Holy! Oh. <laughs> go! You got it! Go! Go! <laughs> Come on, man! Holy bucket! Yes! Uh, victory! <laughs> we need to rush. We got. We, did that just pop in? Boom! All right. Just missed a little bit. <laughs> are, you, are you okay? You are okay yeah. now? You're gonna you're gonna follow me, Gertie. The triple axle that you can't lower the middle. Along and dodge traffic now. Oh boy! Ah! Almost looks perfect. Almost like you know what we're doing. Oh, there they are. They're on the wrong side again. All right, we're gonna go to the drop and Yui. Oh, it's gonna be fast. Yeah, take that girl. Don't take that one right there. Oh, yeah, beef's getting full. Beef's getting full. Okay. They come at you like a spider monkey. <laughs> Tractor. I need the JCB. That thing is the fastest tractor in the game. This is uh, it's it's like a wing now. See, I've got it set up so that it's more like a bat wing off the front. It's gonna give me some downforce. You're, you're and... like a front wheel drive Civic with a rear <laughs> a rear spoiler. Oh, we got cowboy hats on. Oh, Gertie, you're looking good tonight. Oh man. Like it's catapult. Oh, it's just getting catapulted everywhere. I gotta fail on my roof still. I can't get rid of. This thing is a beast. What is going on? So. No. Oh man, what are you doing? Stop with it! <laughs> Just about to talk about how good I was doing. Do I need to give you another 5 million again? Is that what you're saying? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Anyways, um, let's, let's get back to work here. Oh, you need sufficient permissions. I, I banned k Drop. There we go. Nope, I can't. I can't get it in. Yeah, that's gonna beat. I can do that. Oh, 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 there it is! There is a hit point. It's on this side. Just horsing around. Uh, Alright, good luck, Gertie. Do your thing. Go, Gertie, go, Gertie, go! Don't make me F11 you. I will F11 the snot out of you. Boom. <laughs> oh, no. I'm, I'm too high. Let's go. Double dump. Double dump. Oh, there we go. Double dumping it up. You look really tanned right now, man. No. No! Um, are we still doing phrasing? I think so. <laughs> What's this guy doing? <laughs> what is this guy doing? <laughs> is there one coming up right now? <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> and I think that's enough lollygagging, folks. You know what? It's time to get down to business. So make sure you guys got something to drink that you're nice and comfy because you're hanging out with the best driver in Farm Sim. You know what? Now is the time. Let's see the pitter patters down in the chat. We're about to fire it up. Let's do this. Welcome in. It's Wednesday. Middle of the week. Middle of the week. We're back at it tonight. Some Farm Sim at 22. You guys know it, right? Speed shop's open. Get your butts in there. Get get in there, jabronis. Get in there. Oh boy, oh boy. It's a little cold. It's it's a little cold everywhere right now. It's a little, little chilly. It's a little nipply out there. How you guys doing tonight? Hope you guys are doing well. We're back at it. We're in winter in Farm Sim. Year two still. It's gonna be good. I'll show you around a little bit. See if we can make some money. We gotta make some money tonight. I'm still gonna be broke. We're still so broke. Uh, how you guys? What are you guys doing with Farm Sim 22? Are you guys digging it? Are you guys liking it as much as me? I am absolutely digging it still. Oh man, I'd love to see some of the mods come out. We got lots to talk about again tonight with that. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. We'll talk more about that in a little bit. 
But, um, you know what? We better roll into the shop, I think. Get things set up. Make sure K-Bot's behaving himself. Take it easy on him, all right, tonight? We're gonna get him out of the woodwork a bit tonight and see if we can break him just a touch. Let's roll on in. Let's go. Let's go! Yeah, come on. There we go. Oh, yes, yes, yes. We got a little bit of extra special brown. Hey, um, we got new merch. Huh? It's even got the special logo. Uh, not bad. New, new merch. New merch. If you guys are looking for some new merch, just saying, we got new merch. Um, and, and don't forget the Stein as well. This case, Sim special brown Stein. If you're looking for something maybe a little bit different. Mm. You know, when you kick your feet up at night like this, you gotta have the Stein, right? Anyways, come on, grab some brown waters. Um, I see the board. The board's completely changed over from last stream, so members, you guys check out the board. Make sure you guys are on top of it tonight. Good to see you guys in here, by the way. I saw the dude was in here right off the bat. The dude, hey, are you gonna come up and make some drinks right off the bat? I mean, I got the special brown, I'm good. Uh, but I don't know if there's something special for maybe for winter you want to do for, I don't know, like a Christmassy type drink? We gotta start talking about it. Actually, it's Thanksgiving weekend for all of my American friends in here. Oh, I forgot almost. K-Bot! K-Bot, where's the turkey? Where's the turkey? I guess we're gonna have to have real roasted K-Bot. Gives me an idea. Anyways, um, let's bounce in. Let's go, let's go, crew, let's go! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I hope you guys are doing well tonight. Good to see you folks. Uh, thanks for joining me once again. Oh, get the turkey in ya. Get the turkey in ya. Oh man. <laughs> Diesel, that's a good question. It'll be a bit, man. It'll be a bit. Chill. Chill it, chill. I like a weird bang going on here. What's going on with my hair? Let's see if I can fix my ear headphones. Maybe that's the problem. Fix the old headphones up. Oh man. So, who was at MRG stream? He's not streaming anymore. I think he's done, right? I hope he's done. Uh, if you haven't, if you weren't checking out MRG, make sure you guys subscribe to MRG. He was just streaming before this, and he was taking his first look at Giants Editor for Farm Sim 22. He sounded so excited. Um, all the textures that, that the editor has in it. Um, I, it was a really good sign, guys. So if you guys haven't subscribed to MRG, go check him out. Great friend of the channel done some fantastic maps fantastic maps for farms in 19. now he's not planning on bringing those over it sounds like he said he's opened those up for everybody so if you, we have any aspiring modders possibly in the chat tonight make sure you go check out his maps maybe you want to update one of his maps to start with uh give him a shout ask him if it'd be okay if you tried to update it and put it out for farms in 22 but uh he says he's good with that so man i don't know <laughs> Flavor Dave, was he? Ah, oh, man. You know what? MRG is a beauty. He is an absolute beauty. Go subscribe to him for sure. Um, he is an, he's an absolute beauty, that guy. Guy makes me laugh. Oh, did you, just, did you see this? Um, Yeah, we've... If you guys follow me on Twitter, there's a whole... we got a little bit of thing going on. We're just starting some stuff on Twitter. So you can follow me on Twitter, and uh, you can see what's going on there anyways there's more stuff on on this we got coming out tomorrow probably on twitter so uh make sure you follow on twitter as well oh boy it's tur it's a turkey day for you guys on thursday isn't it you're trucking hauling oh no oh, i'm sorry to hear that um it's not technically turkey day for me i've got some american friends that live really close to me actually and we were talking about because i think uh her husband's gone for the week and i'm like well she's an, she's she's living up here in canada now and she's an american we need, i feel like i need to do like a You'd have her over with some friends and have like a little bit of a Canadian American Thanksgiving celebration for her so she doesn't feel so alone. We'll see. We will see. I hope I hope we should do something for her, I think. We better talk with Mrs. Clutch about that. Uh, have you tried updating GPU to see if it fixes? Are you talking to me? Who are you talking to here? I have no idea what we're talking about now. Um, what's going on, Cole? How are you, buddy? Do we need to do some shit? Oh, wait, hang on a sec. Okay. I thought MRG jumped in for a second. I was going to give him a shot. 
Uh, turkey day for you tomorrow. Yeah, there we go. But you'll be, sorry, smoking a ham instead? You know what? I personally prefer turkey, but I'm not going to judge you on your decision. As long as you get something good in you. Uh, drivers are updated. Nice. Cypher, are you, are you having some problems with farm sim? I know some people are. I personally am not having, like, any problems at all. Mm, 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 mm. Nate, what's going on, man? How are you? Uh, let's get some shouty outies quickly in here. Maudi Matt, what's going on, man? Diesel's in here, of course. Uh, IH Power, hey, buddy. Turn on. Oh, you're gonna get the beacon, don't you worry. Cypher's in here. Good to see you. Memes and music. Good to see you, man. Welcome back in here. Uh, is that Justin? I, I can't see that. I can't, I can't see it. Jack, Jackwin? I think it's Jackwin. Sorry, the name is really small on my screen. I don't recognize it, but welcome in. Uh, Samuel, how you doing, man? Good to see you. Trevor, how are you, dude? Good to see you, Trevor. <laughs> Uh, Dirk's in here, of course. Hey, Lone Wolf. Um, wifey, the Wifey and I are here. Hey, Lone Wolf. Good to see you, man. Um, working on the merch still for Wifey. I know, I know. We got, we got we, I, you saw this, right? We got the, we got the phrasing bomb shirt, but we got some more stuff coming. Don't you worry. We got the K-Bot stuff. <laughs> he said he wanted his own merch. I don't know. Uh, good to see you. Frost is welcome. First stream. Cheers, man. James, how are you, dude? Good to see you, man. Uh, you've been having trouble, Zach. Oh, crap. That sucks. I'm sorry to hear about when are mods going to PS4? I uh, haven't heard anything yet. It usually takes a bit, guys. You gotta, you gotta ease into this. It's gonna take a week or two before we're gonna start getting some stream of mods. Just be aware of that. It's gonna take a little bit. It's not gonna be all of a sudden, blammo, you're gonna have every single mod from 22 thrown in tonight, or 19 into 22. You gotta, you gotta ease it in. Just, just tap it in. Just give it a little tappy tap tap, right? Uh, I'm new, Rob. Rob, I'm new. Can I get a shout out? I'm not so much disappointed as kind of expecting that now, Rob. I don't know. Brian, what's going on, man? How are you? Nicholas, good to see you, dude. Uh, the, the versatile make Yes, versatile is in here. Versatile is in here for sure. Uh, I'm really hoping that we get some more. We only get the one so far, but I'm really hoping for more. I'm really... Brian with a second super chat already. Brian with second dono. Cheers to you, Brian. Is that a, is that a fox eating something? I can't see on that. It's so small. What is he doing in there? Brian, what the heck is he doing? Oh, <laughs> thanks, Gertie. Oh, I can't even hear Gertie. I got the music cranked up too, too, too loud. There we go. Got it cranked up so loud. Uh, Rob, but you need... I, I did read it. Here we go. See, Rob, I did read it. I, I totally... You know what? There might be a reason why I ignored Rob for so long. I'm starting to see more of a pattern now. You guys see a pattern? I don't know. I think I'm starting to see a little bit of a pattern. I've used the mother bins. I have not used the mother bins yet. Has anybody in chat used the mother bins yet? I have not had a chance to use them. Um, I haven't got my farm anywhere close. To be perfectly honest, I don't think Elm Creek is big enough to justify using them. Hey, what's going on? Uh, what's going on, dude? How are you? Good for Saskatoon. Love it. Love the fellow Canadians always jumping in the chat. Good to see you, man. Uh, JT, did you... Uh, I, I always ignore you, JT. Come on, man. Uh, we'll show off this beacon light. I got something interesting to show you about this beacon light, actually. So... For those who have the special edition, not much, okay. If you have the special edition uh, and have the beacon, uh, there's an interesting little thing I didn't know about until I just fired this up today. You know what? Let, let me go show you guys. Let me go. Omar, cheers, hey buddy. What's going on, Omar? Hope you're doing well, my friend. Uh, let me show you guys what I'm talking about. This is kind of cool because I didn't know it did this. Oh, this is a good sign. K-Bot, fix this, please. Like, now. Come on, K-Bot, fix it. You know what? There it goes. There we go. Thank you. All right. You know what? You just got to tell K-Bot to fix it, and it magically pops in. Um, okay, so you guys want to see the beacon. You guys want to see the beacon. Beacon's right here. So, it works on all tractors, of course, or anything with a beacon. Actually, let's go back to another screen. You get a little bit better shot. It's a little bit bigger right now. Let's fire it up. Let's see here. So this is in the 9M. No, 6M, sorry. Ooh, 6M. Uh, there. Cyper underscore super chatted $4.99. Cyper, cheers. Help. Help. What, what am I helping Cyper for? What is Cyper? Cyper, are you still having problems getting into farm sim? I hope you're all right, bud. Hey, Newell. The wooden tractor, it had a wooden engine, wooden wheels, and it wouldn't even work. Thank you. I'll be here all night. Uh, I think Newell's trying to fight for K-Bot's job. Okay. 
<laughs> yeah, 9M, exactly. We have a new 9M. You guys haven't heard of the new the new fantastic John Deere 9M? It's a 6M. <laughs> oh, man, I'm dying. I got a frog in my throat. Okay, that's the beacon right there in one mode. So this is on... This is inside the 6M. This is in most of the tractors. Now, I'm going to bounce out of this thing. You know what? We'll leave the light show going on inside the tractor. It turns off as soon as you get off, out of it. Let me jump into the 8RT. And it's got those little hockey puck beacons that we looked at last last stream. Newell, did them. <laughs> um, thanks, Newell. It's got the little hockey puck beacons. Now watch this. Do you guys remember what it looked like beforehand? Let's turn it on this time. It does like a, a strobe effect now. Because that's what... You can barely see the beacons on this little thing. But they're different. They're like the little LED flashy beacons. And this thing actually flashes differently. I didn't know it did that. That is so cool. It caught me off guard. Because I wasn't driving this at all. The first time I fired it up, I was like, Oh, I'm always in the 6M. Um, and it does the, the whirly bird. I was like, oh yeah, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. And then I had the lights off in the studio. And I jumped into the 8RT and it started doing this flashing thing. It was like lighting up my whole room. I was getting all blinded by it. I'm like, what is going on? Why is it so different now? And I thought I could program it, but then I realized that the the uh, the things are different on this tractor. So that is the big difference, the, the beacons. Um, it's funny. You can't see the beacons on this tractor at all. I don't know if you can. I can't even show them. My screen's in the wrong way. But anyways, uh, they're tiny. They're just they're just itty bitty. This beacon is brighter than those beacons on there by a long shot. I'm just saying. Just saying. Anyways, um, very cool little 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 knick knack, little little paddy whack, little give a clutch a bone. Uh, I really do like this thing. It's kind of fun. So I think um, I've actually got another one coming. I'm gonna have two of them. Now, ideally, if I was not a streamer, I would have these up on my monitors up ahead of me. Like, I'd have them on, because I've got some monitors, obviously, up right in front of me here. I would have them kind of sitting up on top, I think, on each side of my monitor, because I'm going to have two of them. I think that's where I would put them if I was not a streamer. But I kind of want them to be interactive with chat. I want them to be, like, I want to be able to put these on and you guys be able to see when they're on. Um... We might put them... I don't know yet what we're going to do. I'm, I've got some ideas of some other, some other stuff. We can... Yeah, but whatever. We'll see. But uh, we'll put the beacons on throughout the night tonight. And you guys can see it running. I hope it's not too, too irritating. Like, this is actually... This is the worst mode right now, I find, for irritation. Because it's always kind of blinky, blinky, blinks. But if we go over to... This one here. It's not quite as bad. Like, it's there. It's just doing the whirly bird, right? Anyways. I think it's cool. I think it's cool. So... Let me know. Do you guys find that? Do you find this annoying? Like, does this bother you? This little flash that's going on on screen right now? Um, okay, so like I said, this is not the worst one. This, the eight, uh, R, the eight RT is way worse for for annoyance, I think. But if this is if this is crazy, let me know. I don't think it's bad though. Like, I think it's more annoying for me. It's giving me seizures. <laughs> see, look at this. Though you can't even see. Like, okay, actually, if I turn the other one off, hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. Hang on a second. Uh, let's turn this off. The eight, this one's like you can't even barely see it flashing Thanks in the in the studio or in the, the building. The money signs. The money signs? Which money signs? Like the the uh what should we call it? The um collectibles? Is that what you're talking about, Ghost? I don't know if that's what you want. Is if you wanted seizure alert. Is it that bad? I find it's worse for me. Because I have, like, right in my eye field. <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about exactly. The money signs. There's the government subsidies. Um. Oh, you want government subsidies? Well, you got to download the mod. And I... Oh, the government subsidies. Uh, but you know what? I don't even have it on this profile. I do not have it installed. Uh, but it should be... Let me see here. It should be in your other in... Isn't it on this, on this side? An other? In miscellaneous? Oh, no, I can't remember now. Is it placeable? It's a placeable item, isn't it? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Fluff's in here. It's a placeable item, isn't it? You know what? Let's take a look at it. I've never even downloaded it. Let me, I'm going to download it right now. Because I haven't even looked at it. I'm curious where it's at. I haven't downloaded it on this profile on uh, in, in 22. Because I'm like, uh... Where is it? Quit. Quit, 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 quit game. Actually, I don't think I have it loaded into this. That's what it is. I've downloaded it on a server... But I haven't used it. Yeah, the clutch dance party, GJ Fox. 
let's see. Oh, that's nice. Just it threw me right out of farm sim. Oh, let me turn this down because I know I think that music's copyright. All right. Is it in generators? Okay. Let's take a look. I'll, I'll just enable it on the save. It's not enabled on that save, though. Career. Hey, I said launch. And government subsidies. Okay, go. All right, K-Bot, come on. There we go. Thank you. Um, so let's go take a look. Let's just see. It should be just a placeable item. There we go. Jake's on it. Thanks, Jake. Lots of guys in chat are on it. You guys are awesome. So yeah, in, in, 20, in 19, it was a placeable under miscellaneous in their placeable section, from what I remember. Um, I hadn't, I haven't used that for like three years though, to be honest. As soon as, uh, as soon as I got decent with working with the editor or in the back end in the XML files, I was like, oh yeah, that's way better to use that. Holy shnikes, this is taking forever. Why is this taking so long? Come on, K-Bot, let's go. Mm -mm -mm. And YouTube's even giving me warnings like, yeah, we're not receiving enough data from you, Clutch. Why aren't we not getting data? I'm loading the game, YouTube, relax. Uh, L's looking for a shout out. L, let's go to L. I am, <laughs> Fluff, you want me to hear, you want to hear my joke? Yeah, I got to tell Fluff's joke. Hang on, we got we to gotta do this. I told you the joke. We, we said the joke. Have you, seen, have you seen the movie Tractor? No, but I've seen the trailer. Come on, Fluff. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if we need to do a vote on which one was worse, Newell's or Fluff's joke. I, I don't know if we need to check there. I don't know which one we have to check. All right, let's take a look. Uh, placeable items. Construction. Uh, da, 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 da. What's it under? Is it productions? Generators? And then there we go. Government subsidy signs. There you go. There's your two. So productions, generators, like Jake said. Then you got your two of those. You just pick which one you want. 350,000 an hour or 350 an hour. That's a lot of cash. 350,000 an hour. Um, and then, yeah, you can just slap that thing down. Wherever it is you decide. Let's see here if I can put this someplace. We'll put it so it's like outside my farm. Like so. Oh, I can't. Really? I can't place it out here? When can I place it? Oh, I have to go like right here. <laughs> Let's go take a look. 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 Um, There it is. Let's see. There you go. There's your government subsidy. So I'm getting 350,000 bucks at every uh, start of every hour. So, and then to get rid of that thing, let's delete that. Cause I, I don't want to use that. But for those that wanted it, that's how you do it. Click your demolish. Uh, yes. Boom. Gonzo's done. There you go. That's it. That's it. That's it. All right. I'm going to put my time back up. I had it down to, I've been, I've been playing at, for those that are wondering what I've been doing. So this playthrough, we're technically on year three now. We're in year three of this playthrough already. Um, I'm not doing bad, but I'm still hurting. Like we still have quite a bit of like 300 and some thousand dollars we owe. We're in debt still. I still have some stuff to sell at the top. Uh, we might do that to begin with. Why am I getting errors tonight? Doesn't make sense. We've got 15,000, 16,000 uh, soybeans in there. We've got nothing in there yet. But speaking of which, I, I do want to try to make a little bit more money. So um, there's something I do need to do. We need to go up top. Um, so we bought the mill last time, kind of to test things out. And I've kept it, as you guys know. So that cost me 100 grand uh, to keep the mill, the, the grain mill. And we've been taking all of our stuff to that grain mill the last day or so. And... Uh, it's selling season right now. February is selling season. Unfortunately, I'm kind of getting sewered on the grain mill. I don't know if you guys have messed with the grain mill at all, but I've, I thought it was going to be better than it is. Let's see here. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So we go take a look at our sell prices. So we had a bunch of wheat, for example. I've sold most of all the wheat and the wheat and barley. I think I took up there and sort of know with sorghum. Anyways, so we, the prices have dropped a little bit, but they were like eight, 800 bucks at one point in time recently. And same with, what is it, the sorghum? Sorghum is up at $1,000 almost, 900 bucks right now to grow Goldcrest Valley. That's pretty good. So I was expecting flour to be like quite a bit more than that. I'm only getting like 1,200 bucks if I bring the flour down. 
it's not great. It's not like I'm making 300 bucks per thousand more, but I had to spend $100,000 to do that. So, uh, so soybeans, uh, so I've got 15,000 uh, liters of soy or 16,000 liters of soybeans ready to sell. So soybeans sell for a good price right now. They're not bad, but I'm waiting for July. So July is when they peak out. Um, so I'm waiting for that price. So I've been watching them. So I think you really got to be, you got to pay attention to your prices in this guys, because it seems like even the flower, there was the, where is it? Flower, flower, flower. Where's my flower at? Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Um, there we go. So it was telling me January, February, this is this pretty much the exact same chart that barley and wheat go by for sell prices. Um, I was kind of surprised that the prices were the same, like wheat and like, well, barley is almost a thousand bucks. There you go. See, look at, they didn't even change it all. It's the exact same thing. Cause obviously the, well, they're made from each other, obviously there, but, uh, I was just, I thought it'd be a lot more. I had higher expectations on how I was going to get a lot more money out of it than I did to be perfectly honest, guys. Um, I feel like I kind of got sewered a bit on that one. Hang on a second here. Hang on a sec. Uh, how much flour do you get? Per so I'll show you. Uh, I'll, we, you can calculate all that stuff. I just need to fix one thing because for some reason, Logitech, I turned you on. Where's my wheel? I still can't get force feedback to work. Is anyone else having problems with force feedback? Force feedback. It's still not doing it. What do you? Why? 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 Thank you. There we go. There we go. Force feedback is still not working for me. I'm having all sorts of grief with that. For some reason, I can't get that to work for the life of me. Hey, 82's in this house. What's going on, 82? How is the modding going, brother? Uh, I'm extremely anxious to see what you got going on. All right, guys. I'm getting warnings right now on YouTube saying I'm not sending enough signal. I'm sending like 8,000. Let me know if you guys are having some problems. If you guys are getting buffering or anything, please let me know. Or if I look all cranky danky and not looking good please let me know 82 good to see you buddy uh, i hope you're doing well clickbait master he called me the clickbait master oh wait we gotta put the beacon on beacons on beacons up awesomeness awaits i am totally waiting for the awesomeness <laughs> jacob's blurry he says <laughs> streams lag and looks good for you i wonder why it's it's giving me grief tonight i wonder what i broke I wonder what the heck I broke. Yeah, it looks good for most people. Good. What do you guys think of the winter in farm sim? Um, I haven't, like I've only, I'm playing with one day months. One day months. I'm, I have to get used to saying that. I used to say one day seasons. One day months. And a little blurry. Okay. But try and bump it up. See if you can bump it up to 1080. I don't know why it's doing it tonight. It should be, oh, whoa. Uh, it should be giving me fresh like i'm not having any any kind of buffering on my end so it looks weird the frost glitches out i haven't i've been through the, through it a bit um oh there i got some buffering there um it seems like it always it's always disappeared for me but i've heard some people having some issues with frost cheers cheers newell yeah i heard some people on the discord were saying uh they're having some issues dealing with frost for someone Make sure you guys say, yeah, yeah, there we go. Say hi to 82 for me, guys. Come on, everyone. Give 82. Give 82 some love. Good to see you, buddy. I had to restart the stream. Okay. So I had some issues right at the start. I think we fixed those, but YouTube's still telling me I've got errors, so I don't know what's going on. Uh, yeah, I had to put it to 1080. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Gotta love the YouTube sometime. Make sure you guys set it to 1080. Take it off auto. Put it to 1080. All right, so here we go. Here is all of our flour. Uh, let's leave this thing right about there. Unfortunately, I don't have a trailer. I could buy one. I just <clears throat> so oh crap! I didn't I didn't open the tarp. Come on, clutch tarps off. Tarps off. I'm using automatic tonight, <laughs> just for for the time being. Uh, let's see. Launch that. Tarps open. Let's turn off the beacon because I don't need to listen. Look at that the whole time. Got it. There we go. All right. Good. Ce Cecil's not having any problems. Oh, I'm going to crash into my own trailer there. Let's look at... I know some of you were asking how much flour do you get? How much flour do you get? So, you can tell that if you go down to your production menu down here. Click on this. Uh, unfortunately, my fat noggin is right in the way of the different ones. So, the top one is... 
uh, wheat, barley, oat, and sorghum. So then it tells you exactly. So right now we're selected on the wheat. As you can see, it's highlighted behind me there. Uh, for every 150 wheat, you're going to get 120 flour. And then it tells you what, what like how many times it's going to do that per hour and what the cost per hour is. So that's not bad. Uh, right now we're working with sorghum. And sorghum is actually a little bit better. For every 150, I still have uh, yeah 10,000 sorghum ready to go. Actually, I got both of these. So I got wheat and flour. They're both producing right now at the uh, at the mill. So it's storing it. We've got 4,435 liters that is currently stored. And uh, that's the production rate, as you can see. So it's storing it. Now I can go down here and I can change the output to selling so it sells it. But I lose some of the transportation costs. So I'm trying to transport as much as I can. Uh, but I don't have a great way to transport. I've got that trailer. That is all I've got right now to transport it with. I can fit... I, I don't know if I can fit six. I can fit four for sure. Four pallets for sure. But I haven't tried fitting six. I'm going to see if I can get fit six in here tonight. How is global companies working? <laughs> uh, you're not wrong. So we'll see if we can fit six in there. I don't know if it's going to work or not. You got to be pretty much perfect, I think, to get the pallets. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, Clutch is trying to pick up the ground. Clutch is trying to pick up the ground. Let's see if we can fit six. No, 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 no. Gotta be perfect. Gotta be perfect. Jam this one into this one. Pick these both up. There we go. And watch. They're going to repopulate right away here, I think. It should at least. I bet you it should. There they go. So that right now it's just storing. It's doing nothing but storing these things for us. Um, that, so you're going to see every time we take some pallets away from there, they should auto populate again with whatever we have for storage. Let's see if I can fit these in the back of this trailer. Like I said, I do want to buy a flat deck trailer, but I haven't, I'm trying to wait for one to go on sale. That's kind of what I'm doing right now. Um, I don't want to spend full price and I don't have a truck yet either. So I'm trying to wait and I owe $300,000. So yeah, um, there is that. So this is the cheaper way of doing things. Go figure, right? Clutch doing something the cheap way. Go figure. All right, let's see if we can drop this in. Nice and easy like. Right about there. Back it up. Oh, no, we missed. We missed. We missed. You're perfect. It should just like land flat in there. Oh, it's hitting. It's not hitting the side yet. A little bit lower. A little lower. A little lower. Come on. It's, it's like warping through the side. There we go. All right, that I can. Uh, can I work with that? I don't know if I can work with that. Let's see if I can like just push it. Just give it a shove. Um, I really don't like what this is, what's going on in the trailer here. Oh, I forgot I could connect this in the front. Um, that's gonna be a problem, isn't it? Yeah, because it's gonna bung up the rest of them. Ah, oh, darn it. Okay. Uh, what can I do for a solution? Oh, I know what I can do. I know what I can do. Let's raise this up. Raise this up. Connect this. Connect to the front. Yeah, yeah, there we go. And see if I can just like, I just ram it maybe. Right? If I just kind of, yeah, see? I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I had a plan. I had a plan and it's uh, it's worked out flawlessly. Okay, let's get another one in there. You guys doubted me, see? You guys doubted me. Come on. <laughs> All right, let's go. So I'll show you how, the nice thing about these, they auto unload. Um, you don't need to worry about picking them up out of it. Uh, that's what I thought as well. The first time I did, I'm like, I hope this works. And it does. Come on. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Jam it into the building. I don't like the way that's sitting, but yeah, maybe we'll be okay. I want to get six in here this time. I only got four in last time. I want to get six. I want to get six. Come on, baby. Get her in there. We got to be nice and tight, though. We gotta be nice and tight in this little tiny trailer. It's all about precision here. There's actually quite a bit of room. I think we'll be okay, even if we're not perfect. Like it looks like there's enough room in this for another another two easily, right? Drop that. Edge this in. Drop her down right up against the edge. Okay. Back up. Oh boy, that, do we ever get lucky there? 
<laughs> I think we got a little lucky. I think we got a little lucky. Oh, yeah, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, there's lots of room now. We got this. We got this. All right, let's drop this in. We got this. Oh, man. Where's Buck? No, no clue. Haven't chatted with him today. Oh, inch, 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 in. All right. Oh, come on. Give me that one. Give me this one, too. I want them both. Really? I did them both before. Am I not straight enough? Is that what my problem is there? I think I'm not straight. I have to be like dead on. Otherwise, the tips, the tip just doesn't reach in far enough. Oh, that's a problem. Um, that's okay. That's okay. We can, we, we still can work with this. We can work with this. We can work with this, right? Come on. No. I'm going to have a whole bunch sitting right here. No. Okay. You stay there. Don't, don't spawn anymore. Don't spawn anymore. Don't spawn anymore, please. Oh, I screwed that one up. I screwed this one up completely. Let's just try to get, like, perfectly lined up. If we go perfectly straight in, it should work, right? Because you've got to have two of them. Otherwise, you're never going to get it set. Okay, there's one. There's two. There we go. Okay, we got them both. We got them both. We got them both. We got them both. <laughs> Larry, are you not used to this by now, Larry? This is what we do here. We try to... I've got to make things work because I'm I'm cheap and I'm broke, which is not a good sign. Um, there we go. One. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Get in there now. Just land in there. Just fall in. Just fall in. Nice. Okay, good, good, good. All right. We're good, crew. We're good. We are totally good now. Yeah, perfect. See? Um... I got this now. All right, let's go take this back down. I think the bakery is the best. No, was the bakery or the uh, fast food place was the best price. Let's go sell these off. Uh, just tarp that. No one needs to know what's in there. No one needs to know what's going on inside. Don't need to look in there. All right, beacons on. You no, know we forgot. The, we forgot about the hazards on too. I almost forgot the hazards. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. All right. Anything coming? Nothing coming. Perfect. All right. Down the hill. We'll double check prices when we get down there. But okay. So I've got, like I said, there's like 4,000 some odd liters, something like that up there still. I could just sell it from there, but I don't really know yet how much you lose by shipping it, by not shipping it yourself. Uh, it kind of, it just hurts me to know that I'm losing money. And there's no way to see that. That's one thing. Like, you don't get to see the money you lose in anything I've been able to... Oh, maybe it's in the... I wonder if it's in the ledger. No, it wouldn't be there. It wouldn't be in there, I don't think. Oh, I could have put one of the forks. Good call. Ah, oh, I'm such a dummy. You're not wrong. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. What? Why wouldn't I... Why would I do that? I've got forks sitting right in front of the tractor. I'm not actually using them. Like, what is my problem? I'm just driving around aimlessly. I got nothing on my forks. Uh, like, really, really, come on, man. <laughs> Kyle, you like the look of the winter? Yeah, it's not bad, actually. Like the, I love this valley right here. So if you go up further up this hill, if you guys have been up this way, um, the way the roads like twist and turn up here, it looks really good. Especially if you come up here like early in the morning, everything's like nice and foggy. And this whole valley looks so cool. It looks great up in here. I kind of do want to run a farm up on that side and take these hillside fields at some point. I might be doing that in one of, the, one, one of our videos at some point in time or one of our playthroughs. All right. Let's see if I can take these ones right here. Let's see if I can take these. We'll take two. See, oh, can I get two the whole way? I might be pushing the limits a little bit here, chat, but uh, I wouldn't be me if I didn't do this, right? We didn't push the limits completely. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we're good. We're good. Flip it around. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. We got some flour. We got some flour. Hey, Matsy, what's going on, dude? It's not that much. We, we've been making, we've been working on the flour. I didn't mean to, well, I did mean to buy the mill. I wasn't planning on buying the mill as early as I did, so... I'm broke because of that. So I'm trying to use this as much as I can, right? 
as, tr as much as I can, I want to use that mill. Unfortunately, like I said, I don't have a truck yet, so I'm stuck with this. <laughs> uh, uh, traffic is on. Traffic is on. Um, don't, just a, a, oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. How did that come off? No, no, no. Get back on. Get back on. Ah, don't hit me. Come on. You can get, get back on. No. No. I'm going to lose a thing of flour. Look at you can see the forks like sticking through there. Uh oh, no. Uh, I want to take that one. I want to take this one. Okay, good, good. Okay, that's that's something. It's on there for now. It's on there. Oh, no, no traffic, please. No traffic. No, no traffic, please. Do these forks go back further than that? Oh, there's traffic. No, no, no. <laughs> All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Um, I wonder if actually, hang on a sec. I got a better idea. I got a better idea for these two. I got a. I, I got. A, I've, I've been thinking. I've been thinking. And what if instead I did this way? We stick one fork into one. Get a better angle of this, so I can see what I'm looking at here. Uh, we stick one into this one. Right? Are you guys, you guys picking up what I'm throwing down here? Are you guys picking it up? I mean, well, I'm, I'm picking it up, but are you picking it up? Are you guys? Um. Um. No, no. Just, just pick it up. Just. Oh, you're not picking it up. You're not picking it up. Oh, come on. You know you want to do this. <laughs> I haven't messed with this this kind of messing with the pallets before. Uh, let's just see if I can get this to work. Does this work in Farm Sim? I mean, this kind of worked in, in 19. Why does it not work in 22, right? Right? Uh, I'm not getting into the right spot. I'm not... I can't get it into the right little holy hole there. Um, are, are we still doing phrasing in here? Just wondering. What if I go in this way here? Okay. There we go. And then if I tilt this... No, 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 no. Grab it, clutch. Why is it not grabbing it? Why is it not grabbing it? It doesn't want to grab that one at all. Okay, I got the one. I think. I, th I think. Why does it say zero on there, though? That's kind of strange. Anyways. Okay, I got that one. Let's see if I can grab the other one now. Just, just, just grab it. I don't think you can widen these forks, can you? I don't think I can widen them. Uh, let's see. Can I widen these forks? I don't think I can... Oh, I can. I didn't know I could widen these ones. I thought it was just the fork left. Thanks. Thanks, 82. 82, you're awesome. Okay, let's try this again. I can grab just both of them now. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And then tilt it back. Now we're smoking. Yes. All right. There we go. 82 is awesome. I didn't know you could do it with these ones. I thought it was just the uh, the forklift and uh, the telehandler ones. I didn't think the front end loaders would widen. 82 knows what's up, though. Oh, be easy, easy, easy. We're good. We're good. You know what? Doing this, I could actually carry two more up front, probably. I wonder if I'd have the traction still in the back to do that, though. Like, I, oh, oh, don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Uh, I, I wonder I wonder if I could still get traction on those back tires if I did, like, another two more on the front. Yeah. No, geez, don't fall off. <laughs> Do you guys hear the noise when you, like, hit stuff in this, too? Like, when you hit bumps and stuff, you get, like, a rattling noise now. Very cool. Uh, I do need to get a trailer. I can't... I don't want to spend money on a trailer yet. Like I said, I'm waiting for for them to go on sale. For now, at least. Unless I get some decent cash. But I'm not going to lie, guys. I'm finding money's a little hard to come by right now. Like, we're on year... Starting at year three right now. We are still in the hole. Like, well, 60000 minus 320 or something. So, roughly $250,000 we are in the hole right now. We got some product to sell. We're going to plant tonight. Uh, we're going to be planting some beans in a bit. But as soon as we get out of the winter, I'm going to sell off this stuff. And then we're going to set it to auto sell. Just to see if there's a, any, if we can tell any kind of a difference. It's going to be tough to sell. Or tough to tell. Tough to sell. Tough to tell. Uh, let me double check our prices here quickly. Uh, flower, 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 flower. Let's go. Boom. Flower is the best price is going to be at... The bakery. Okay, bakery's got the best price. 
Um, but but why? Why did you fall off there? Why? <laughs> why did you just fall off? What's your problem, man? Like we were. I thought we were good. I thought we were all good. What happened? I th I thought we were happy. Oh, I'm so lucky that car didn't hit that flower. Why did you fall off? I don't understand. I do not understand why you decided to just fall off there. <laughs> when I was sitting there looking at the menu, I come back in and my flowers off the forks. There we go. Um, that was weird. That was kind of weird. <laughs> hey, Glenn, what's going on, man? Good to see you, dude. All right, let's keep on rolling. There's the farm. Still no animals in the farm. We're a long ways from animals, I bet. I, I don't think we're going to be... Uh, we're going to be seeing animals for any time soon. Unfortunately, as much as I'd love to, um, I just don't know how we're ever going to make that work right now. Ah, I'm not cheating money in. I I can cheat money on the XML too. But I'm, I want to I want to enjoy this. I mean, we're going to have enough crazy and nutty stuff go on in the next two or three years, guys. I'm really trying to enjoy what I can right now, the actual playthrough, and really get a feel for, for what's best. Because I also want to know what I can do for tutorial stuff for you guys on how to do things. So the more I figure out, uh, the better my videos can be for you guys later on too. Oh boy. All right. So let's open that cover up. There goes the front. Nice. Some good cash right up there. Uh oh, uh, that was what? 2000, how much was that? It was only two grand. Is that it? Okay. And the rest of it in the back just automatically pops out as well, which is kind of nice. Um, so for instance, if you don't own this pro this property, you just sell, it's a sell point. That's all it is. So you can use that still as a sell point. I think even a multiplayer, it still just works as a sell point. There we go. Another seven grand. So we got 10 grand just off of this. That ain't bad. Uh, but if you own the property, then, uh, you get, you get product at the back. That all gets built into something then instead of being sold right there, if you own it. Now that being said, I have not tried it exactly in multiplayer yet, but I'm assuming that's how it works. All right, let's bring this back. Is Simulation in the house? Hey, buddy, what's going on, Simulation? Uh, <laughs> good to see you, dude. <laughs> I hope you're doing well, man. I had, I was, uh, I, I lurked in your stream for a couple minutes uh, this morning. I didn't have a chance to really sit down and talk there. I was working away, so uh, I hope you're doing well. How you, how you liking Farm Sim? How are you liking Farm Sim 22, man? Hope things are going well for you. All right. We're going to set this to auto sell now. Whoa, wait. I guess I am down the middle of the road. I guess I am technically down the, the middle of the road. All right, in we go. Let's just, uh, we'll just park this here. We're going to advance time, but first we're going to set that to auto sell and see. Okay, so we got 10 grand for six, which makes, yeah, that makes sense, right? It's like a little 1200 bucks per thousand or something like that is what the price is. Uh, we'll turn this off, turn this off there. And, oh, wait, wait, I got a sec. I think I still got the hazards on. Turn those off too. There we go. That's better. All right. So let's go into our menu. Let's just set that to auto sell. Like I said, we could have gone. I could go back up and make more money on it. I kind of want to judge how much um, how much we actually get from selling versus not. So uh, we would have had what we roughly. Oh, we only have, storing only 500 liters right now. Oh, because we moved everything off. Well, that sucks. What are you going to do? Um, I'm just going to start. I'm just going to start selling for the day. So we can go, we can put that to sell. Ah, it's not going to sell anything right now. We've sold pretty much everything that's in there. Kind of sucks. Kind of sucks. I've only got 500 liters. Like, what did I do here? Hang on a second. Let me just double check this. Let's just go up top and take a look. Uh, right here, right? No, right here. Visit. Why am I only getting 500? Did I hit? I, I hit these ones, but I, I didn't, I didn't hit these. These should be still sellable. Why can't I sell these? Why can't I sell these ones? So I still have 6,000. I was hoping to sell all of these ones, guys. I knew these ones here wouldn't sell because I moved them off the markers, but I thought I could still sell these ones. Craptacular. Um, so much for that. So I can't sell those. I'm just going to sell whatever I can when it comes in for the day because that doesn't matter. You know what? It's not going to matter now. The best prices are going to stop. And we're gonna we're gonna move on. So whatever. Okay, let's uh, 
Let's start storing then for now. We'll store the rest of this. Crap. Oh, well. Oh, well. I don't want to wait. I don't have time for that. We ain't got time for that. Uh, oh, speaking of which, speaking of what we don't have time for, we don't got time to uh, pay. We don't have time to pay interest on our loans. There we go. We're down to 250000 Could be worse. Could be better. All right. Let's go 8 o'clock tomorrow. I don't know, yesterday it doesn't sell once it's spawned. What doesn't sell? Uh, I have to sell them manually. I did. I thought the stuff. Some of the. If you, as long as you don't touch them, I thought you could sell them still. That sucks. Oh well. Um, it is what it is. Okay. Uh, I think today. No, it's uh, never mind. Today's not the day. Today's the day to plant. Not today to sell. So, no. Tomorrow's the day to plant. Okay. But let's take a look at prices while we're talking about this. Prices for flour now. What's the price of flour? So prices are dropping. Yeah, prices are starting to drop, and they're going to drop pretty heavily. Yeah, after this, they're just going to they're just going to tank out. Unfortunately, uh, what I'm waiting for, of course, we still have soybeans in the in there. Um, soybeans are going to max out in July. Our current prices are decent at fifteen hundred bucks, fourteen fourteen hundred bucks. So hopefully, what are we in March right now? So we're like right here. So I'm hoping that this is over twenty like twenty two hundred bucks is what I'm hoping for. So I can get like $30,000 at least for those soybeans. That would be all right. That would help out. Uh, but for today, like I said, let's see here. Nothing today. Let's let's advance one more day. Let's advance one more day. I do have seasons on. Yep. Seasons is on fully right now. We have no seasons turned off. We're on pretty much base game settings. So if you launch in here, this is the settings that I'm playing with or what you're going to have. With one exception, I have weeds turned off because weeds freaking suck. <laughs> silage is worth doing too you say speedy i haven't done any silage and i've done silage for for feeding cattle and that's it so far how did i get a 1200 bucks hmm. anyways uh all right so that's good what how's our other stuff doing all right so this is still Ooh, it's still selling Ooh, i don't want it selling store 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 start storing start storing uh store 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 i was wondering how i didn't lose money it was because of this um speaking of which what's our, our strawberries and stuff at so our lettuce okay so our prices are dropping pretty heavily on this i'm gonna start storing everything that's in the greenhouse as well uh greenhouse has actually been paid off so you guys saw the, the title of, of the stream tonight the 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 uh greenhouse is pretty much paid for itself easily now guys so i made roughly about fourteen thousand dollars off the greenhouse last year so this greenhouse, I think greenhouses are actually pretty good. I think it's a good way to go. I think this is something you could probably use for like getting started at least. Um, like, yeah, you make some decent money off this stuff for not doing much. Like just filling it with water costs you about 1400 bucks to fill it with water. And then you're going to be making enough profit to pay for things. But like it's covering my loan. Uh, if I just let it sell the whole time, it would pay for my, my interest on my loan, which is like 1200 bucks a day, right? So that ain't bad at all. Plus a little bit actually on top of that. So anyways, uh, I'm, I'm happy with that. Really quite happy with that. Larry. Oh, buddy. Cheers to you, Larry. All right. Uh, can we watch the night when I was using the Colossus front loader? I went to get out and froze your game. So you couldn't do anything and you had to quit and come back into the game before. I have not ran into that issue at all. Larry, I have not had any. I haven't had a single crash in game. Like, yeah, jumping in and out of equipment. I've done a lot of this kind of stuff, just trying to freak it out. Nothing like that has had... Uh, I haven't had any problems with my game at all. So I don't know what to tell you on that one, brother. I wish I did. I wish I did. But I got I got no information. Uh, but Larry's buying you guys around, so let's go. First round of the night. First round's on Larry. Let's go. Larry! Cheers to you, buddy. Larry's buying around. He's breaking farm sim, but he's still buying around, so... Get up here, get get it in ya. Larry, cheers to you, man. Appreciate ya. Come on, folks. Larry's buying you guys around. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? Let's do some timeout, too. Let's, oh, see, look at this here. We're not doing the front lifter bag. Get out of here. <laughs> uh, we're not doing those. Those are bad. Those are bad. Let me get rid of that. That's my, my wheel settings. Yeah, that front lifter bag is breaking stuff. Do not use the front lifter bag. That's all I've been, I can tell you. I heard that's breaking stuff right now. I can tell you that much right now. That front lifter bag sucks. Um, 
Yeah, if it's breaking stuff, just be careful with that. Why is this thing still up? Get off my screen. Get off my screen. <laughs> I'm not breaking my game. Nope. Get out of here, trucker. Uh, it was just that piece of equipment. None of the others. Weird, Larry. Um, to be fair, I don't usually use too much cloth stuff, so could be part of that. Yeah, the front lifter. Uh, something about if you like open the bag and start unloading that lifter bag and then get out of your tractor, it locks your game up. I heard something about that. Um, I haven't played with it at all. I don't usually use the bags like that. So anyways, just careful with that. All right, let's play. Uh, let's play some timeout. Take it easy on the bot, guys. If you haven't met K-Bot before, just take it easy. He's a bit of a jerk. Eh, just take it easy on him, guys. Seriously. What was this about a turkey? I, I, want, I, I, got, I still got the freaking nuggies, though. How about we do a nuggies for Thanksgiving? You guys want nuggies for Thanksgiving instead of turkey? Right? I think we should do nuggies instead of turkeys. Tommy Powers, I'm sorry you were the first one timed out tonight. Uh, that sucks. K-Bot is on a roll, though. I, I don't know why Giant sent him a hat. I he's def I the best bot gets a hat? It's like, seriously, what? What are we talking about here? What are we talking about? Whoa, super loud. Let's go. Let's get back to work. <laughs> you know what the funny part is? It how many people leave the chat when uh, K-Bot comes on? We lose like 50 people. <laughs> I <laughs> uh, love it. <laughs> if you don't get used to K-Bot, you're probably not going to like it around here. That's all I can tell you. Uh, all right. So I've already cultivated these fields. We got to we gotta fertilize them again later on once they grow a little bit. And we're good to go. But other than that, we are happy. Uh, I need beans in here, though. We need some beans. Where's my beans at? Which one is it? Uh, da, 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 da. Beans, beans, beans. There we go. Beans. Beans. Turn this on. Uh, did I turn it on? It's turned on. Good. Lower it down. And let's plant. Let's go. Beans in the field. I've been lucky out. Plum, what's going on, man? Uh, clutch. Cheers, man. How's it going, buddy? You get some brown water. You want some squats? Oh, we'll get some brown waters flowing here for you in a sec. Let me get to the edge here. Tell you what, I'm going to do a headland and I'll get some brown waters for you. 
we'll do a quick headline around this field just so we can kind of get into it we can get into it uh right to the edge uh, i'm having some super duper luck right now with um with field stones now I, someone was saying they think it's the crockerling uh because it's got a roller on the back and that pushes the stones back down because i don't get any stones with that with that cultivator at all i do not get any stones with the cultivator an angry christmas elf oh you're an angry elf <laughs> I gotta go watch that movie now. I've gotta go watch that movie. All right. Space the tracks out. I know I could go in and, and pay for them to have them spaced out. But I, like I said, this was a used piece of tractor, a used piece of tractor that we got. And I'm all over the place here because I'm, I'm not paying attention. Um, but uh, yeah, so this was used. We got this one used. You guys might, might remember. Might remember. Uh, cryptic. Cheers, buddy. Where do you Fair. get the water for greenhouses and animals? I keep going to lakes, but get stuck. Fair enough. I'll show you in a sec here. I'll, I show you everything, cryptic. Uh, plum. We still owe plum something though here. Let's go. Let's go. Plum is buying you guys around. Cheers to you, plum. All right, let's go, crew. Come on up. It's rude. I keep on telling you this. It's rude. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, there we go. Plum, cheers, buddy. Appreciate you. Get in here. Get it in you. Oh, get it in you. All right. So you want to know where you get the water for it. Uh, so if you went in new farmer mode, you would have actually gotten uh, a little water source to use it on. Wow. With so much, so much foliage. So right here, this thing. This is a container that fills up with water. So you can use this. You can buy this in your construction tab under containers. Go buildings, containers, right here, water tank. And then place that down. That's going to give you water. It's going to cost you about, I mean, I don't know what the price is totally, but to fill this thing up, yeah, the Joskin, it's like 730 bucks on normal mode. So every time I fill up that with water, it's about 730 bucks. Uh, but just place that down and you are good to go. You're golden. That's all there is to it. No one has to mod any stars. Keep the stars out of farm sim. There can't be anybody like, I don't understand why they were even in the game to begin with. Like who was, whose idea was it? It's like, this is the tracker we want to have is Stara. Is there, is there any, like even the, the South American guys, I don't, I've never seen anyone that was like big on Stara ever. I could be wrong. Don't get me wrong. I could be wrong, but I've never once seen it happen before. Let me know if, I don't know. Is there, is there any YouTuber that was all about using Stara's? Like I, other than me? <laughs> uh all right zip that in uh is crop destruction on uh oh yep crop destruction is definitely on good okay one nice thing about this, these the ART is how fast or how quickly I can zip this thing around like getting this lapped around oh man I'm having a heck of a time tonight I'm sorry crew this is not my my I know this is my usual driving who am I kidding I'm just, I struggle with these tractors. I don't know what it is because I can't see the wheels. Like which way I'm turning. I totally struggle with it. All right. Uh, get water from the ponds. There you go. You can do water from the ponds. You can do it from the creek there as well, I guess. But yeah, like I said, you can do that. That little container will give you water as well. All right. Zip it around. Yeah, like you can flip this thing so quick. That's one of the benefits of these tractors. Maybe yeah, that's it. Not enough brown water. It's like my golf game. I also drive better. At least I haven't changed off the soybeans yet. And change it to, to wheat. And have a wheat bean field. Because that would just suck. Alright. Lift her up again. Don't hit. Don't hit. Don't hit. Good. Oh, see, I'm missing some there. Now, I could use the uh, the arms, but like I told you guys before, I found when you're using the arms that it actually brings up rocks. It brings up stones. So I'm like, I don't want to do that now. I got to go back and replant that section. I totally missed some there. I, I'm going to fix that in a sec. Aiden, hey, buddy. You working tonight? Oh, easy, easy. Get nice and close. Drop it back down. Drop her back down. There we go. 
Apparently, I thought my planter was bigger than it actually is. You guys can read into that however you want. Ah, uh, Hayden's working. That sucks. Uh, I find the same thing, Derek. Now, the one thing they did change with the sound is now it's dynamic. So the sound that you're going to get from your equipment depends on Sarge how close you are. Sarge, what are you doing, brother? Welcome back in, Sarge. I think you remembered a long time ago at one point in time, weren't you? Uh, guys, give Sarge a welcome, would you? Uh, so I think the, like, the one thing I've noticed with the sounds is that it depends how far away you are. So, like, for instance, back here, just turn this down for a second. You hear it at this volume, but as you zoom in, it gets louder. In Farm Sim 22 or 19, they didn't do that. It was, like, the same sound no matter what. So, um, I think that might be part of it. But I do struggle getting the sounds just right for, for, for videos and for streaming. I'm not going to lie, guys. It's, um... It's been a bit of a struggle for me so far for sounds because they sound great, but just trying to find the right volume is um, a little bit difficult because like right now I'm at my standard set stream volume for what we used to run and my volumes are like my music's way too loud. It looks like compared to the game sounds right now. They should be about even and I can it's about a third. It's down about a third. That it should be. So anyways. It wasn't to the same extent, though, in 19. There was something different about the way you look at it. Randy Fry! What's going on, man? More Christmas buddy from Doug. <laughs> sorry, Doug. Sorry, Doug. Um, sorry, Doug. I'm sorry, buddy. You're trying to play FS11. Nice. That's hardcore. There. I have never played uh, that far back. But like I said, I started on 15. Farm Sim 15 was the my first foray into Farming Simulator. Farm Sim 11, though, holy. Oh, easy. I cranked it too much there. <laughs> Doug. Uh, Doug's back there as well. <laughs> uh, sorry, Doug. I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go down to the far side. Instead of bouncing it back and forth in here. Getting kind of annoyed trying to do this. Let's go this way instead. We're almost done this field. And then we'll go down to the far end and we'll do the big field. And then uh, we'll advance a day and do some fertilizing. Hopefully as soon as this comes up with some green. And we should be into harvesting already. Because the other fields should be harvested or already uh, fully fertilized. I already took care of all that wheat. It's barley this time. We got barley instead of wheat. And I've already taken care of all that field. Those fields there. Now, we'll see how we do tonight. If we're if we're doing good with the harvesting, we may end up flipping a field. We'll see if we can flip a field. Because uh, I know that still is a thing. If you guys haven't seen that before, it's kind of a cheeky farm sim maneuver. Um, we'll see what you guys think. All right. The bar is just getting started right now. Put it that way. <laughs> sound, sound beam. Hey, buddy. How are you, man? Welcome in. Uh, did I miss anybody with a shouty outies? I know Flavia Dave's in here, I see. Um, can we, can we see the bar? Yes, you can. Give me a sec. <laughs> Hayden. Uh, we'll talk to K-Bot. We'll see if we can get him to lose his mind a little bit tonight. We'll get K-Bot to lose his mind. How's, what, Hayden Road, cheers to you, Hayden. Appreciate you, man. So I've been seeing some mixed stuff. I think bar? general, the general consensus is on Farm Sim 22, though, that everyone's digging it, though. Uh, I know I've heard some people, of course, you're going to always have the haters. There's nothing you can do about that. But, and I am definitely a bit biased because I absolutely love the series, but um, what do you guys think? I mean, you guys are in here, so I'm sure we're going to get a bit of a bias on this, right? Like, the game is... I think you guys... You're happy with what, what they've done so far? Oh, I have plans. Oh, boy. Uh-oh. That's not good. You guys want the ban bar. He's already, like... He was out here earlier, and as soon as we brought K-Bot out, 50 people left the stream, so that's the thing. See, I'm digging it. I'm absolutely loving this. This map is absolutely amazing. This is such a good map. Elm Creek is a fantastic map. Um, and I think it's the best farm sim map base game that's ever been done, personally. From what I've played of it so far, give me another like month on it and we'll have to talk. But um, right now, I'm, I could see this being my favorite all-time base map. From, at, least, at least from seven, or 15, 17, and 19. Um, definitely better than 19, of course. 17 gold crest valley didn't really do it for me and then westbridge hills would be the next the next closest for me and i think this blows westbridge out of the water so um 
There is that. There is that. Hang on a sec here. Oh boy. Ouch. We'll see. We still, like I said, I still need to make some money though, crew. Um, it's not looking good for me right now. Uh, are you guys finding it as hard? I saw someone posting on Discord a while, on, on one of the channels, saying that it's they're finding it actually kind of difficult. I mean, it is with seasons, so you can't constantly harvest, which uh, kind of throws it a little bit of a loop in the old system, right? It changes the way that all works. And I find it, I'm struggling a little bit. Like, I'm on season three already, and I'm, I'm so far in debt still that... Yeah, it is what it is. We're still we're still a long ways down. All right, perfect. Close all that off. All right. Uh, is Nitro in here? Sorry, sorry. Is Nitro dad just drop in here? Did I miss Nitro? If Nitro's in here, I I, I want to know what he's got planned. Hey, Nitro, what do you got planned? Have you had a chance to look at the editor yet? I know it just came out today, but I want to know what Nitro has planned because the editors came out and there's guys raving about it right now. Like I said, if you guys saw MRG's stream, MRG was going ballistic about all the textures he gets to play with now. So, Nitro, I, I hope you've had a chance to take a look. Because there's all sorts of fun new stuff on there now. Gabe's turn season off. I get that, Knight. Oh, boy. Okay, before we... Well, that's, we'll, we'll, we'll play some time out in a sec, but... Uh, we've got to go do some time out. I thought it was Knight. It's, is it in England? I thought it was Knight. Cheers, man. I got your name wrong completely. Who were you before? You had a different name before, didn't you? I don't recognize that name, and you're a member. I, I usually recognize members. Did you change your name? Uh, but we got some brown waters to give out, so appreciate you, man. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. More brown waters flowing tonight. Uh, I apologize. I thought your name was Knight when I looked at it before, and I, I don't recognize it. I apologize. Ming Light. <laughs> appreciate it let's go guys get it in ya get it in ya brown water's flowing tonight it's flowing let's go let's go let's go what are we doing time out again why do we have to always do this always playing this little time out game you guys are ridiculous absolutely We're gonna have to take care of you, K Bot. I, I I can't have you stay in the chat. Sorry, dude. Um, you know what? I owe you guys one. So, oh, let's just zap him just for for funsies now. Let's just zap him for the fun of it, shall we? You know what, K Bot? You're getting on my nerves already tonight. So, um, have a little ride, buddy. This one's from me. Appreciate you guys. Let's go. In three, in two, in one. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That hurt. That one's for me. That one's for me, K Bot. Uh oh, my button's broken. See, this is what happens. When 
when you guys mess with things, this is what happens. You force me to do things like... Oh, you guys are bad. You guys are brutal! Absolutely brutal! Uh, cheers to you guys. <laughs> Something has completely gone haywire. Let's get back to work. Let's go. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, we got to... Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. He, you know what? He got, into the, he got into the studio there and... Uh, he almost broke that. He almost prevented me from tying him out, but not quite. See you, K-Bot. Have a good one, buddy. He gown. He gown. Let's go. All right. Planted. Where was I? I was doing something. I was doing something, chat. I don't even know what it was anymore. There we go. I was doing that thing. All right. Beacon on. Uh-oh. Did I just drive over a bunch of my crop? I did too. Oopsies. All right. The beacons are on. Beacons are on! And we're driving the 8RT, so, um... Yeah, it's on spastic mode now. There we go. Big boss. Super big boss. Cheers, buddy. How you guys doing? How you doing, big boss? Good to see you, man. All right. In we go into Gertie's trailer right here. Just sneak by. Great. Oh, let's go this side of Gertie's trailer. We don't want to go by her bedroom there. She's sleeping. K-Bot is awfully annoying, Nate. I 100% agree. Good to see... Uh, I hope you're home tonight. Nice, for me. Good to see you, buddy. Uh, let's open that up. Drop her in. How are we looking here? Is that down? Drop that down. Fire it up. And let's go. That's in. Looks like we're planting, right? Yeah, there we go. So you guys might notice I also I can turn the beacon off there. I lowered the camera so you can kind of see the side panel now. It's right here. Uh, that this little thing right there. That's the little thing you're looking at. It's my joystick. Um, easy lane, easy. So you can kind of see how I'm always end up using that now. If you guys had panel, any questions on the side panel, um, I'm kind of trying to use it as, as much as I can, pretty much exclusively. Pretty much exclusively, I'm trying to use this. So my left hand is always on my joystick. I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> oh, bad. Beans still seem to be fairly good. To be honest, um, I'm trying to do the factory stuff as much as I can. And I think that uh, oil, like the oils, you can get it from uh, soybeans, canola. Uh, what else makes the oil? Sunflowers? I think that might be a pretty good way to go, too. You got unfinished <laughs> phrasing. Thanks, believe it, Dave. <laughs> you got unfinished business in Griffin, Indiana. I would love to see some remakes of some of the old maps. Uh, but the new textures and stuff, I'm just wondering, like the way MRG was going nuts, guys. <laughs> I always knew you had a little joystick. Yeah. <laughs> it's got a red light on it, too. Um... <laughs> It truthfully does. Oh, boy. <laughs> Poor K-Bot. You know what? You guys, if you guys have not met K-Bot before, I know he's a little on the annoying side. That's just what he is, guys. You take, you can you can give him shots, but he runs the show around here. You know what? He takes care of us in the speed shop, so. Uh, what do you think of the lack of big cedars? I'm a little disappointed in it. Um, the bigger problem with the, not having the big cedars will be as soon as we get some big 4X maps. Some big, uh, big American 4X maps. Then all of a sudden, guys, that's good when it's going to be like, um, I need some cedars now, Giants. Giants, hello, I need some cedars. So um, I'm sure that someone's going to be doing like a DB, a DB90. Uh, hold on. Someone can't drive apparently here. <laughs> uh, I can see like the, the uh, custom modding doing the DB90, DB, DB60, DB120 and having that good to go pretty quick, guys. So uh, I'm not too concerned, but I would still love to see like the Borgo stuff. I miss that. I really did like the Borgo. Uh, I know I shouldn't have told you. Of course not. Of course not, Laner. What is flipping the field? Well, I'll tell you what. We'll get into harvest season here uh, in just a little bit here, and I will show you. It's kind of a cheeky way to make money. Um, some might call it cheating because it's not exactly realistic. All right. But um, it is a legitimate farm sim 2019 tactic, and it also works in uh, in 19 or 22 as well. So yeah, 
Let's go. Can't wait for more maps. I'm not, I'm okay right now. Uh, I'm really enjoying this map. Now, what, if we start having some choices for more maps, of course, it's going to be great. But I'm digging Elm Creek right now, guys. Elm Creek's a fantastic map. Uh, you can't speed up growth. It still takes X amount of days for a crop to grow, no matter what you do. Um, yeah, crop growth is always the same. So you don't have the slow, medium, fast, or off options. Uh, you actually have an off option, technically, I think, uh, in the seasons menu. But that's you can just but you can pause the crop calendar, right? Or the crop. Yeah, you can pause the crop. I think it is. Anyways, but um, you can't speed things up in that same sense. Yeah, you're ruining other farmers, cowboy. That's exactly what you're doing. <laughs> yeah, you're just taking their crops off their field. But I mean, hey, they're, they're willing to sell it to you. It's one. It's one aspect that I never really truly understood. I think they should have made it a little bit more difficult to buy fields. Like it, it's, it's bizarre that every single field is always, you can buy whatever field you want, whenever you want. I think they should have made it so that fields kind of come up and kind of like the used market, right? Um, actually the farm sim network does that. Let me move this over. There we go. They make it so that like fields are not always on sale. A field comes up and it goes away. So you can't always buy fields in the farm sim network. You have to watch for a sale to come up on that specific field uh, and buy it when you when it's on sale. And I think that they could have built something like that base game. I think they could have done that. But then, of course, you'd have people like, well, I just want to buy these fields here all the time. All right. Maybe you have a way to turn that off. I don't know. But I think that that as far as like a farming simulator, I don't know. I guess you're getting more into like the land management side of things there, but at the same time, um, just being able to buy any field you want whenever you want doesn't really make sense, does it? All right. There we go. Uh, oh, I missed Nitro's comment. Nit what did Nitro say? Does Nitro have news? I missed it. Nitro, I missed it. Please repeat what you said. I want to see what he's got planned. All right, and I apologize if I miss anyone's comments. It's just what happens. It's some time, time clutch, straighten it out, straighten it out, clutch. Oh boy, I suck at driving this tractor. I always crank it over too far. I've heard a lot of people not happy with how. Well, not a lot of people. I've heard some people not happy with uh, being like the way seasons is implemented and how it's kind of difficult, right? Like it's not, it's not as simple. But I mean, you can get rid of it, kind of. But like you said, you can't speed. You can't speed up the harvest, right? You can't speed up when crops are ready. You still have a certain amount of time that it's going to take no matter what. So I find it's more of a methodical game. It's it's a little bit slower than uh, than 19 was base, especially. Um, you definitely have to do more planning. Now, that being said, I'm surprised that Seasonal Cycles does not have a crop uh, a crop rotation setting. I thought that that one was going to be a thing again. Kind of surprised. Oh, darn. Did I just turn this thing off? I did too. Hang on. I am flying all of a sudden. Yeah, there's no crop rotation whatsoever. So you can keep planting the same things on the same fields. Um, I'm surprised that that wasn't made into seasonal cycles. Kind of surprised. Just trying to decide between converting one year old mouse and starting a new one. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Fair enough. Uh, you know what? You're not wrong. Precision farming could could introduce crop rotations that could be a thing you are totally 100 right that could be a thing oh boy these things turn so freaking sharp but you don't want to you don't want to turn it too sharp right there you go uh drop yeah it's dropped okay all right Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I'm just waiting on... That's one of the ones I was kind of weirded out about a bit by. And same with the way animals work. Um, I thought that was kind of nice, the way the uh, Seasons mod did the animals. And it didn't really touch animals in 22, which is kind of strange to me. Like, it's... I, I get it. Uh, I think the animals were harder in 19 with Seasons than they are with in animals now. But still, I thought it would have more of an effect, considering... Uh, one of the guys from Realness, Reals, Realness, Real, Realness Modding, I can never get that right. 
um, is the guy that did the uh, is working for Giants and pretty much implemented the season cycles. Uh, am I doing grapes or olives? Not on this playthrough, most likely. Uh, I might head over to the French map and do some of that stuff. We'll see. Um, I, I don't know. I, I like to do it. It seems like it was fun to do once, but we'll see. Um, I, I need some mods for that, to be perfectly honest, because I want to do some K-Sim special stuff. Uh, we'll see. Real, real in this modding. There we go, JT. You can never pronounce it right. <laughs> hey, Joe. What's going on, dude? How are you, man? Did you do some on the French map? It's a nice map. It, I 100% I agree. Um, but uh, I, I want Elm. I, this is where I want to be, guys. Elm Creek. I just love this map. Digging this map. There's a goat in 22? I haven't seen. The only goat I know is myself, my friend. That's the only goat I know in 22. Hang on a sec. I need a. There's got to be applause or something, right? Let's do. Um, do I not have applause? I thought I had applause on here. Hang on. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Yeah. There we go. Hey, there we go. See? I'm the goat. Get it? Come on. Come on. Come on, chat. Come on. You guys know you like that. That was a good one. That was a good one. <laughs> that joke was bad. Come on. <laughs> uh, took time to accumulate uh, manure for, for fruit. Yeah. Um, you make manure pretty fast from what I've seen. Oh, Slurio has making pretty fast. We were messing around uh, with unlimited money. You, you made, we had a, only had 60 cows, but made manure pretty quick. Come on, guys. If I wasn't awkward, what would I be? Like, seriously. I wasn't just a little bit on the awkward side. What would we be? Oh, we're hitting the shrubbers. We're hitting the shrubberies. We're into the shrubberies. All right. There we go. Uh, the Kamaz dump truck yet? I have not. Not really a mod. I was big with Ken, to be honest with you. Uh, 18K, 20,000 bucks with a hitch. Kind of cool. One of the things I noticed, so I have only, I haven't messed too much with the trucks, but the hitches don't seem to work on a lot of things like I was hoping for. Like I couldn't get it to hitch up to even like the the, the little bin, the little wagon. I couldn't even get it to use it on that. I don't know, but there's something, it seemed like it should have worked on it and it didn't. It seemed like it should have worked on it and it wasn't. The balance of manure, yeah, I agree. I agree. Oh, I totally agree. Oh, you know what? Speaking of which, uh, what's on sale? What is on sale right now? I haven't even checked. Oops, wrong menu, wrong menu. Let's go here. What do we got? Uh, we got some big planters. See, I find this funny. Um, you've got some of the big stuff, the big Vatterstad stuff, but you don't have the other big stuff. I just, I, I, I don't know. Whatever, I guess it is what it is. Nothing good right now. Nothing worth buying. Nothing worth buying. Everything is on sale. What are you talking about, Matty? What else is on sale? There's nothing on sale. Nothing. I missed some. I did too. You think it's coming as a DLC? Maybe. We'll see. I, I, I'll be kind of bummed if that's what they choose for a DLC is to bring back old equipment we've had but like the last game um oh damn it lowered it up um i was i'm i don't know like i absolutely love the anderson pack i'm glad we have some of that stuff in base game why is this not lowering i says low oh i'm hitting the wrong button that's why i'm trying to unload <laughs> there we go now it's lowered um but we'll see like the borgo and the anderson pack those were my go-to dlcs for farm sim 19 if they're going to make me buy more Borgo stuff, I mean, I definitely do it. But still, um, I just was would like to see it base game. That's all. I don't know. I don't think you're going to see them as mods. I have a funny feeling. And someone 82, you should make a Borgo thing and see what they say. Just just for funsies. I'd like to see someone do a mod of it. Can, so, can someone do that? <laughs> of course. Okay, so how would that work? Can you do a mod of a DLC pack now? Can you like update that? Is that? I don't think they would let you do that, would they? I'm pretty sure they wouldn't let you do that. Uh, is Logitech good? What are you looking for for Logitech, Zay? 
I'm running a Logitech wheel. Um, I'm running a lot of Logitech stuff. They're it's they're they're okay for some things for sure. Uh, licensed, okay. Fair enough. I didn't think they would. You never know, though. I mean, there's been some other weird stuff that's got on the mod hub, right? Zip it. Come on. Turn it hard. Turn it hard without. There we go. Without actually uh, jackknifing. Oh, I missed a whole bunch. No, I didn't. Uh, yeah, I did. I don't know if I did or not. I think that's just my track. It's kind of strange looking. Weird. All right. Uh, no, the DLCs are encrypted. Giants are the only ones that released. Okay. That's too bad. But I mean, if someone released that as a mod, potentially, but they'd have to make it themselves, of course, and not use the DLC stuff um, because it's encrypted if they managed to break the encryption. But um, like, I would, be, I would wonder what Giants would say because that would be one way to find out if there's going to be a DLC pack of it, right? Like, if you released a mod of it, it'd be like, no, sorry, we've got plans for that already. Okay, I wanted to do this. I wanted to fix this up here. And there we go. Fixed it. Fixed it. We didn't have, there's no more problems here, chat. We fixed the problem. Problems fixed. Problem solved. Clutch solved it. Kind of, sort of. All right. Looking good. Looking good. You know what? There's one little bit here. Here, I think I missed too. Kablamo. All right. Fold it up. All right. Planting is done. Uh, we can advance a day here. Get some fertilizing going on in a bit. I'm gonna, I, I'm watching the markets like a hawk right now because I want to see what happens with flour. Uh, I was kind of surprised that the prices for flour and the wheat and the barley were so similar. Um, not only that, a little bit disappointed, obviously, as well. I think I can cut this way, right? Oh, no, I can't. Nope. This is not going to work. There's no trails this side. Um, I want to go over there. I want to go over there. Um, yeah, we're going to try a little off-roading here. Try a little bit of off-roading. Don't mind us. There we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. We're good. We're good. We're good. No problems. Um, I still want to go over that way, though. I still missed my turn. There was, I thought there was a road there. There it is. There's the trail I was thinking of. I'm like, I know there's a little dirt trail that goes over this way. I can sneak through here. Watch out. Coming through, bud. Out of the way. All right. Uh, all right. So let's actually, we should probably do these as well. Let's get some more water in here while we're thinking about it while we're thinking about it because I see the tomatoes look a little bit uh, they look parched they look parched can I not grab that can I not grab that oh, I was going to the wrong spot there we go uh, grab this all right I want to fill this up from the creek does it cost anything to fill it from the creek versus the other thing I have no idea. Let's just take a look here. Yeah, we got a trespasser there. He's trying to get by. So I can't fill it from the creek. Someone was saying I could fill it from this. Um, not from this one. You can't. Is there another one? Which is the other one you guys were filling it from? Yeah, this one doesn't fill. Was there another one? It's free at the lake, like the way down South Lake. So like, where is it? Like I could go over here, I guess, or way down here. Um, that's the recreational lake right down there. I'm, and it's, you can free up, fill up at those places, can you? Okay. I didn't think, someone said the last week that you can fill up at the creek and I never tried it. Lake near the shop. Okay. Yeah, that's all right. I don't feel like going that far. I don't feel like going that far. We'll, we'll pay for our water. Oopsies. We'll pay for our water. That's fine. It's 700 bucks. You got to pay for it every once in a while, right? The one by the store is closest. Where is that one at? Just out of curiosity. Like this one right here. The store is right there, over here. So there's a lake right here. I mean, there's a lake on the far side. Uh, but that one has like signs by it. It looks like toxic water. But there is a lake right here. And then this one here is like the wreck lake uh, with fishing and stuff on it. There's nothing really else that's close. Uh, the main river, I wonder if that one, I wonder if you could fill there. That's not too far away either. That ain't too far away either. Just take the back roads. Yeah, we could do that, but whatever. I got, I got, I got, I can do this. I can just buy, buy it here. 
We'll pay for it. For once. 730 bucks, whatever. And... Yeah, I need to get this parked a little bit closer. I don't want to overload from here. Leave this thing parked out in the middle of the road. Uh, let's get it nice and close. There we go. And uh, overload. All right. How are we looking for water on this? We should have that should be put us back up a bit, right? Yeah, there we go. So we've got lettuce and tomatoes going in here. Let's see. Yeah, water is half full. That'll be good enough for now. That should last us a while. Doesn't go through a ton of water. So uh, roughly, I, I think I, I if this, if it's good sales, you'll get about like ten grand per fourteen hundred dollars of water. So it's worthwhile. Oops, I, I wanted to leave this here. I don't need this. I don't need this. Don't need this. Leave her here. There we go. I need the I need to get that cedar put away. Um. No, they will never let you hunt the deer. That's not going to be a thing. Yeah, they, uh, I mean, I don't know unless a modder can figure out a way to make them so they're a thing, but um, they're not going to let you hunt them, unfortunately. They are all about uh, making it sure it's uh, like a, a family, all ages friendly game. So any relation to hunting, unfortunately, they're not going to, they're not interested in it at all. That's something they don't want to, to to get into, it sounds like. So I even asked, like, what about, like, fishing or something like that? But, no. Like, it's just, like, a little mini game, but... Never. Doesn't sound like that's something they're, they're ever interested in. Oh, see? Oh, the workbench got in my way. Workbench got in my way. Uh-oh. Now I'm so stuck. There we go. I, I was good, except for uh, the workbench is in the way there. This is a tight fit for this thing in there. But I don't need it for another, like, six months, so I might as well put it away. I'll wash it up later on. Pressure washer is right beside us there. Easy, easy. Just tap it in. Tap it in now. All the way back. Perfect. All right. That looks good. Uh, you know what? We can park this as well. I'm not going to need this for a bit. So fields are ready. We just need to, we'll need to, uh, we will need to put some fertilizer down on them. All right. You know what? Let's just scrub this down quickly. Um, game less milkable. <laughs> Wish we could farm deer. Yeah, no kidding, right? That'd be kind of cool. I get helpers to work tonight. They're sewing single rows. Uh, oh man, that sucks. Um, Helpers are, are there seem to be somewhat better, but there's still have some problems for sure. All right, let's just take a quick look, see, make sure I'm not forgetting anything. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, so we need to fertilize these two fields. Everything else is fully fertilized, so we're good there. And they are growing, looking good. Everything's happy. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so those fields are all good. Uh, what's our prices looking at for stuffs? I don't think they would have changed by now at this point. So we've got flour to sell off. Current price is pretty low, 1100 bucks. I mean, I'm going to hold off on selling any more flour. I just want to see what happens with that, if the prices go up on this at all, because I'm kind of disappointed in this. Like 1100 bucks and like wheat and barley. Actually, wheat and barley is cheap right now. Oats are high. And what's sorghum at? Sorghum is mid-range. But anyways, for... Like, well, it's almost 734. It's dropping, though. Anyways, I, I was a little disappointed. I thought I would get a lot, like another $500 per hundred uh, from the, the flour. And then what do we got? Soybeans, soybeans, soybeans. Where's the soybeans at? Beans. Beans are going up. They're at 1,700, almost a little over. Oh, they're at 2,000 right now. And they've got, what are we at? What month are we in right now? May? We're in April. So we're in April. Beans are at almost 2,000. April. Like, they should go up. Like, there's no... My problem is with this scale, there is no... There is no, uh, like, dollar scale. Like, I... What does it... What does this mean? It means that, okay, this is the best month, but by how much? Like, what is the difference between this and this? 
you kind of have to do the math in your head and just kind of guess right is this like is this zero down in the bottom that's nothing and this this is so like i don't know so this they're trying to say right now this is two thousand bucks if this if you're going by this graph this is two thousand dollars or nineteen hundred dollars is peaking out at uh per thousand so that's like double so that means we should be getting four thousand dollars roughly per thousand if that's true in two months i don't think that's what we're gonna get guys i really don't think that's what we're gonna get i think that graph is deceiving and i don't like it and i don't like it all right i'm gonna be broke again because uh loan interest comes out money is dropping yeah i know it happens we, we're losing we're not we're not very rich right now that's for sure hey 53 what's going on man how are you doing minus 1200 do you notice that you can't write checks uh that bounce to the workers anymore okay, i thought that was kind of funny you now have to pay your workers if you run out of money in your account your workers will not work for you anymore <laughs> you are uh you're stuck you got to pay your workers you got to pay your workers okay uh i'm gonna go fertilize these fields quickly then we'll check prices again actually you know what since it's fresh in our heads let's go check let's look prices let's go look at prices then we'll fertilize and then we'll move along into harvest season right away we're, we're moving along quickly we're moving along quickly tonight give me that let's see prices okay soybeans see it's dropped down we're down to 1700 now and it says that th that shouldn't happen right it doesn't there's no way that that should happen according to this graph <laughs> this graph is baloney absolute baloney okay that's what's wheat at now wheat should be the same yeah it's dropped a little bit not bad how's our flour looking flour is about the same it's dropped about 100 bucks okay so I i'm not happy with that graph i like the one that we had in seasons 19 better that's obviously Eric. Hey, buddy. How you doing, Eric? Good to see you, man. Eric, did you say you got the shirt or no? I just got a fresh one in today. I got a fresh one today for some new merch. All right. Beans getting fertilized. With the 6M. Turn this on. Ooh, we're a little low on the old fertilizer. Little low on fertilizer. I'm going to have to take a loan out. Clutch is going to have to take out a loan to get some fertilizer. That sucks. I got seed at the shop. No, yeah, yeah, okay. Weird. And now the rain comes too. Um, now as well, it says that you can, I think you can harvest when it rains now, but you lose your yield drops. You aren't able to harvest as much. So just be careful out there, guys. You are actually able to harvest in the rain uh, if you want to, but it's gonna affect your yield. Uh, is bugged or is this something within the graph? It sure seems like it, Kyle, because I've been watching that since release and we've been messing with it, and it never seems accurate to me. That graph seems like it's baloney. All right. Is it 50% you lose? It can't be that high. Just from harvesting in the rain, you can't lose 50. That seems like way too high of a, of a loss for that. All right, four percent. Okay, I'm gonna take out a loan, guys, just so we, we need we need some more fertilizer. I can't finish this field uh, with the fertilizer we got. So let's go for a cruise down to the shop. I don't think I have. I've only got lime, I think, left over. Let me just double check and make sure that's correct. Oh, let's see here. Lime. It's not fertilizer, right? Yeah, it's lime. Lime, lime, lime. Okay, let's go down to the shop. We'll refill with a couple bags of fertilizer. We'll take out a $5,000 loan just to pay for it. Ouch. Ouchies. Beacon's on. Uh, cheapest place? I don't know if there is a cheapest place yet. But uh, you can get it in the link down in the description. It's down there. You can download it directly from Giants. Uh, after a few days, far more expected than mods coming out than game... <laughs> uh a, I, I don't agree with you man i think the game is great i think base game is actually really good right now um i'm there's some equipment that i'm i'm, I'm hoping to see quickly uh, i'm happy we're already starting to see some mods come out even third party sites we're getting lots of cool mods now um i don't think it's gonna take that long i think we're gonna get some good mods right away here oh i got some seeds sitting here still that's right that's right let's see let's buy some more stuff though uh what else we got 6r series is on sale now slurry tank uh, nothing i need 
Nothing I need, big bags. Oh, I need money first. I need money. Give me some money. Give me some money. Uh, borrow, borrow. Yeah. And buy. Uh, fertilizer. Buy. Yep. Buy. Um, I'll buy one more. I'll buy three. I'll buy four. <laughs> uh, there we go. Okay. Uh, update for console, I think, was the PS4 update, wasn't it? That was the big update. Uh oh, there we go. I think that's what it was. 10 to 14 days. Okay. Well, it should come from. It should be the U.S. that's coming out of Eric. Yeah, it wouldn't be coming out of Canada. I think it's California. Is where all the merch comes from. All right. Is Kbot waiting for a star up? Maybe. I could see that being a thing. All right, that looks good. Got like 35% there. That should be enough to get us through for a while. Fertilizer goes quite a long way, so I never go crazy on the fertilizer. Uh, PS4 got an update today. Nice. Noise. So along with um, th uh, this little thing right here um, and uh, Kbot's hat, they also send a copy of... Uh, of course, this comes with a PC copy. I got a PC, an Xbox copy of Farm Sim, a PlayStation copy of Farm Sim, um, and some other little knickknacks and patty wax. I'll talk about those. I'll show those off probably over on the Twitter. So if you guys want to see what we got uh, from Giants, follow us over on Twitter. Uh, I think exclamation mark T, I think. We'll bring up the Twitter, and you guys can follow us over there uh, as we're posting stuff about all the stuff that Giants is doing as well. But yeah, follow us on Twitter, follow us on Facebook, all sorts of fun stuff. Is there a way to change the time? to regular uh, change the time to regular time what do you mean regular time oh i missed my turn i missed my turn is that twitch ah that's twitter there we go nice cheers thanks johnny am i going to i didn't get oil uh, you know what i'm not i'm not i'm glad i didn't to be honest i could never make up for what uh I, I mean, I can't, I can't keep up with what DJ does. So I, I'm, I'm just glad they didn't send it to me. <laughs> I think, did 53 drink his oil? Did I hear that right? That 53 drank oil too? I heard somebody else drank the oil. I don't know who drinks olive oil. I don't understand. I don't get it. All right. I'm gonna do a just do a headliner on this one quickly so I can get away from these trees. All right, way we go. Oh, way we go. Uh, I I think it's a step forward for sure. I think it's a pretty good step forward in farming and farm sim. Um, I, I have been searching collectibles. I found I I think I got ten on the map so far that uh, to help me get ahead a little bit there, driver. Uh, but you no, know, I definitely think it's a step ahead. Um, there's, there's a lot of new things that are kind of going on behind the scenes that make it just so much more immersive. Um, the sounds are fantastic. The sounds are a big deal. I wish they were louder at times and I wish they were more controllable, but they are great when you get them. Um, yeah, we, I think there's just a lot of other nice little features, right? There's some new gameplay features. Um, I'm just really curious to see now. Because the modding sounds like it is very similar. It doesn't sound like it's a big step as far as modding goes between 19 and 22. So it sounds like modders may have a fairly easy time of at least updating some mods. We'll see. I know dry, I know. Um, David's already got some stuff working. Oh, wait. I didn't do that far side yet already. Darn it. Oh, well. We'll get there. I, I didn't do the headland yet. So we'll see how that all works out. But I know that it sounds like the, the modding community should be fairly good with some of the older stuff to easily update and then we'll see it'll, it'll be interesting we'll see we'll see we'll see uh where it's not military time oh so you just want to do tw i don't think there's a way of doing that is there so you just want to go like am pm i see what you mean you don't like the 24 hour clock um i don't think there is a way of changing that i don't think it's a thing uh, do used vehicles haven't changed? Really? Your used vehicles haven't changed? Every time I sleep, my used vehicles swap out slowly. Like, they kind of move one up and one drops off. 
Um, and if you buy buy one of the used vehicles, then it's gone, and another one kind of comes up eventually later on. It's like every like 12 hours, something new stop drops into the, the used vehicle shop. At least that's how it's supposed to be. All right, country boy, hey buddy, how are you? All right, that is it for that. Everything's fertilized. Everything is good to go. All we got to do now is wait for the harvest chat. Boom. Hold this back on up. Now we got rainy May. <laughs> She's rainy today. Um, yeah, I don't think you can change the clock. I don't. I don't think so, Joe. My, there's a 12 hour time game. Is it really? I have to take a look. I don't. I didn't. Don't remember seeing a setting in there, but it must be it. Uh, Jeffrey, I'm doing fantastic, man. How are you? Yeah, the sales are good. Like that's the whole reason we have that that 8 RT on this playthrough. Uh, we had a 7 R was our original bigger tractor to start with, and the 8 RT was in there. Was it 8 7 R? Was it 6 R? I can't remember anymore. Anyways, I wasn't planning on buying an 8 RT to start with. But that tractor was in there at 60% off, so I couldn't afford not to buy it. Mm, don't! Oh, I just nudged it. Just nudged it. Just a little nudgy nudge. All right. Beacon's off. Hazard's off. Yeah, you think so too, eh, Fluff? Good. Glad you're digging it, man. Um, I do have to get on the server at some point. I promise soon. Maybe even tonight. We'll see. Let's just put this over here. And of course, if you're not on a server, if you're looking to get a server, uh, G Portal has servers. You can get 5% off down in the description below for G Portal. And once again, console players, you guys can use you can use servers as well now. So uh, you can play with PC players on servers. You can play with other console players on servers. Everybody can play with everybody on servers. It's fantastic. It's so good. Uh, my hockey has been doing good. I freaking hurt my back pretty good the other day. I went down like a sack of hammers. Uh, the ki kids took my feet out from underneath me, and man, my back still kind of kind of tweaked. It's funny how uh, how that works out for you. All right, game word, yes, I 100%. Jerry, uh, if you like farming sim, any other farming sims, you'll like this one. This one's a great. This is a. There's nothing wrong with this one at all. This one is a fantastic addition, uh, and carries on farm the farm sim name for sure. It's a lot of fun. Um, loving this, by the way. This is so good to have base game these. Uh, these augers. Let me just fix this up now that I've messed it all up. Put this back in there. There we go. That's better. Perfect. Um, yeah, the augers are, are pretty good. They work fairly well. This one here, I think, might be missing the mark right now. Maybe just a little bit. It doesn't have to be perfect, but it has to be still... Like, this is probably right on the edge of, of actually working. They have to be pretty close. So you can just jump into it. Go down to go down to the motor here. Uh, just fire it up. And you should be able to quickly just spin it into place. There we go. And then, you, of course, you can move the uh, the baskets for these so they're they're closer. Um, I mean, ideally, what you'd want to do with, like, those the bins I'm using is slide these underneath once you've got it in place. But uh, for the sake of time, I just leave it out and try to get it as close as I can. And it usually works. All right. I don't have manual transmission on tonight. Uh, I usually do play with manual transmissions on, though. You do not have to use manual transmission. I'm on, it's, it's, uh, I'm on auto tonight. Okay. Um, so, beans. Beans, 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 beans. Soybeans. They're supposed to be, like, next month or two. We should see the price starting to bounce up. We'll see, chat. Let's go. 8 o'clock tomorrow. Yeah, the transmissions are pretty much are fully optional. Um, there, there's a clutch option as well, and the clutch option is fun to use. I mean, the clutch has got to use the clutch, right? So uh, it's fa it's you know what they did a knockout job with this stuff. I know I would have wouldn't have mind have seen manual attach be a base game option. Is that ready already? Is that ready already? Hang on a sec. Oh, it's barley. All right, we can harvest. Woo! Mm -mm -mm -mm. I didn't know we could harvest already. Let's get to harvesting. Harvests a go. Harvests a go go. I didn't think we'd be getting to harvest already. 
I thought that was another like, couple days away. Ooh, that's getting all marked up. Ah, good, 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 good. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, check your resolution. You should be able to update. You should be able to get 1080. Um, get out of the shed. Come on, please. Come on out. Come on out. Come on out. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Just slide it right on out of that shed. That's a tight barn to get out of, but we can do our... All right. No, you do not need a second. If you want to do a local server and have it up on another computer running all the time, you will. If you rent a server from G Portal, uh, the game is included on the, on that server. So for your monthly fee, whatever you end up being for size for for uh, for uh, mod space is how they really decide and how many how many slots they want or how many people you want to be able to have on the server at the same time. You can have from anywhere from four to I think sixteen, um, depending on how many people you want to have on the server. That's how they they choose the cost of it for you and how much mod space you want but the game is included with that so yeah you're, you're paying it with your part of your monthly fee all right there we go leave that there let's uh let's open this up while i'm thinking about it yeah giants editor came out today came out today uh i saw 82 82 Studio, the, the creator of the TLX, and as well, MRG Mapping. Uh, we're both digging into it today, and uh, it was fun to watch them, see the see them looking at some of the stuff, especially, uh, I know David's knowing quite a bit about what's going on in Farmson, but I think it was MRG's, like, first chance to really get into it. And to see his, like, his face on some of the stuff he found was pretty cool, actually. All right. I love the header trailers, by the way. Header trailers are way better. Um, it makes them actually usable in Farm Sim 22. Farm Sim 22 header trailers are usable. Don't hit my house. Don't hit my house. All right. Let's uh, fire this up. All right. Back in the barley harvest. Holy shnikes. That was quick. That was a quick year. And cruise control on. So wait. Oh, uh, I want this on. There we go. I'm gonna get some straw out of this as well. Make sure we get the straw. Make sure we're getting as much money as we possibly can out of this. Like the animation in the back here, guys. Look at that. Like that looks so good. That animation they do now for the uh, the swath and the straw. Way, 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 way better than it was before. Um, they've really upped the level on that. That was the first thing I noticed actually when the first time I fired up Farm Sim. Um, and you jump into uh, into a game because harvesting is the first thing you're ready to do and go and it looks so much better I swear they did a, they really knocked this out of the park I mean even look like down here like look at that this barley going in here that looks so much better and then you've got the all the effects that come out of the back it's way better uh, tough times with the monies yes but like I said, we're going to be selling some beans right away. Um, and then this is all going up to the mill. So we'll be uh, we'll be making money off the flour off the mill at some point. We better be because I spent 100 grand on that thing. Ah, oh, man, I don't know. I don't know if the mill is the way to go. I thought for sure the mill was going to be the one of the big money makers. And it seems like right now the money from the mill, like you, you could get the same prices almost for your grains. Uh, at least the wheat. I've seen the wheat at the same price as the mill was offering, so I don't know. So far, I'm a little bit... Uh, the say I'm disappointed would be, would be an understatement. Yeah, the mowed grass looks good. The one thing, like I said, I am a little disappointed with, with seasonal cycles, they didn't go with drying grass. So you can't dry grass from the sun. You still have to go and ted it. And also, it's kind of unrealistic, but you can immediately mow immediately ted and immediately turn that into hay bales uh which obviously is not how that really works you still have to wait and let things cure and you don't have to do that in farm sim i don't know why that wasn't implemented it seems kind of funny but maybe that's a precision farming thing that we have to wait for as well i don't know all right the mill does not have the monopoly no it definitely does not uh favorite favorite brand equipment i got no favorites uh anything but Stara. that's all i can say uh, yeah, I like the straw swath. Me too. Love it. Love the straw swath, the straw droppings. They all look really good. The, the ground textures as well. Uh, loving like the harvest texture we got going on even right here right now, right? That looks pretty good. 
You got the little lines in there for... I'm going to get this little tuft that's sitting there. The last little tuft. Let's go. Uh, I like the deer they've added in. I'm hoping that modders can add, like, different animals, too. Like, have, like, the chance of seeing, like, a moose or something. I don't know. Maybe some elk. I would just like to see some other animals possibly populating that thing. Uh, kind of the same idea, but maybe just not as frequent. I don't know. That'd be kind of cool. All of a sudden, you see, like, a moose roaming around through your farm. I'd, I would dig that. I would dig that. All right. Uh, PC setup. My PC is a it's a two year old PC now. Actually, I gotta re, I gotta do build a new one one of these days. Uh, it's a third. It's a Ryzen 3900X with a 2080 Ti, uh, 64 gigs of RAM. Not you, Moose. Wrong, Moose. You can come wander through my farm though. Oh, Doug Fry, we don't need ducks. We don't need no ducks. They're quackers. We don't need any ducks in here. We got enough ducks in the chat. Big boss wants a, a kangaroo in his Australian maps. <laughs> emus for life. No, no, we don't need any emus. Oh, bad. Talk to, uh, better go talk to GJ Modding about that. Maybe he'll, uh, he'll get something set up on, an, on his first map. I'm, I'm curious to see what he does. I mean, like he, he just released a map, really. <laughs> I'm curious to see what he does here. He's, he's been pushing out maps pretty fast and heavy lately. We'll see what he does here right away. Someone say ducks. Oh boy. Do we need to go duck hunting in the chat? I feel like we need to go duck hunting. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't have been this far over. It's okay. You know what? I'm not actually going to fill up before I get these fields done with barley. With wheat, we'd always be able to get these fields done, didn't we? And barley is um, more... It's usually denser. Huh. That's surprising. All right. Well, I'm not going to get this field done. We're going to have to empty this out before finishing it off. Uh, I'm going to go put this right into the silo. We'll, we'll, we'll dump this into the auger. Just keep it simple. Oh, yeah, Ray. Come on, Ray. Get those ducks. Get the ducks, Ray. And, like, I'm, I wouldn't... I'm not worried about getting a combine on this farm. This combine is actually pretty good. This is actually not bad for the size of our farm. But at some point, I mean, we could upgrade, but we're nowhere close to that right now. We're nowhere close. I'm going to run this one until it dies. Uh, let's open this on up. Let's see if we can get this into a nice spot here to dump it in there. Come on. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Don't. I missed it. I missed it. Should be able to just drop it right in that pan. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Right in the pan. And right up on top of the silo. Perfect. Like a glove. Uh, do you know how to put seed? Do you know how to put seed in the planter, Levi? Yes. For most of the planters in game, you just pull up beside a seed bag and hit the activation button on your joystick. It should be like pushed down on the left thumbstick. Uh, I think it's R on the keyboard. So you just drive up beside it and it should give you an activation to fill up. Some of the planters, you might have to open a lid or open a tarp type of action first. But I think all the base game stuff, you can just pull up beside it and it'll automatically open if it'll take it. I think all the base game stuff is like that. I haven't tried them all yet, but I know most of them are like that. The, the, I even think the Kinsey stuff is like that as well. I don't think you need to... Uh, I don't think you need to open anything to fill them up. I think they automatically open. As soon as you go back a seed bag, um, they should open up. Minnesota Railfan 11. Minnesota! What's going on, man? How you doing, buddy? Uh, Minnesota Rail fan. Cheers to you. Appreciate the dono, my friend. How are you? Hope you're doing well tonight. All right. We're still needing to get straw off this. That'll actually get us out of debt. So I'm kind of... I wouldn't mind doing that right off the bat here, chat. Yeah, let's do that. We're going to get out of debt so that I can hire workers at times when I need to. Um, so we can start running cart with the, with the combine. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, isn't it the C? <laughs> DJ Fox, I thought it was the C. It's not R, it's the C. Hey, Granny, how are you? Good to see you. We're doing well tonight. Hey, Scott, what's going on? Justin, happy Thanksgiving to you. What do you guys got planned for Thanksgiving? Are you guys getting together with family, friends? What do you guys got going on? Uh, I, I've got so much hockey this weekend, and we don't even have Thanksgiving in Canada. 
I got hockey for four days straight. And I've got me work stuff going on as well. Oh boy. It's gonna be so busy here for the next month. Alright. I hate just getting together with family nice. I hope you guys are getting I hope you guys are getting together with some family and some friends for Thanksgiving. It's it's the time of the year for that, right? Gotta see some fam. Go hang out with the fam. Oh yeah, fellow Canucker Michael, you know it, buddy. Yeah, no Thanksgiving up here, but I, I still try to take part a little bit. I do. I am a little envious of, of of American Thanksgiving, to be honest, guys. You guys do the Thanksgiving thing up big. Uh, I mean, us Canadians, we do it. We do. We still have a Thanksgiving. It's back in October, but it's not. It's not the like the American one. I, I tell you, I tells you, uh, I'm a little envious. The Americans, you guys know how to do Thanksgiving. That's something we could learn a little bit more of, I think. I think, we, I think us Canadians, we need some more family time with that stuff. I think we should do it more. I think we need to make it a bigger deal than it is right now. Because it seems like it's kind of, just kind of lackluster in Canada. Not that we don't do things, but I think we need to, we need to up it, up the ante a little bit. Uh, old Crazy old Granny, crazy welcome granny. to the crew. Cheers, Cheers to you. Appreciate you. Cheers, cheers to you. <laughs> You're awesome. Uh, speaking of which, how are uh, how's Australia doing? <laughs> Hope things are good down there. All right, let's stop that there. Let's let's go pick up. Ooh, that's not a good spot to park that. Let me move this out of the way. Let's just park this right there. There we go. Let me go grab a tractor and uh, let's pick that strop so we can get it out of debt. I want to get out of debt. I want to get out of debt. Uh, the Smurf Bandit. What's going on, man? How are you doing? Emu Wars. Uh, and that's be spending Christmas money. <laughs> uh, Doug, I, I can't make any promises, man. <laughs> Doug, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Doug. You, I, I'm, I'm kind. I'm kind of sorry, Doug. <laughs> Doug, I'm kind of sorry. Okay. Okay. I'm not. I'm not really sorry. Um, but good luck, Doug. I, I mean, I hope you have a great Thanksgiving, Doug. <laughs> Uh, back this on in. We got straw in here still. See, this is the one thing. Like, your crops don't degrade from rain anymore. I'm so used to playing with seasons where your crops are gone if uh, if it rains. Omar's from Australia as well. There we go. We got another Australian in the chat. You got you Aussies. You guys like your farm sim too, right? There's always Aussies in farm sim everywhere. I think, like... There's a large contingent of Aussies I met oh, right off the bat of what we'll started playing farm sim. Uh, let's Australia, drop this down, Australia. fire that up, and away we go. Okay, looks good. Uh, does the housing protect the vehicle from value? You know what? I haven't tested it enough to know for sure. Uh, I am just so built into doing that with seasons in farm sim that I always do it. I always put vehicles back in the shed so to keep them from being weathered. Um, I don't know if it I don't know if it does uh, in Farm Sim 22. They didn't say anything really about it. Uh, I'm just kind of I just how I play now. That's really a favor. Hey, buddy. And then favors from the Netherlands, too. That's right. <laughs> um, does anybody has anyone checked that at all? Has anyone read anything else that I haven't missed but, or that I've missed? But I don't know if, if parking them inside sheds helps keep uh, the maintenance costs down on vehicles or not in Farms 22. I know in 19 it was a thing. Uh, seasons seasons was a thing about that, right? I don't know. Just, I, I don't know. I don't know what to think of it. I would like to, uh, I'd like to think that it does, but it might not. I'm noticing like the maintenance bar is still getting hit really hard. Hey, Sarge. Oh yeah, New Zealand. Sorry. No, oh, ouch. Oh. Sarge, ouch, I'm sorry. <laughs> but there's some Aussies in here. That's what I'm saying too. <laughs> sorry, Sarge. Uh, that, I, I know that one hurts. I apologize. That's like calling Canadians Americans and Americans Canadians. That's, that's like what that is right there. I'm so sorry, Sarge. My bad. My bad. My bad. Totally my bad. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> uh, how many times have I done that before, though? Uh, there we go. And away we go. Favorite hockey team, Calgary Flames. Go Flames, go. Go Flames, go. Like calling Hawaiian Samoans. There we go. 
<laughs> I just do that to get under your skin now, though, Fluff. Come on, buddy. Uh, if you didn't know, um, a Fluff is from Hawaii. But um, he's known as our Samoan brother, even though... That's just... Yeah. It's, it's, it's become a joke now. I'm sorry, Fluff. That's just a thing now. I can't stop saying it now because that's all I can think about. You made it You made it a thing. I blame you for that, Fluff, just so you know. <laughs> all the time. All gra so sorry, Granny. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Um, uh, Sarge, do you know if is Big Daddy, is he, he's, he's Aussie, right? I think Big Daddy's Aussie, not New Zealander. I think. I get, I see, I get them, I get you guys confused all the time with this stuff, and I, I can never remember which one's which anymore. I think, I think Big Daddy's from, uh, from Oz, from what I remember. Please correct me if I'm wrong, because I don't want to be wrong again tonight. <laughs> is he UK? See, ah! is he, I thought he was Oz. <laughs> Uh, I, I lose track now. I never know who's from where anymore. I'm not bad. Oh, thanks, Sarge. <laughs> you know what? I could have figured. You know what? I, I, I should have figured. I, I never even thought about it. Since this has Sarge uh, NZ, you, you'd think that uh, with the big brain here, I could figure that out. You would think I would figure that out. Uh, dragon, well, there we go. I was thinking of Dragon. Dragon's from Oz. I, I you know what? I was. That's who I was thinking. And so is Big Boss. That's right. Big Boss is in here too tonight. So, um... I, that's who I was thinking of. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, man. You know what? I don't mind curling. I don't like watching curling, but I've played... I've curled quite a bit in my... Well, I played young when I was younger. Um, I, I even won a bond spiel. That's how, how down with curling I am. And if you don't know what a bond spiel is, it's just a curling tournament. That's all that is. Do you, like why, why why don't they call bonds why do they call them bonds spiels? Why do they do that? I've never thought about this before. Why do they call it curling bonds spiel? Why don't they just call it a tournament? I don't understand that now. Huh. Weird. That seems bizarre. That seems a little bit bizarre. Why would you call it a bond spiel and not uh huh. interesting. Seems like a seems kind of weird to me. All right, this should unload here. There we go. Thank you. Let's get out of debt, please. That Canadian is more confused. It's, curling is not confusing once you figure it out. There's not much. There's not many rules to it. You just sweep rocks and throw stones and try to be the closest one to the center. That's all there is really to it. There's a lot of strategy to it, but uh, the actual game itself is fairly straightforward. All right. Um, I'm going to pick up the rest of the straw that's on that field and we're going to bounce into the next field and keep on harvesting. Oh, we got, we got some cash now. We can actually hire, we can actually hire workers now. Oh yeah. I forgot to turn the beacons on. Beacons on. Beacon on. Uh, we better put our four ways on too, I guess. We're on the highway here. Clutch. Come on. All right. Uh, Justin, I am not good with telling you what kind of specs to get, especially right now because prices are all over the map. Uh, build my PC is probably a good place to start and uh, go with that is what I would do. Just try and figure that out. And I mean, there's a lot of there's a lot of options out there right now, but the fact that prices are all over the map because of the way the chip shortage is going, um, sometimes you might be better going with even like a pre-built potentially. It's tough to say, man. Gabe loves watching Girl at Nice. Uh, are they really? Are they going on right now? I didn't even know that the Olympic trials were going on right now. I know that the hockey, they're talking a lot about the hockey right now. Chris is missing the GPS. Yeah, me too, my friend. Take, take, I'll take a number on that one as well. Uh, do they have a senior curling league? Um, they got like men's leagues. Like usually every town's got like a junior league, a men's league, a ladies league, a mixed league, something like that. Um, there are some more competitive leagues out there, but it's not like we're hockey, baseball, football, anything like that. Let's put it that way. All right. All right, Oliver, have a good night, man. Thanks for hanging out with us for a bit tonight. Drop this in. Fire this bad boy back on up. Let's finish off uh, the straw on this, and we'll keep on harvesting. I'll just pick this up for the time being. Oh, let's get rid of that beacon. Turn that off. And all right. Um, we'll go down this way. We'll go down this way here first. 
another thing i need more i need another wagon i need like if i can get a second one of those wagons and just tow them in tandem i think that might be uh, a nice to have um either that or like something a lot bigger i also need a truck and trailer man guys i need so much stuff i need so much stuff i need so much stuff right now and i'm so freaking broke so freaking broke oh well harvest continues we'll get through it we got a tiny little field to go harvest and then we've got to move on the other side of the creek and we'll dive into those bigger fields all right uh there we go that's right canadian co-op <laughs> all right zip this around you know what the, the straw is not bad like okay so we spent like a hundred thousand dollars on this trailer i spent way too much money on this trailer guys um i kind of i don't regret it i was i could have waited though let's put it that way i should have i have a little bit of buyer's remorse i should have waited until one of these was on sale and not bought it for full price uh buying for full price was not a smart move by me i should have waited until one went on sale because like a hundred grand for one of these well it's good because i'm making a couple extra grand like every field we harvest right now man that, that's a lot of money to be put out so like we would be almost between like yeah this and the um the mill if i hadn't have bought those two things we would be pretty much out of debt right let me leave this right in the field here so i mean and both things i was planning on buying at some point mind you like i don't know if i was gonna buy this exact model but i had plans to buy the mill because that's the, the direction i wanted to go so i would have spent the money on that eventually but I could have waited on the straw. I could have just said, you know what? Not picked up straw, just plowed it or not plowed it under or just uh, just chopped it instead. I could have just done that, right? And then carried on. But I kind of wanted to, to, to get to test some stuff out. And so, um, well, here we are. Here we are. We're broke still and uh, oh, bashing into things. Let's go. Can I turn here? Can I turn sharp enough here? Yeah. All right. There we go. Are you solving problems downloading? What are you using the Giants? Uh, the Giants software? Or are you where are you getting your farms from? Easy. All right. Uh, that's not my field on the left, but this one on the right is. So let's see here. I'm going to just see if I can leave this like right here. We'll leave it right here. Turn this off. Let's go grab the combine. All right. Uh, we're on farm manager mode. So we're on the, the middle difficulty. Actually, before we go, let's dump this out. So I have a, a fresh tr a fresh bin. Yeah, we're everything's set on like medium for difficulty Newell, as far as that. Newell, what are you doing? And 69 cents. Newell. The buck 69. He comes in here with being all cool. Are you working tonight, Newell? You must be working, right? I think he's working every night almost right now. I think Newell's like working every night right now. There we go. Uh, the tr silence treatment, I have tried it. It seems to work as expected. Um, I didn't notice a huge increase. I think it's only like 5%, right? Uh, but I think for one of the cows, we had to do it. Are you on K-Bot's farm? Okay, we need. I need to jump in there is what you're saying. We need to do that tonight maybe. Maybe later on I'll jump in there. I'll keep on I'll make a farm on there at some point I'll come say hi you gonna be on later all right I'll, I'll see if I can jump on later too I'll see if I can jump on a little later uh big t farms buying rounds for the crew you know what it's a great time big t farms is buying rounds right before we jump into a harvest it's the best time to get rounds in you right right here right now big t let's do it let's go get some rounds let's go chat let's go Big T Farms. Oh, echo, echo, echo. Cheers, Big T. Appreciate you. Come on, guys. Let's go. Let's go. We don't got time to waste. We got harvesting to do. Get up here. Get that brown water. In. Hey, don't forget. We got the new merch. Huh? It's got it's got K, it's got Clutch and K-Bot's favorite sayings on it. Uh, Fluffy, nice work, buddy. You know what? It's pretty cool. It's a cool little shirt, actually. I really do dig it. Make sure you guys check down. I'll pin something. I'll pin it in a second. But anyways, new merch. We got some more stuff coming soon as well. But Big T Farms is buying around. Ah, oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get it. Get it in you. Get it in you.
Ah, oh, yeah, see? That one's yours. Let's go! Hey, let me see here. I've got the, I'll, I'll pin that thing. I think I can do that. I, I think that's something that Clutch can handle. Um, where is it? There we go. Boom. There we go. New merch. Couple ammo. All right. Uh, for me, downloading off the giant software. Downloading off software. Yeah. Um, I, I've I had some problems with my laptop downloading it yesterday. It wouldn't download yesterday on my laptop. I had the same kind of issues. Let's see. Uh, no multiplayer right now, Justin. No multiplayer right now, bud. Not right now. You know what? I I do all. You know what? Big T put in a big dono for for rounds. We do play some timeout. Let's play a quick game of timeout. Let's get Kbot back out here. He's being a bit of a jerk in the background. Just you know what, guys? Just take it easy on him. He's kind of ridiculous. Uh, let's go, Kbot. Let's go, Kbot. <laughs> that sounds like a new saying. That sounds like a new saying. What do you jabronis want? Are we not done this? Oh, come on, whatever. Let's just, I'm, I, you know what? I don't have time for this. I'm in a busy, I'm busy eating chicken nuggies. Let me just, uh, just start this here. There we go. Okay, let's go. Let's go, keyboard. Oh, wait. That's, that doesn't sound right when you say that. Why would you say that? That's, that's kind of mean. Isn't let's go, keyboard kind of mean, I think. I don't think you guys like that. Let's go, for Silo City. Remember, if you're the first one to chat after the exclamation mark, I'm gonna tell you. Let's go, it's Silo City. Uh, really, Big T? Big T Farm, why? Super chat is $2. You think, you think it's blog. cool? Just coming in, interrupting me when I'm talking? I don't do that to you. I don't do that to you. I don't come in talk in the middle of your thing. Let's go. Silo City in three. In two, don't you talk, chat. Don't do it. In one. It's time to see. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Who, is it? Who do I get this time? Who am I going to time out? Who's it going to be? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Rabbit Rob. Rabbit Rob. <laughs> get out of my chat. Get, no, no, no. You put the wrong mouth. You have to put in two exclamation parts if you want to play that game, Rabbit. Get out of my chat. Get out of my chat. You're down. You're down. Oh boy, Rabbit Rob, I'm sorry. Um, Rabbit Rob got timed out by Kbot. You know what? Kbot lost the last one, but he's two for one now. Uh, chat, better luck next time. Better luck next time. Let's keep on. Let's get in the harvest here, chat. Let's go. Like I said, you guys can harass Kbot all you want. He's a bit of a jerk. I have no problem with you guys giving him shots. Uh, just, but just watch out if Gertie gets out here. That's what you got to watch out for. You really got to watch out for that. All right, go. there we go. Uh, make sure you guys slap the like for di to dislike Kbot as well. If you want to slap the like, that's a dislike for Kbot. Just so you guys know. Dirk, don't even start. <laughs> Dirk's going to come in here and be like, oh, I'm, I'm disliking the stream. I dislike this immensely. Look at the colors in here. Like, look at this. We got a bluebird day. We got a nice yellow harvesting field going on. Big green, bright trees. The yellow New Holland. Uh, like this looks fantastic. Looks so good, Cole. Cheers to you, Cole. The video, smiley face. <laughs> Thank you so much, Cole. I appreciate you, man. Uh, is, hockey is my favorite sport. Yes, hockey is 100% my favorite sport. Let's go, Kbot. <laughs> uh, eating what? Are you eating Wendy's nuggies right now? Oh, bad. I'm, ra, ra, I, you know what? I feel ripped for Rabbit Rob. Uh, can I get an F in the chat for Rabbit Rob as well, by the way, guys? I feel bad. Um, one of the members got timed out. Ah, that sucks. Rabbit, I'm sorry. It, mm, I, I don't control the bot, guys. It's, you guys understand, right? This map is awesome, isn't it? Like, look at that building back there, too. That massive complex. That looks so cool. And then there's, like, one back there, too. I just... Ah, guys, it's such a good map. It's such a good map. Giants outdid themselves themselves with this map. Like this is, this is good. I guess eight people like Kbot. 
<laughs> Did we get eight dislikes? Oh, man. That's awesome. Uh, well, we know one's you, Dirk. We know one's you. We're getting the Fs in the chat for Rabbit Rob. I like that. I'm sorry, Rabbit. <laughs> oh, that's what happens. Uh, I, I used to play. I just coach right now. I coach youngsters. Um... I haven't played for five years, I guess now. Yeah, I just don't have the time anymore. I wish I did. Um, deer, where did that deer go? He like went to the, he just like went into the ground. Um, yeah, I used to play in a, in a work league, but uh, just a men's league or whatever we used to play. I just don't have time anymore, unfortunately. I would love to get back into it, but it was always like morning games. And when you got little ones that are going to school in the mornings, uh, the times no longer really work for me, unfortunately. I, I I do love playing hockey, though. Hockey is a lot of fun. It's a good time. I, the other problem was it was all the way across the city, the league I was in. So um, I'd have to drive like 45 minutes to get to the games in the morning. Get there, right, run through rush hour, uh, get to the game, and then drive home at like noon. And be like, ah, uh, just you, know, you always have a couple brown waters while you're there. And, uh, yeah, then you got to try to get home as well. And yeah, you can't have too many brown waters, of course. So anyways, uh, what age do I coach? Uh, under nine. So we got mostly seven and eight year olds. Most, actually, our team is, is the young team. So we got all the seven year olds for the most part. I think they're all seven on our team. All right. Keep on going. Oh, uh, you know what? Goalies are weird people. I think K-Bot might be a goalie. Uh, Ve Vector, welcome into the crew. Cheers, man. Appreciate ya. You guys know the drill. There you go, members. You guys know the drill. Welcome in the new member. Uh, cheers, man. Appreciate ya. Got a new member to the crew. All right. Look, like, look at these colors. They look so good. They look so darn good. Oh, man. Dude, I, I, I'm digging farm sim right now. I'm 22. It's fun. Yeah, it's if you guys haven't got it yet, of course, don't forget. Uh, link down in the description. You can use my code, and that helps us do more giveaways, hopefully at some point here. Uh, we'll be doing giveaways come whenever the new DLC comes out. So um, stay tuned for that. Of course, you can also get the one-year pass down there as well. If you want to get them all right now and save yourselves, probably like 20 bucks. I think it's like 28 bucks you save if you get the one-year pass still. So you can still get that up until I think the first DLC drops is the way they usually work it. I can't remember how that works, how they're doing it this year. But anyways, you can get that one year pass. That gets you all four DLCs. But uh, yeah, it's, it's cool, guys. It's uh, I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am. All right. Looks like he's been hit by a buck. <laughs> uh, Fluff, are you on the board to clean the shop up? Oh, now clean the shop. That's right. That is right. So new members. Uh, I, I really, I really hope v Victor knows this, but all the new members, you guys are on the board. So um, when you become a new member, you, you're, you're definitely up. I mean, you're kind of like the rookie. So you got to clean the shop tonight. And um, well, usually whoever's in the top list has to go take care of K-Bot and clean his little kitty litter up. So um, I hope you guys are aware of that. Just, just saying pass my respects on to k -Fog. Is Rabbit Rob... Rabbit, did you get... Are you done? Did you, are you out of the, the naughty corner yet? Rabbit Rob, are you still hanging out? Where's the bop? <laughs> See, that's the key right there. Um, You need to bring it or figure out something else because we don't... I can't provide those. We've tried to provide the mops and they just keep on getting damaged and soiled. It's more on the soiled side. More so on, on, the, on the soiled side. Just said. Have I tried Crokinole? Yes, I have. Crokinole's fun. My folks, they used to, we used to always play Crokinole at, uh, at Christmas time. It was like a big game. Uh, we'd always have little tournaments. I remember at friends and family's houses. I've got the old family board down in the basement. I haven't brought it out. I'm going to have to bring it out for Christmas. we got some friends and family going to be here. So, yeah, we're going to have to do it. Oh, yeah, there, bud. Get her done. <laughs> What's going on, buddy? Uh, I, let's see. Is it Al Alpina? What's going on, Alpina? How are you doing? Cheers. Appreciate you. Alpha Major. Oh, no. One no. Super chatted $1 is it Alpha? Is it Alpha Mojo? I thought it was Alpina. It said on my butt. I can't read that from here. Alpha. Appreciate you. Alpha Major. Cheers to you. I thought it said Alpina. I'm like, interesting name. Alpha Major. Welcome. Cheers, my friend. Definitely. Definitely, my friend. Uh, more deer. There, someone wanted to go hunting. Can There you go. I think we should be able to get coyotes, too. Like, coyotes should be a thing we should go after in farm sim, right? 
go empty go uh k by <laughs> knuckle puck uh yeah didn't even see it coming just flatten his face straight out <laughs> uh do you know why i will not download off the giant software I keep on giving it a shot emily it's they've got a lot of downloads going on right now i know that that's part of it uh, my laptop yesterday i was not able to download all day yesterday i was trying to get it i tried it like four times was not able to get it fully downloaded until later on so um persevere uh that's all i can really say um there's no other there's no reason it's not down their websites are up um things should work but i know it's a little slow at times depending on what time you're trying to download at all right go out hunting for the deers oh wait wait i gotta go finish off down there i didn't finish that section off i didn't finish that section off there we go rabbit rob boo came on <laughs> uh, he's back um i'm sorry rob i'm sorry that happened <laughs> for those that missed it rob got timed out by kbot um yeah see you're only gone for a couple minutes just so you know if you happen to get timed out that's that's kbot for you guys what happens if you hit the deer nothing you go right on through them they don't really exist they're just figments of your imagination all right kind of like kbot soul all right <laughs> it's all right clutch it's not your fault <laughs> All right, there we go. One more field to... Oh, did I not... Hang on a sec. I got one field. No, that's beans. I don't have the field in the corner. I didn't buy that one yet. I haven't owned that one. I paid to shoot pucks at game. Oh, there we go. That's... We, we need to find, come up with a mini game like that. How much is uh, Farms of 22? Isn't it 49 or is it 59? Uh, there is a link in that in the description. You can figure it out right there. It should tell you. Is it 49 or 59 American? I can't remember now. I was 49 at one point, I think. I know it's like 65 Canadian. So whatever that... What, how much Monopoly money is that for you guys? Yeah, I think off the site is a 49. Okay. It was 65. Every time when I bought copies for the giveaways, it was always like 65 bucks Canadian is what it ended up being. Bales do not rot. No, bales don't rot. So I actually don't mind the fact that the bales don't rot because like bailing and leaving them out on a field for the winter is normal. Um, I kind That kind of irked me a little bit in 2019 with seasons. The, the fact your bales would rot away right away. Like after the first rain, you would lose your whole bale. I kind of like the fact that they don't rot this time. But at the same time, like if you leave, I think if you leave the straw out like this and just in, in headlands or in rows, um, I think this should rot away. But if you bail them, I think it should stick around at least for a year. Was it 80 bucks for URC? Wow. Yeah, every copy I bought for the giveaway. Um, and just so you guys know, it was like all the donos and all the all the ad revenue and stuff that you guys sent to me is what went into that. Giants didn't give me copies to, uh, to give away. I know there were some people making comments in some of the videos afterwards that they couldn't believe how many copies Giants gave away. Giants didn't give away any of those copies. Uh, that was only solely what I did. That was just giveaways for the channel, for the support you guys give me. So um, I appreciate you guys. But we gave away those 22 copies, and they were each one was about I think it was 65 bucks is what they were. 65 Canadian. All right, that is done. Um, you know what? Let's hire. We'll hire a worker. We'll hire Gertie. I know we'll get, we're gonna get out of the trailer on this from this one here. Let's see. Should we take care of the back side or that side? We'll start at this side up here. All right. Easy. Oh, boy. Fit through there. All right. Uh, let me do a quick... I'm just going to see if I can get like a little headland down right here so that there's room. And then I'll hire Gertie to go start doing some uh, some full-length passes of this, this field. And we're going to go empty that trailer out. And then go bring that back and give her a hand because we're getting pretty full. We're getting pretty full. It's three in, in New Zealand. Nice. <laughs> uh, I hope she hasn't been. I hope she hasn't gone into the brown water today. She's going to have to drive the combine for a bit, but you know, a couple, a couple should be, she should be fine. All right. Uh, Mason, I'm in, Cal I'm in Calgary and I'm echoing and I'm repeating myself. All right. Pick this up. 
Spin it around without squishing my beans. Because nobody wants to squish their beans. You don't want squished beans. There we go. All the way down. Big boss wants more time out. <laughs> All right. Perfect. This should be good. Should be good right there. And now I should be able to send Gertie down to the far side and she can do her thing. 20% left in the, in the hopper here. Should be room for a little bit of room, a little bit of farming still. You should be okay. See. Not a lot of wheat though, guys. I don't know. Like what? I don't even, I didn't see how much we had there. Let's get this going. There we go. Let's go dump this out. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Dump this thing on out. 8,000 liters right now of, of, oh, it's barley. It's barley. That's why. That's why it's barley. Okay. That's a little bit different. Oh, easy. So the barley goes further when you're making it into flour. You get a lot more flour for less, you get more flour for less barley. So that's kind of a good sign. And like I said, to dump it into this, you should technically probably like go in the back and, re and dump this off the rear. Um, if you want to do this the proper way, but I don't like trying to back these trailers up. Let's see. There it is. And dump. So I just dump it in like this. And like you said, you could slide that pan right underneath there if you really wanted to, but it does work fairly decently. You just get close enough and it does work. Um, it's not realistic looking, but it is what it is. If you're in a hurry and you got to do it. Yeah, you're good to go. Ah, Gertie's full. Gertie's already full. I can't get the shot of that. There it is. There you go. You can see the green going up there. All right, let's go. We're going to get caught up with Gertie. Let's go get caught up with Gertie chat. <laughs> Let's go this way here. Uh, beacon on. No cars, hopefully. <laughs> uh, oh, she didn't get spun around. She didn't get spun around. That sucks. Okay, pull up the spinner. We'll have to do it. I was hoping they would have made like what course play did. So if you guys played with course play at all, um, the worker would like when it got to 95%. It would automatically make a spin. Super chatted four dollars uh, and Diesel, cheers, my friend. That's in that red shed. Actually, have lights in them. Yeah, they do. I think they turn on only at night, though. There's, I didn't. I've never found a light switch in there. Um, appreciate that, Diesel. We'll play some time out here in a sec, guys. I was hoping that the workers would actually do what what course play did. Oops. Like when you were set like this, they would. Like it wouldn't be that difficult to program. I don't think would it. Where you'd have. It gets to an, if it's if it's um, if the pipe's on the wrong side, it would know that, and it would automatically do like a, a just a little flip around to make space for for your trailer to pull in. Like, I think that. Bad boy, what's going on, man? How are you? Uh, find a buy a new shirt. <laughs> Come on, Pull, empty out. Empty on out. Oh, we're not gonna. It's right. It takes it takes more than I can fit. All right, we'll, t we'll set Gertie back on our way here. But anyways, I was hoping it would do like a little loopy he loopy loop here. That's what I was really hoping for. Um, it's funny. So the beacons right now are on on the combine, but I didn't turn them on. So my beacon's not working. I could turn the beacon off and then back on. And now the beacon works. Kind of strange. Um, if I don't turn the beacon on, it doesn't activate automatically kind of weird all right looks good where is it there she is let's go let's see i've got these i turned these beacons on uh so they are on just bizarre the way that works out well we'll just cut through right here we'll just, oh did i not do this little field here i meant to do this field too and i forgot about it this tiny little field that we have like two passes on that would have been nice to do that there would have been nice uh let's see here which is what i need to move this over that side there. We gotta move the sides. Uh, LTH, I am loving Farm Sim 22, man. Farm Sim 22 is a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I gotta build a farm uh, relatively soon and do like really work through the build mode a lot and see what we can, what, what kind of ideas we can come up with. Let's see. Can we get this close? There we go. Dumpy dumps. 
Uh, K-Bot just went to jail. What did K-Bot do? What did K-Bot do? He didn't do anything, did he? He's just being himself, guys. He's just being himself. Remember, you got to slap the like if you hate K-Bot right there. Oh, boy. Well, that's going to fix something for us. Mm -mm -mm. All right. Resale room with a $50 dono. Oh, boy. Dude, you're nuts. You are crazy with the big $50 dono resale. Appreciate you. Um, guys, you know what that means. Well, let's head out some rounds first. Let's go. Resale, you crazy man. Cheers to you, buddy. Come on, folks. Get on up here. It's another round. Another one. Let's, uh... Let's do this. Let's see if we can do that one. Oh, hey, where's my, where'd it go? Where'd it go? I had one here. It was, I swear it was here. It was, it's gone. Resale, appreciate ya. Let's go fry a bot, shall we? We got somebody to fry. I know you guys are going to like this. Let's go, resale. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Well. Um, you know what? It's easy if we just do it this way, right? It's like we keep it under wraps. We just kind of move things along and uh, we make the bot disappear for a couple minutes. So uh, appreciate your resale. Hey, hey K-Bot, I think resale's got some, some something you want to have here. I, I think he's got a present for you. You know what? We're, everyone's getting ready for Thanksgiving weekend. And I think the biggest turkey of them all really is K-Bot. So, um... Maybe we're gonna get started with an early feast. I think we gotta fry somebody. Resale, this one's for you, buddy. Oh, that felt good. That felt so good. Um, he left in a little bit of a hissy fit there. He uh, he threw some stuff at me. It almost made me fall on my face. Truth be told, I, he's not happy. <laughs> uh, resale with a big $50 dono. Um, okay, well, you're, you're gone, buddy. Get out of the chat for your, for the next little bit, at least. We'll see you back in five minutes. You guys got five minutes apiece. No K-Bot. Five minutes apiece without the bot. Use it wisely. <laughs> uh, let's go. Uh, there we go. Oh, boy. You know what? Like, this face, where is it? Right here. Kind of sums it up perfectly. I feel like I, I need to make it so I can, like, flick his head. I want to be able to flick it and have him, like, move around somehow. Uh, is there a way? I need to find a way to do that. If I can, like, give him a flick and have his head bounce around. How can we do that? Let me think about that for a second. I think I can make that happen. Yeah, I think that's it. I think I can, like, give it a flick maybe somehow or smack it. And then it would, it would, it'll move. Hmm. Something to think about. Something I got to figure out. Something else. Something new. Something new. I love this little 6M tractor. I'm having a blast with this thing. Um, the maintenance on it uh, could be done. Uh, we've only got seven hours on it. And it's almost like, is the maintenance like a 10 hour thing? I wonder if it's set to that. Like every 10 hours, you've got to do maintenance on your combo, on your equipment, maybe? Hey, what? What? Why, why did you miss a... You missed some. Uh, once again, we got the Gertie strip, guys. We've got the Gertie strip right down the middle. Of course we do. What? Why? Why? Oh, well, it's just one. But still. It's just one. A, a K-Bot bubblehead. <laughs> I've already got one right here, Sarge. Right here. Like I said, I want to be able to like give this one like a flick, or maybe like smack it, and we could have, we could have it like move around and do something. Um, they're full. Well, like the beacons weren't even on on that thing. They weren't even on. They weren't even on. All right. 
back the sun up. Yeah, worker stop manually. I know, I stopped it. There we go. It'd be nice if I could actually get it to uh, to stop at the right spot. You still are at the bar this morning. <laughs> so what was she just doing? Like the walk of shame home, my age? <laughs> I saw her at the bar this morning. Oh, man. Yeah, she was just walking home. That's all. <laughs> uh, let's go. Let me out that. See, I need a bigger, I need a, more wagons or a bigger wagon. But this wagon is like half the price of any other wagons in the game. Um, it's tough not to go with that for your starting one. Just saying, it's such a good price. But it's, it's a little on the small side and we're outgrowing it. So, I mean, I've got so many things I want to buy here, but um, I don't know what to buy first. Like what, chat, what would you guys buy first? What do you guys think? Like we could use a truck and trailer. Uh, I need a bigger wagon. Uh, I don't have a planter. I only, I've only got the cedar. Uh, what else is there things I want to buy? Um, I mean, those are like, that's probably the tops of my list right there. Uh, let's see if I can sneak through this way here. Does it go up to 18? I just have to put an extension on it. I didn't know that off the top of my head. Maybe I should put the extension on that thing. Just pay for that. And then that'll get us a little bit more, right? Uh, that's the other problem. Our, we don't have a repair bay at our, at our farm either. So I can't do that at the farm. I, which isn't... I mean, it's not that far to go down the, the street. I wouldn't mind having it right at the farm, though. I, that's something I'd like to have at some point. Um, yeah, still, like, I'd like to have the bakery as well. I'd like to own that if we could. And so we could start doing more than just do something else with our flour, right? Uh, let's see here. Which side am I on? So you can tell if you go interior view... And look at the handle. You can tell which way it's going to dump here. That center off the back, and that should be the right side. Now, we should be able to dump it that way now. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. Is that not activating? Really? Should be right that way. Should be right there. Feel like this should activate. Really? Really? Am I not getting it? How am I not getting the activation on this? Wait a minute. Hang on a sec. Did I bump that? Like that's right on there. Let's just see if this has to be changed a little bit. Maybe I bumped it. Maybe I bumped this a little bit here and that's our problem. Set that so it's better. That looks pretty darn close. That's got to be close enough. I still can't dump this in. Why can't I dump this in? What am I missing here? Uh, let's see. I want to go left side. Yeah, that should work. I'm close enough. I can't get any closer. It started working. It's like it's there. It's just having a fight to get in there. Hang on a sec. Uh, let's see. I bring it this way. I should see it. I can't believe this isn't activating. Why is this not activating? Let's see if I can bring it around the corner and go right into it. Like, now I feel like I'm too far away, of course. Oh, I got the loader arm selected. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. So it was working. And then I was just, just a, like, I must have been just off. There we go. Thanks. I had the lower arm selected. That makes a lot more sense. There we go. I was like, I know it's there. I can see it. It's looking perfect. Uh, the silo holds like 800,000 liters and we're nowhere close to that. Like, what are we at here? Yeah. So we're not even at 50. We're not even at 50,000 liters. Now, I would like to do this differently so that we make it so eventually each silo only holds one type of grain. Um, and like, if you want to bump the realism up a little bit with that, I think that's the way we should be doing it, right? Um, ideally, but you, you need space for that. You would need to, and I think I'll, I'll end up doing that really, really quite quickly here. Uh, maybe not in this playthrough, but I think that's how I'll end up doing things. Actually make it so it's somewhat realistic with those bins. 
and you actually fill only fill what you can and in realistically into the bin instead of having absolutely everything going into a bin that doesn't make any sense right space and money that's just it right but i mean if you okay so if you focus on two crops like we're really we're focusing on either wheat or barley plus uh beans right now so you have two maybe three bins that's that's kind of realistic that's not that that's not that far-fetched right that wouldn't be that difficult to do um now you would have to get some big harvests going on too to make it worthwhile of course but let's see yeah zap it down get that up to five who's on there we go no 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 gimme 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 go 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 there we go there we go now we're now we're cooking with gas uh i think that's per i think that that is per on that one i haven't double checked it but i'm pretty sure it's per that seems like it could it should it usually is but uh i don't know if anyone else has tested it or not i thought it was per per uh grain or per crop you could put eight hundred thousand in total or for each one kbot's always mad uh system they yeah exactly like i mean if you have a if you buy one of the go with one of the bigger silo systems it makes sense to be able to put a bunch of different crops in but when you're just doing like the single bins i think they should be make it realistic in that sense oh that's, i want to harvest all this still there's still quite a bit here let's not crush it all uh, i'm sure cecil i am sure you will see a welker's farm update map um really like that's gonna happen for sure yeah resale i think he's mad at you <laughs> i think resales t yeah he's it's we'll just have to blame resale for that that's all just blame resale all right nice and close let's see if it works first time this time come on there we go thank you barley in yeah resale you seem pretty disappointed that uh i'm hoping for county line i want to see county line get updated i want to see someone do an f4x of county line actually is what i'd like to see love county line over we go no force feedback isn't working for me either i thought it was just me i didn't know if it wasn't working for everybody but it's definitely not working for me uh so lincoln creek um yeah you're not gonna see anything from mrg doing lincoln creek so lincoln creek he said that's the one like, i don't know if that one is specific but all his maps uh, are up for grabs if anyone wants to do an update to farms to 22 with any of those maps from mrg he says uh contact him he is okay with it um but uh yeah he's willing to let people update all his maps for 22. midwest horizon as well yeah that's a map i haven't played much lately for such a long time for console force feedback is working there you go so that's one one benefit of console right there right it's working for console but it doesn't work for pc apparently at least it doesn't work for me all right come on let's go gertie last pass it looks like last pass and uh that is oh maybe not she's, oh she's missing like the last little bit that sucks that sucks um there we go there we go is it it's not working for you either okay yeah it's not working for me pete I've got an issue with my wheel where it always defaults to like really difficult strength, like strong arm. It feels like you've got no power steering in anything you drive in farm sim. Uh, it defaults to like the hardest difficulty from Logitech and I've only got it set to like 10%, but I have to go into Logitech app every time, uh, mess with the, the sensitivity or the strength of it and then set re and it resets it right away. So I did that at the start of the stream. You saw me go into Logitech and mess with it. It's kind of annoying. Like it just, it's its one extra step that I don't think I should have to do. Every time I want to play Farm Sim, I've got to go and fire that thing up and, and make sure it's changed over. And like <sighs> using a tractor with that kind of like strong arm uh, power steering sucks. Like it should be like this. I can just kind of whip the wheel around for the most part. And it has some centering force, but not a lot. All right, zip it around the corner. 
Oh boy. Nick Wolf. Oh, you guys are going to fry the keyboard again. Nick Wolf wants me to fry the bot. Oh, Nick, what are you doing? <laughs> Let me go drop this off, Nick. Nick, cheers to you with a big $50 dono. Nick, dude, you're, you're crazy, man. Uh, appreciate you, Nick. Nick, huge supporter of the channel. Uh, as always, man, seriously, you are, you're here all the time doing this kind of stuff, and I appreciate you, man. I, I appreciate you. Uh, guys, let's go get some rounds. These ones are on Nick. Appreciate you, buddy. Oh, boy. Nick Wolf. Cheers, man. Um, that's second fry him in a row. Resale room as well was in here. Frying him. Nick Wolf's here now. Fry him. Let's... Nick, you're nuts, man. Uh, let's see if we can do this. Let's see if I can pass this one out better this time. Ready? Oh, see? There we go. We got it that time. Cheers, Nick. Come on, guys. Let's go. Get that brown water in ya. Get it in ya. Let's go. time for you talking is kind of done i think you've done enough talking for one night oh boy let's stretch that out a little bit whose back is still sore nick uh cheers to you nick um it's button time i think it's button time cheers to nick wolf twice in a row we're doing this uh nick wolf resale room cheers to you as well man but uh this one's for nick wolf you know what i don't feel bad anymore this is just getting fun now uh let's count it down in three in two, in one. Oh, I'm so sorry, k -Bot. That hurt. That hurt. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. That was weird. Um, <laughs> Cheers, bad. Cheers, Nick. Uh, where is the little bugger? Where is he? k -Bot, get get back here. Come here. Quit hiding always trying to hide from everybody always trying to hide i can't even find him there he is we got him we got him get get out of the chat get out of the chat oh boy anyways <laughs> uh, let's bounce in let's get going uh next time in the game a game ghosts and leaves trails yes ryan mine does too um, it's part of the new NVIDIA update and I'm not sure why it's doing it, but mine does it as well. You get like these like laser streaks around the farms. Um, oh, that guy's done, isn't he? You know, what? we can probably leave this right here for now and go get that combine. Yeah, it leaves like laser trails from the cars, right? Mine does the same thing. I never farm at night though, to be perfectly honest. I will, you're not going to find me farming at night, so, um, it's never usually a problem for me. It's like, yeah, it's a thing. Oh, whoa, look at that. That's, that's rough. Woo. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we got to go down this way. This way, this way, this way. Let's finish this off. There we go. There we go. Ah, perfect. Okay, well, walk the green mile. You know what? I keep on... Oh, there's something I can plan for that. I got to take care of that right away. I got to take care of that at some point. Hello, Wesley. Welcome in. All right, I'll just get this last little bit here. And that is, oh, no, 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 that's not it for the harvest. We got one more thing to harvest still. We got one more part to go harvest. One more thing to go harvest tonight. Stephanie's saying, oh, no, what, what are you oh, no one about? What are you oh, no one? 16 hours straight diesel? <laughs> uh, I've got a lot of hours. Like I'm probably pushing 60 hours already in here. Um, but 
<laughs> Man, I, I don't think I've played for that many hours straight, that's for sure. All right, let's go. Zip it around. Back, back over to the farm. And we'll get that last little field. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. You, my kids sing that all the time. You have no idea, Newell. You have no idea. All right. In we go. In we go. Through the crick. Through the crick. Uh, Brody. Cheers, my friend. With a $5 dono. We played some time out, but um, while well, somebody has been, uh, well, zapped. Uh, I appreciate you, Brody, with the big $5 dono coming in here. You're awesome, my friend. All right. I, I knew he was gone. I was just testing. <laughs> oh, bad. I don't know if I believe you. I don't, I don't think I believe you. I don't think I believe you. You know things. Yep. I, I don't know if I believe you, Newell. <laughs> I don't know if I believe Newell, chat. the tiniest little field that is super awkward so this field once again uh if you guys were here for like the first couple streams when we were doing the pre stream the pre-release uh i turned this into part of my farm and that'll be my plan again like this here land is just i want to use this for actual sheds uh for storage probably like a workshop but until i have the money to do that kind of stuff then this field's gonna be i'll, I'll keep on harvesting at least it's some more it's some more field land right but it's just it's small. It's a pain. It's not a lot of stuff. Don't question my smarts. Granny's still hanging out in there giving Newell shots as well. Nice. I like it. All right. In we go. 20 hours so far. Nice. So I've got the Giants version. I don't know if there's a way to get Steam to recognize all the other, like the achievement parts. I don't think that's all. It doesn't see that, does it? You have to add that as external, I think. Uh-oh, Newell's, uh -oh, Newell's getting fired up. Newell's getting fired up. Uh, can K-Bucky was a devil when he's back? <laughs> uh, maybe. Maybe he can. <laughs> oh, maybe. <laughs> uh, I think he probably he's probably done it a few times tonight after getting zapped. Oh... Uh. Yeah, I, I, I added it to my Steam library as well, Newell, and I, I it's it says, like, Farming Simulator 2022 instead of Farm Sim 22. It's kind of weird. And I, you just get, like, a launching spot. You don't get the whole thing, which is unfortunate. Um, I mean, it's not the end of the world, but um, you don't get all the fun other stuff that Steam has, unfortunately. <laughs> okay. Can I get the whole thing? The whole shebang here. Perfect. It ended up it ended up perfect for once. We get it all. We want it all. We're getting it all. I <laughs> just said, Alpha, you're not wrong. Um, we did tr test it out tonight just to see where it was because I haven't I installed it, but I've never even never bothered putting it in. Um, on our other playthrough, we just went into the, the game XML and added uh, 90 million dollars into the account. So. That's the other way to do it, right? You can go into your game XML and just add money in as you wish. But uh, like I said, I'm trying to play this kind of like a new playthrough. Uh, this is like the, the real playthrough for me right now. What this save here, we're in year start. Well, yeah, we're year three now. We're done three years as of next next month, two months from now. And uh, I want to just play this like I normally would play Farm Sim if I was, wasn't was necessarily streaming or making content and just playing Farm Sim, really. Just seeing what the uh, the, the best way to do things are. Like I said, actually, you know what? We haven't checked something today. Let's see here. There's one thing we did not check today. Ugh, forestry equipment. Now this, though, the multi-pack. Because I could buy that cheap little baler uh, and then stack them with that and make the big bales, right? Because that baler is usually going for fairly cheap. Where's the baling technology? Like 22 grand. You could buy this little massy baler and then get the stacker that's on sale for only 30 grand so that's 50 grand you're into it now but you get the good bales with that at least that would be all right that would be that'd be kind of a cool option uh how much is the regular baler just out of do i have an idea here uh baler's 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 
Yeah, because otherwise, like, if you want to get up into a decent baler, you're going to be 150 grand, like, for that. This is the big baler, right? Anything here that can change the sizes? Oh, boy. Versus that? Yeah, so that might be, a, like, that would be a, a better way of doing things, potentially, and save some cash. Save a little bit of cash. All right, drop that. Okay. Uh, there we go. We got that harvest done. Let's put this on the trailer again. something like that drop that and drop love the new the new header trailers by the way so good so much better they don't have a problem anymore grab this a little bit further there we go all right let's give this thing a quick spray down a quick rinse off just a little quick bath and I'll put it back in the shed for the day. I like this too. So if you use the pressure washer and you get too far away, it just automatically shuts off. Now you don't get stuck. Like you can just walk away from it if you want uh, in order to get done. So right now it's like, yeah, three meters, one meter. If I keep going, it's going to just shut off and uh, retract the hose from me. Keep on rinsing this so you don't need to go back to the call or to the the pressure washer now to return it you can just walk away from it and eventually it'll just zap back there we go that looks good and four three two one gonzos i like that that's kind of a cool way of doing it um i like it better than the old way that's for sure all right let's get out of here zip through this field and through the barn put this back away for now it's a tight squeeze into the barn folks i need to suck it in suck it in suck it in they couldn't have made this barn like another like five feet bigger right eh? they had to, to make it that small just to test everybody's patience and like it barely fits in there it barely fits in perfect all right leave that there combine is uh into its home for the time being out of the way i don't know what else to store here from now but it's it does its job all right zoo shiny 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 uh let's put this let's sell this all off started yeah we're started okay sell off this wheat or put this wheat in our bin for now actually you know what we'll probably truck this up right away um We'll just fill this up with uh, with Barty right now. We're ready to go. We'll be ready to go because I'm going to start making lo loads up to the mill in a bit here. Boom. Love it. Works so good. I love the system. These augers work so good for the most part. I don't. I rarely have problems with them except for when I'm dumb and selecting the wrong object. But they all seem to work pretty good. Oh, we can shut that off now. Let's get some straw and make a bit of cash back so we can be good. So many jokes, so little time. <laughs> was there phrasing again tonight? Well, I wasn't doing phrasing, was I? I don't think I was phrasing at all. Doesn't sound like me at all. Doesn't sound like something I would do. Uh, did I drop that? I did too, okay. All right. Uh, have I went down to that room in the basement? Yes, I have. <laughs> the, the mean mystery plant. Yeah, I've gone down to the basement. <laughs> I've been down to the basement. Uh, Tony! What's going on, Tony? Hope you're doing well, man. Comes in with a $5 dono. Appreciate you. Happy Thanksgiving to you as well. Uh, appreciate you, Tony. We've been chatting about turkeys and chicken nuggies all night tonight, man. Um, oh, yeah. Speaking of which, um, there may not be a Farm Sim show this week. Just a heads up. Um, as much as I want to do one, because it's too much fun. Uh, DJ's got plans on the weekend, of course, with Thanksgiving going on. Uh, and I am booked up on Friday completely. So I think we're going to be skipping this week for Farm Sim Show. It doesn't sound like it's going to happen. Unless we can do it on Thursday for some reason. But I don't think there's reason really quite yet to dive into, into the Farm Sim Show on Thursday. We don't have... There's not a lot of new mods to talk about, of course, yet. And uh, yeah, I mean, 19 is is what it is. We've talked a lot. We talked all about it last week, of course. So 
Um, I think we'll maybe hold off this week. We'll see. We'll see if DJ has other plans, but that's kind of where I'm at, at least right now. Oops. Wrong button. Turn my beacon on. Turn my beacon on. Ah, dear. Dear. Come back here. Come back here, you little bugger. Get him. Get him. Oh, you're running the wrong way. You're running the wrong way. You can't get away from me now. We got you this time. Where is he? No. No. Ah. That close. Almost had him. Almost had him. We almost had him. What's, what? Me and the mystery meat. What are you talking about, Cecil? I don't, I don't have any mystery meat. Sniper. Hey, Sniper. What's going on with the turkeys in there? I like it. I need like a gobble, gobble, gobble um, sound effect. We're running over the deer with the deer. Trying. I failed. I failed. I, I was I was going for turkey nuggies. That's what I was going for, Newell. We were trying to get some turkey nuggies there, and I couldn't get them. Couldn't catch them. All right. Straw inbound. More and more straw. Okay. I want to check the prices for straw, because I think I could sell them someplace else. Can I? I think straw can be sold in two places on this map. Could be wrong. I thought there was a second spot, though, other than just the animal dealer. I just wonder if I can get more money for straw someplace else. Just wonder if there's anything else. Uh, so much more. Nice. Uh, collection minister for free. For free. Uh, what do you mean for free? Beckner, what do you mean for free? What am I doing for free? I'm confused. What am I doing for free? What did I say? What did I just say for free? I don't even know what I said for free now. Uh, where's our straw? Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. No, straw. Straw, straw, straw. Uh, show current prices. South biomass energy. So can I sell directly to this or do I have to buy the biomass energy? I don't know about this yet. I, I thought I had to buy that. Well, let's take a look. See if I can sell there. How far away is it? Let's go see. Let's go see. Let's go see. Let's go see. We're going on a trip. We're going on a trip. We're going on a trip. Beacons on. I, I, I think like free. I don't have to buy it. Do I think I can buy it? I can sell it for free. I don't, I'm not sell it, but I can sell it. Can I? Oh, that was meant for Kbot. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Let's go for it. We're going for a trip in our favorite rocket ship. It's a long ways away, though. That's all the way down there. I haven't sold down here before. Let's go. <laughs> now I got the moderator singing. Great. I got all you jabronis singing. <laughs> Later. Oh, man. Great. I don't know what I expected, mind you. There's a lake right there. I could have got water out of that. That's where the lake is. All right. Thanks, Sarge. I wasn't sure. I haven't tried to sell at the biomass plant yet. That's a longer ways away, though. That's for sure. I'm going for it. Where's the other water tower? Can you not see the water tower from here? I guess not. There's one there. I thought there was... Oh, I thought there was one behind us that you could see. I can't see it. I can't see it. <laughs> uh, you want the beacon off, chair? Beacon off. Beacon's off. It's giving me one, too. It's so bright. This beacon, like, the way it flashes, it's kind of... Like, when you use it on this tractor... The other way, it's not so bad. But this tractor here, the beacon goes crazy. That, it just goes nuts. Uh, let's see. Uh, how do I get up there? Where's the road go? That's a farm down here. I kept meant to buy that one. Chicken nuggies have magically appeared on the on your desk. Really? Why don't I get chicken nuggies? Oh man, I need some nuggies tonight. We had I had Wendy's I think tonight actually. Speaking of which, eh, it was okay. It was a rush. Rush to eat dinner in time so I could be here. All right, in the biomass plant. Um, just so you know, there is some collectibles in here that I have found. Um, I've already taken them out, so you guys won't find them. I'm just gonna say there's some ladders. Find some ladders, and once you find the ladders, you might be able to find the. The collectibles. 
Oh, you just dump it on the ground? Is that all you do? You just dump it on the ground here? Really? Okay. You just dump it on the ground here. That's kind of weird. Kind of a strange spot to sell. Uh, kind of a weird way to sell this stuff. But hey, what am I? Who am I to judge, right? Who am I to judge? Just dump it on the ground, and it magically disappears. That's kind of weird. Kind of strange. <laughs> the load of potatoes. Oh no. I don't like that. I didn't know that's where the sell point was. Like it should have a proper, a proper dumps location. Um, that's kind of dumb. Not really liking that. Yeah, I don't like that at all. That's kind of dumb. But whatever. <laughs> you just drove your tractor to the river. Uh, that sucks. <laughs> Uh, did you hit the water break or no? Did, did the water crash it? Did you have to reset it? All right. I might see if I can cut through uh, one of these spots to go the quick way. Okay, I can, should be able to follow. If I get on the other side of the tracks, I should be able to sneak through and go the quick way. But I got to be on the other side of the tracks. Jump. Jump it. All right, there we go. And let's see if I can sneak through here. There we go. We're just gonna sneak down, follow the tracks. No one will know. No one's gonna, no one will know. How will they know? They'll know, they won't know. How would they know? Oh, there's a big ditch here. Uh, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. That just goes underneath. Is there any collectibles underneath this? I just wanna see if there's any collectibles. Make some cash. Any collectibles in here? No, no collectibles. Oh, collectibles! Oh, <gasps> lots of collectibles! Lots of collectibles. Uh, I'm grabbing some collectibles. I'm grabbing some collectibles. Nice. I like that. Easy money. Easy money. Nice. There you go. So we just got some extra money for you right there. You guys didn't see that. You guys didn't see that. Just uh, don't worry about it. Don't worry about a thing. Don't worry about a thing. <laughs> They're going to know. They're not going to know. How would they know? How would they know, Newell? How would they know? Oh, wait. The collectibles are gone now. That's how they might know. That's how they might know. Um, I'm going to take the road. This is getting a little toit. This is getting a little toit. There's the field I need to get to. It's a bit of a rigmarole to get down to that, that, that biomass plant. I'm not going to lie. It's a bit more of a rigmarole. <laughs> Big boss. Yes, we did. No, you didn't. You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. Over the bridge. Hang on a sec. I'm going to check. Is there collectibles under the bridge? Nope. No collectibles this time. Wasn't sure. They're all over the place. They're all over the place. I might have already got those ones. I've already might have got those ones, but uh, you got to check. You got to catch them all. Wait, that's the wrong game. That is totally the wrong game. That there would be the wrong game. I might check that bridge too, actually. I haven't even checked that one. All right. Drop that. Drop that. And away we go. Farm sim go. <laughs> oh, deers are back. We got the deer back again. I like when you spray the pesticide or the uh, the herbicide, I mean, and the fertilizer, and they don't seem to notice it, and they uh, you can shower them with it. They gone. They gone. <laughs> Wrong game, but the recent one makes it awesome. Uh, home from school. Did you miss anything? Ah, just some, just some farming, man. Just some farming. <laughs> you, you never would have saw me pick up those collectibles. I would never go out into the wilderness and steal kids stuffies that are hidden everywhere around the area for some reason. No, that's not something I would do. Not something I would do at all. Is there shampoo? 
What do you, what do you want shampoo for? For washing the deer? Is that what you want the shampoo for? You want to wash the deer up? Uh, there's... Is there no collectibles on it? Really? Or did you find them all already? Did you find them all already, Duel? Is that what you did? Hey, Farson G, what's going on, man? Still waiting for someone to mod in-game max so they're actually... Oh, boy. Did I miss a whole bunch there? I did, too. Whatever. I missed a whole bunch. Uh... Like someone stole them. I don't know who. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> I blame pancakes. Whatever they're waffles. Whatever waffles. <laughs> yeah, the trucks are a little weak sauce. I don't quite understand uh, some of the uh, the traction problems that go on there. I don't understand what's going on. I know 82's actually been looking at that as well. He, he did something with some of them. But uh, hopefully they can get that patched. Because it's kind of weird, right? Especially like, okay, the truck right at the shop. You hire somebody right at the shop and they can't move. Like the truck will just stall out or it won't be able to uh, get any traction to leave the purchase point. It's so ridiculous. Like hopefully that's one thing that gets fixed. Yeah, it gets stuck all the time. You got to have it close to a tractor, that's for sure. Or just carry a, a trailer with a, a front end loader with it all the time. So if it does get stuck, you've got uh, means of moving it all the time. A splitter, I agree. A splitter would be fantastic, wouldn't it? Yeah, if there was a splitter option in the menu, I think I would buy a, a, a splitter, like for American Truck Sim even, like one of the switchers. But they're like $200 Canadian. They're expensive. But that would be worthwhile to buy it then if it actually had a splitter. If you got stuck to a new U-turn with an empty trailer. <laughs> that's uh, that's kind of impressive, actually. All right, 5% left. Can I finish this field and then go sell this? I don't think so. Negative. All right. Uh, I think the prices are still pretty whack, though, right? Like, let's see here. Price difference. Yeah, it's it's worthwhile for me to go for the extra drive. As much as it's like an extra, like, probably three minutes, um, I think it's still Big worthwhile boss, to drive that. Big boss, cheers, buddy. Uh, let's get this going. Let's go. Yeah, I think it's still worthwhile for me to drive the extra distance here. As much as it kind of sucks to try to go through the fields and not just go over, like, over that little hill there. Um, for the extra third we're going to get out of this, it's, it's worthwhile. drive it through the fields we're gonna sneak through the back roads again follow the train line Meow. see look at that silo complex there that looks crazy that looks absolutely crazy down there i do need i need a truck i need to get a truck at some point but this is what i got i got they're both the same speed they both don't go any faster than this so i'm stuck with what i got laner Look at the JCB. JCB will double the speed, right? Let's go underneath. Why not? Let's do it this way. Meow. Let's sneak across. Yeah, the JCB would be a nice one to have for sure. Because um, I could use that tractor for so much more, of course, as well. Uh, beacons right here. I've been keeping it off because diesel it kind of flash. This tractor it flashes a little bit. Here, just to show it to you, it's kind of flashy, flashy. It's a little bit much with this with this particular tractor. Uh, with the rest of them, it just does like a spin, so it's not as irritating. But uh, trying to help diesel was irritating diesel. So I fair enough. I get it. I get it. Farmer Mike with a five dollar dono. Appreciate ya. Uh, this before, but what wheel the setup to is? Yeah, I am Logitech G uh, G29 uh, with the shifter as pedals as well as the side panel. You can kind of see the side panel. My hand's always resting on it right now, but it's always there. As uh, we made light of, I've always got my hand on my little joystick right now. 
<laughs> all right once again we got to find the uh the drop point that's not really a drop point this is so weird right here I, this is like the worst one i've seen though i don't know why they couldn't have come up with something a little bit better for a saw point here like they've got everything else all these other placeable buildings all they would have had to do is put like a like one of the troughs or something just to make it look authentic i don't know that's kind of weird this is i'm kind of unfortunate kind of an unfortunate hey technical farmer what's going on man what is going on tonight buddy it's not gonna grow <laughs> what if i if i play with it lots it should <laughs> Uh, yeah, exactly. You got to rent the train first. It's kind of strange, right? The train's kind of bizarre. It's a little bit different. Um, I don't mind that idea. I mean, how, in, in real life, you're not going to be able to get a train just for free whenever you want anyways, right? A tactical farmer said does. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Welcome in. Uh, tactical farmer, were you playing some farm sim, were you? Uh, have the wheel shifter and pedals, but the side panel... I so, um, LTH, did you see that? I did a video on this like a week and a half ago, talking about the side panel, the current generation of the side panel, which is very similar to every generation of the side panel that's come out since 2015. They're pretty much all the same for the most part. Um, it's, it's, it's a nice to have. It kind of has a cheapness to it. It doesn't feel great. Like there's a, it looks good. It's the functionality is kind of nice to have all the buttons, but the actual, the actual feeling of it and the quality is not great. So I'll, I'll give you that much. It's very, it's very plasticky and hollow and light. Um, but the buttons, like having that kind of those, the, the amount of buttons you get access to, uh, the little joystick, of course, is is kind of indispensable in some ways. Uh, there's nothing else on the market that does what it does. Does all that it does, I should say. So I mean, you can get. Um, like you can get a stream deck and you're going to pay a lot more for a stream deck. It does more than this, mind you, but you can get a stream deck. That's, that's kind of equivalent. Uh, but then you don't get the joystick. Um, you can get a, um, a, a proper joystick with her, like a flight sim joystick, but then you're probably not going to get all the buttons. So, um, yeah, it does a lot for, I mean, it's still pretty expensive. It's 150 bucks American, but, uh, it still does quite a few things that you're not going to get anywhere else. I was, I was hoping for they, they would do some kind of an update for 22, to be honest, but we're still in the same thing. So it's still, I think it's worth it if you want the, the full immersion cycle side of things. Um, I, I, I dig using it. It's a lot of fun. It's nice to have. Uh, the Thrustmaster are for sure a good thing. Yeah. Especially if you like, if you're doing logging, oops, where am I going here? Like logging, of course, uh, you're going to want some proper joysticks, I think. Uh, but if you're just doing farming, like what I, I don't usually do any logging, I think the joystick's good enough, but I've heard some people say that it doesn't last. They've broken theirs. Uh, oops, mine's been good so far, but I haven't, I'm pretty, I've been pretty light on it so far. I've been pretty aware that, uh, that it's, that it could have issues. So I'm not reefing on the thing. Uh, I need to drop this, this down. But, I mean, I'm using it every time you see me looking around right now. That there is the joystick. There we go. All right, IH, have a good night, man. Have a good Thanksgiving as well if I don't chat with you before then. No issues with the wheel, other than the fact that um, uh, force feedback's not working. No other, that's the only thing, force feedback. I can't get it to work right now. Uh, I'm not the only one. It sounds like it's, a, it's kind of a, a common issue. But uh, that's the other, the only thing that's going on right now. All right, how are we looking here? We'll get this, these two out of the way, and uh, then we can probably work on uh, getting this tilled up tomorrow. How are we doing for money right now? Ten grand in the account, and I've still got a lot of. I'm, I'm trying to think here now. How much do we have? We got to take all that that. Uh, those grains up to the mill turn that into flour hopefully actually what's the prices for flour let's see if the prices have actually gone up for flour flour they're under a grand what's wheat at Ooh, ouch big oof okay so it's still worthwhile 
We got quite a bit of barley to go up there, and I think the barley, if memory serves me correctly, what does barley do? Okay, so barley actually is the least. So yeah, unfortunately, the, the flour you get a little bit more. I think sorghum, yeah, sorghum will give you the most. So if you have sorghum, you get the most amount of uh, flour out of sorghum for. Oh, actually, never mind. Oats, oats are really good too. Holy shnikes. 188 for 150. That's that's a really good one. Almost a third. Almost, a little less. Like about a quarter, I guess. A little less than a quarter. <laughs> yeah, don't get timed out, all right? <laughs> all right. Uh, sounds good, Freddy. Appreciate you, man. We just try to have a little bit of fun around here, man. That's all we're doing. A little bit different. Different, but the same. <laughs> All right, almost done that. Oh, oof, big oof. We got lots of straw still to get here. So I should actually get some decent... You know what? That's going to... Is this going to pay for the trailer? This actually might pay for the trailer having this 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 hero harvest. Like, we need... We only need, like, another three or four loads. And that will pay the hundred grand we bought this trailer for. So it might actually work out this harvest to actually have bought this, right? Maybe? Maybe not. Tough to say. Um, if you can turn on beacons, it'll turn on. I don't have any equipment that doesn't have a beacon. I haven't tested it with anything else yet, to be honest here. Good worker. Uh, it, the problem is I'm using those augers. And the, they won't recognize that. You can't use the augers and have them running to the mill. So I'll have to load it up, which I can do. Uh, let's see how that'll work, actually. Take a look here. So this here, I can't have them go and come back. So I have to do a load location with this one, right? So we can go... Let's go into our, our, into our thing, into our active workers menu. Um, create job. I can't do a, uh, a load and deliver because it doesn't recognize this silo. You're not going to see the silo on here. It's not, you're not going to find it, unfortunately. So instead, you got to do uh, just a delivery load. And let's see here. It's going to go up to the grain mill. Grain mill right there. Set our location. Say we'll set it right here. So we have an idea. Let's see what happens. Start job. All right. We'll see what happens. See if they load. Uh, when they come back, we'll have to... My, my worry is that I'm going to forget about this. And, um, yeah, they're going to sit in the parking lot and I'm going to spend all my money on that, Cecil. That's what I'm really worried about is that they're going to come back and just park there and I'm going to forget about them. Oh, this guy's going to get tagged. Don't hit him. Nice. Okay. And I'm going to forget about him and lose my cash. That's what I'm really worried about. And they suck with the load up to the mill. I'm, I, there's one spot. We'll see if she makes it. She can't figure it out typically. And we're full again. Off, back off. There's like the one intersection right when you get off the interstate. The workers can't seem to figure that spot out. It, I don't know what it is with that. Uh, but they tend to struggle there. A lot. Like almost every time. Almost every time I've, I've had workers go up there, they always they get lost and struggle. You can almost see her from here. But yeah, get over that interstate right there. And then as soon as they turn up into the hills, uh, and then they have to make like a, a left-hand turn to go up towards the mill, they seem to get lost there all the time. We'll have to watch and see what happens. All right. Farmer, what's going on, man? How are you? Farmer Eastley, is that right? What's going on? How are you tonight? Yeah, this game is all about the tractors, right? That's the big deal with this, is you get to drive all... Any kind of tractor you really want. See if you can break stuff. Uh, it has all the cool big equipment that you everyone wants to play with. Maybe you just can't get. All right, Ray. Cheers, man. Good seeing you in here. Uh, I hope you stay safe this uh, rest of this week. Happy Thanksgiving, bud. Uh, we're going to be... We've already got stuff planned. Yeah, there's going to be a, a roleplay series coming out on this map very soon. Uh, yeah, we've already got stuff on the, in the works. Already have stuff in the works, man. 
I just need to get in, uh, get my life together and do it. That's all it is. Uh, it is out right now. Farming Simulator 22 is out now. Came out yesterday, technically. Hey, day before that, two days ago. Came out on the 22nd. She is out right now. If you haven't downloaded it, check the links down in the description. You can get it right from the Giants website and uh, get all the extra little bonuses as well still. So the Black Anthem, the the Fent, and the Black Beauty, and uh, what is it, the Z-Door? You get all the special, the little special updates if you go to right from Giants. So check the description. Click the linky links. All right, tac Tactical Diesel, what's going on, man? Have a good night. Uh, get, get, get some rest tonight, would you? Get some rest! Blue Blue League, I 100% think it's worth buying. Anthropox, holy shnikes. I haven't seen that name for a bit. Dude, I'm having a fantastic night. I hope you're doing well, man. <laughs> is that the new Stara? Do we need to... Co do we, is the Z-Door the, the new Stara chat? Is that what we need to do? I feel like the Zedor might be the new Stara. Just saying. I think we might have to go that, that route. Uh, LTH, cheers, man. You as well. The pork and beans. I think we might have to bring that back because we'll see. I do like that. Oh, uh, man. Let's go. That's done. Another three grand in the bank. Let's zip it around. The Zedor is more useless than a star. Nice. All right. Well, maybe we, the Zedor King. <laughs> it doesn't have the same ring to it, but uh, we might have to. Oh, the Izeki sucks. I'm sorry. Whatever it's called. Yeah. Try using that tractor with a manual transmission set on and um, then and let me know how that works for you. When I fired that tractor up and it's like, oh, this is an automatic tractor. I'm like, okay. So I step on the... No. I still have to put it in gear and then it's it's got ranges and I have to shift between this I mean, this doesn't make any sense this is not a there's nothing about this tractor that, that's an automatic why are they calling this an automatic this thing sucks the Zeter queen <laughs> oh man um I might have to remember that the Zeter queen thanks fluff <laughs> <laughs> we'll get Gertie on that one. Oh, man. We'll have to get that up there, I think. We'll have to get that up there. The Zeter Queen. Um, I haven't used any of the Zeters yet. Haven't even... I've never even bought one. Uh... <laughs> Two extra horsepower. <laughs> oh, man. Are they... Well, what's that Zeki cost? How much is it? I don't even know what it is. Oh, boy. Really, Kyle? Is that bad? That's ridiculous. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the look of the Zeters. Um, they just don't really be... I don't know. They're just not really for me. So I haven't tried them at all. Plus, they're not really a North American brand. So I tend to stay away from that in that case anyways. But I'm sure I'll have something. I'll have to try them at some point in time. Resale, what are you doing? Uh, he wants to time out. Well, we can try that one more time. You're buying another round. You're buying another round, Resale. All right, buddy. Let's park this thing up in the field here. Resale wants some more rounds. Wants some time out the bot. All right, buddy. I'm, I, if, if you want me to, we, can, we have to do that, I suppose. Let's go. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Stretch the old back, yo. Cheers to you, resale. You're awesome, man. Appreciate you. Come on, folks. Another round. It's Wednesday night, farms. That's you know what's it's it's Thanksgiving. It's Thanksgiving tomorrow for you guys. Don't have to work, do you? I never even thought about that. You guys don't have to work tomorrow, so happy Thanksgiving, crew. Oh, and resale. Cheers to you. Let's go. Come on, folks. Another round. Another one. Another one. Let's go. Get it in ya. Oh, that's good, 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 good job. All right, buddy. Cheers to you. Let's go. Um, let's go play some timeout. I'm sure Kbot will love it. He's gonna love it. Let's go. Turn off my mic. Just turn off my mic. Hang on a second. Just, just.
Just to remember, guys. You know, giants. Giants really likes. They like K-Bot. Giants is all about K-Bot. They, they gave me a hat. Giants got me a hat, so they must. Oh, sorry. I think I can turn this a little bit. See, they got me a hat. Giants sent K-Bot a hat. That's how much they think I am the best bot. Period. In Farming Simulator. Just so you guys know, Giants sent me this. That's how you know I am important and you must respect my authority. No. No. No, 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 no. No, no. It's my hat. Yeah, no, no. Don't you guys, why do you guys have to be so mean? You know what? Just because I'm not giving you away stuff tonight, is that why everyone's so mean? Whatever. Anyways, let's play some time out. Let's, let's, let's play some time out. It's time out city. You guys know the rules? You guys know the rules. If you're the first one to chat after the exclamation point, you're going into my corner. You're going into the corner. Let's, oh, let's go. Let's just ignore that. Just ignore, just ignore, just ignore the sign. It's time to see. three, and two, and one. It's time to see. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, let's go. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. Um, K-Bot, um, you know what, if you, if you like the hat, you may want to take it off for a couple seconds. What? It, no, you just put it beside you. Um, sorry, Big T Farms has got a present for you. Um, K-Bot, just, just take off the hat. You're not going to want to wreck it. Just, just take it off. Is it off? No, no, here, here it comes, you ready? Here, here it comes. Here it comes, buddy! Oh, I'm sorry, Big T. Cheers to you, Big T! Oh, Big T farts the big dono to time out K-Bot. Uh, <laughs> he was going to get timed out anyways, I think. Wasn't he? I think he was going to get timed out anyways. Where is he? Where is he? You might have got timed out anyways. Big T, cheers to you, you crazy man. Um, let's see here. Boom. Um, <laughs> no hats were shocked in... <laughs> no hats were harmed in the shocking of this K-Bot. <laughs> oh boy. Let's get back in. We gotta go finish off this straw still. We still got straw to finish off. Where's my buttons? Where's my buttons? This is still off. This is not on. Let's turn this on. No, it's on? The RPMs weren't on. Oh, it's still... It's still in miles per hour mode, that's why. I, I forgot to change that back, that's why. Never mind. Clutch is dumb. He didn't change the thing back the way he's supposed to. Yeah, it's been a rough night for the little jerk. Um, it, it Usually most nights are, let's be perfectly honest. Let's be honest, it's usually a little bit rough for him every single night. We still we still keep on trying to find a way. We have been talking about this for a while. And uh I, I wanna I wanna kinda up the amperage a little bit. Just to just to see what happens. You know, for science. I kinda wanna see what happens, just for science. Um I think we could find a way to do that, right? All right, what am I checking the garage for again? Oh, 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 wrong one, wrong one, wrong one. I went the wrong way. I missed one. What am I checking the garage for again? What did I miss? Oh, hang on a sec here. Uh, how is how's Gertie doing for her driving, by the way? Did she not get out of the parking lot or is she parked still? Hang on a second. Is she wasting money? Oh, she made it back? Wow, awesome. All right, uh, I didn't think she was gonna make it back. Oh, darn, I missed the thing. I missed the thing. I missed the thing. Yes, for science. Yes, for science. Okay, what do I need to check the garage for again? I keep on, you keep on saying something about the garage. I can't remember what I'm checking it for. What am I checking the garage for again? All right, 
good. Create job. Start job again. Yeah, so it should be the same. Yeah, it'll be the same thing. Perfect. So I just have to do this now because unfortunately I can't do it automatically. It'd be so much nicer if it did it automatically. Uh, For sale. Oh, okay. Sale items? Is that what we're talking about? We can do that. Sale items. What's for sale? Oh, it hasn't changed. It's the same thing. We got oh, the Brockman. I like this trailer, but I don't have a use for it. This is cool. Like, this is a cool thing to have in Farm Sim. Don't get me wrong. Um, a little, you can get a reefer unit. Yeah, it's got a little reefer unit on it. You can change your wheels. But, I, I guess, shipping eggs? I guess? I don't know. Kind of a cool little trailer, but I don't really have a, like, an actual use for it. It's kind of weird that they put it in, to be honest with you. Uh, but it's good for roleplay stuff, that's for sure. Uh, you, you didn't change the location. Yeah, it, uh, it might to it now. You didn't change the location. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, the cheese transporter. Is that what it's for? I thought it was for eggs. Eh, that makes sense. It shows you how much I know about cheese. Where am I working on the map? Ah, uh, let's bring that up. So I am south, directly south of the main middle farm. Yeah, you can see Gertie crossing the highway right now, but I am directly south of the main middle farm. Slowly making my way. There's Gertie's trailer right there, uh, right along the road, but I'm directly south of this. Trying to expand. Um, I don't know where. I'd like to get like the 30s field, 30, 31, 32. I wouldn't mind getting over that way or possibly 41, 42, and 40, like right ahead of us here. There's some nice fields right in that neck of the woods too that I wouldn't mind uh, getting my greedy little mitts on. But money is the thing. All right. Uh, I had cheese. <laughs> did you? You hauled cheese in real life? I did not know. You know, I get, it makes sense. But I mean, don't you just scrape the mold off anyways? <laughs> I think you just scrape off that mold anyways. What does it matter, right? Just got to scrape it off. Uh, Wayne's World. Wayne's World. Party on. Excellent. Where, where, where did that come from? Uh, <laughs> what's going on with the Wayne's World tonight? That's, that's kind of random. <laughs> All right. We got uh, two, one more load to make. Looks like. We'll, then we'll just leave it as in the trailer. What are we going to be over? 20,000 maybe? The more mold, the more expensive. Oh, boy. All right. Uh, no, you. Cheers, man. Get some sleep. Go, get your, go edit your videos. Get your videos out there. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, I went the wrong way. Um. Oh, boy. I missed my turn. I missed the turn. I was reading chat. I was reading chat. Oh, this is going to be fun. Hang on, chat. This is going to be a rough one. Oh, boy. Oh, that was a lot deeper than I thought it was going to be. Um. Okay. I've, I've got a plan. I've got a plan. I, I've got a plan. I got, I got, I got a plan. I got a plan. We're just, um, that was way deeper than I was expecting that creek to be. We're good. We're good. We're good. Told you we're good. Totally fine. Totally, totally fine. Oops. I was looking at the bridge. I was looking for collectibles. Is there any more collectibles under the bridges? They like to hide them under the bridges. <laughs> we need 82's record. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Best driver in farm sim. <laughs> oh man, I forgot about that. Yeah, <laughs> no one saw anything. That didn't really happen. That was all just a figment of your imagination. Ah, no, we we knew what we were doing from this. We were good. We we knew what we were doing there. We had that all planned out, guys. Totally planned out. Um, I had that. Yeah, down to the to the the wire. I knew exactly how that was gonna work. <laughs> That's what she said. Sorry. Couldn't help it. Here. No. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Where are they going? Where are they going? Oh, I don't want to go that way. You guys have fun out in your field.
<laughs> we just about got some deer, deer jerky right there. Almost had some. Just about. Uh, why so much off driving? We are got to get rid of the straw. Um, I have nowhere to store the straw in the farm. And I don't have a baler. And I need the money. So I'm selling it as soon as I get it. Unfortunately, that's the way it's going right now. Uh, this should be the last load of straw. So we'll unload this one and we'll keep whatever we get left in there. I think we got like two more passes left. That should do it for the straw, I think. So we should have enough of that. And then uh, hopefully, I'm I don't know how far it's going to be yet, but I need, I need the money from the straw. So unfortunately, every time we get straw, we got to drive. And there's only two sell points for straw. Uh, this one being one and the other one being the animal dealer. So you're, you're stuck driving if you don't want to hold on to it. Boom. Because, I mean, it's only like three grand I get per load. But when you've got like no money at all, it doesn't hurt to sell it. It doesn't hurt to sell it. I feel like I have to right now. So I still got like, what did I get out of this? Like we did what? Four loads, five loads. So we still got like almost 20 grand. Um, still worthwhile. 15 grand, maybe 15 grand. sucks but it is what it is like i said i want to get a truck that i can actually haul stuff with but i mean that's a hundred thousand dollar truck right granny have a good night thanks so much for hanging out with us tonight cheers to you uh, let's see This thing needs a wash, guys. Look at this. And I haven't figured out yet, does leaving leaving it dirty cause more damage than not? I know that was a thing in 19. I There's nothing in any of the documentation that really talks about leaving your equipment dirty at all. I'm assuming it does, but I've got no proof of it at all yet. Bye, Granny. See you, Granny. Everyone's saying bye to Granny. We'll see you next time. We will see you next time. The Wayne's world was on me. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Everyone gets stuck in Wayne's world now. Great. You know what? I did enjoy the movie. I used to love them on Saturday Night Live back in the day. All right. Last load, I guess. Should be, right? In theory, that should be the last one. Plus, it's 6 o'clock. It's almost quitting time. It's almost quitting time for today. Uh, the music is from... No, this music is not from 22. Yeah, we're definitely blaming you. Uh, the music is not from 22. This is just uh, a playlist I have. Uh, 22's music in the radio is actually not bad. But um, it is copyright. All right, there we go. Turn this back on. All right, let's get this done. I think I think we should be. I don't know four four rows. That we got four there full. Maybe three and a three and a bit or four almost four. Full four it looks like. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, engine hours should be damaged and repairs. That's what I would say as well. I have no idea what it is. You know what? I've got. Um, the disc copy that comes in the collector's edition has an actual manual. And I want to read through it a little bit to see if there's anything I didn't know in there. Um, that was one thing I was thinking about. I'm like, does, does the manual have anything extra written in it that I didn't know about in Farm Sim? So I'm going to take a look through that at some point here in the very near future. Like, that would be nice to see. Um, but anyways, it's got a cool little manual that comes with the... Uh, with the disc copy for uh for pc of course i think console players you guys get manuals too right or no anthropox you're not wrong it the the sound is a lot better uh, unfortunately um it's kind of quiet right now i just cranked it up for you guys a little bit Ooh, is the is gertie back hang on a sec hang on a sec here is gertie back oh good timing good timing Open that up for her. 
Barley inbound. And should be able to hit. Uh, create job. Start job. Oh, how quick is that? Too fast? It was, a, it was a little bit too fast. It's okay. 90% full. It's all good. Where's that tracker? There it is. There it is. There it is. All right. The mill is going to be pumping out bre uh, flour. We're going to be pumping out so much flour, at least. 56%. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. It would be close. Uh, DJ would like a manual. A uh, manual, really? <laughs> uh... The, we're, this channel, the YouTube channel is all farm sim. Yeah, so we are always on farm sim on the YouTube channel. Um, the algorithm doesn't really let us play anything else, unfortunately. Uh, you'll find other stuff on our Twitch channel from time to time when we get some time, but we're, we're pretty much dominated with farm sim 22 right now. So uh, that's pretty much all you're going to find on this channel on YouTube is farm sim 22. If you want to see some other stuff be played, just follow us on Twitch as well. But... Uh, we don't do too much on there. You never know. There might be some other shooters and stuff at some time, but most of the time we're usually on farm sim. So you can't really put it on a loop right now because of the um, the silo I'm using. You can't really even see the silo. The silo I'm using it has the uh, the augers and the, um, the 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 AI doesn't recognize the augers as a pickup point. And we've got to go do one more drop off. Crapola. Well, that sucks. One more drop off. Sorry, chat. I promised you it would, would only be less than that, but we got to do one more. We're making a run. So you can put them on a loop, but the silo that we have is not recognized as a uh, as an actual pickup because of the, the the augers. So they are. It is looping to come back there all the time. It's just that it's not doing the pickup automatically because it doesn't see the silo, which kind of sucks. So I just have to remember to go check on it every once in a while. So if you use, if you go to this map and use new farmer mode, that farm comes with a silo built there. Uh, and if you use like the actual silo, the proper silos that have the, the dump area, um, they will see those silos and dump there automatically in loop. But the fact that we use the augers, they won't do the loop because of the augers, that's all. So I'm just setting that up for a load and deliver. So I have to go and load it whenever I'm ready to do it. And, uh, and then she just comes back and brings it back for me so it's ready to go again. But if I forget about it, for instance, it could cost me an arm and a leg because she'll just sit there and do nothing. I did harvest a small field. Yeah, I went back and harvested it. Gives <laughs> Jay Forby gave it a case of AFS Connect. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> All right. Nothing coming across the road. Lots of driving tonight. Holy shnikes. We're seeing, uh, we're seeing this side of the map. I haven't been down to this side of the map that much, to be honest with you. Hey, J J JT, um, can we get a billboard? Just wondering for a friend. Hey, yeah, we play American Truck Sim. We usually, it's always on Twitch, though. We used to do that over here every once in a while, but uh, the YouTube algorithm is not really kind. It doesn't like when people, if you start spreading your stuff out like that. And yeah, if, unless you're a real variety streamer, a variety channel, you might be able to do okay. But unless you really focus on that on YouTube, it's not not really beneficial, I find. At least that's what my personal opinion is on that. Is there any way to get it into 22, JT? Just wondering, asking for a friend. Um, Just the normal stuff. I would just like to, to try to... I could, I could actually come up with something to put onto it, but I just don't know how to get it in the game. I would love to get uh, uh, the billboard back again. Uh, blue exclamation mark Twitch should bring up the channel. Kbot should be back there. Uh, he can link it to you. All right. That will be officially the last time we make this run. There we go. 18 grand. Oh, yeah. JT says you can do it. Nice. I, I, I've heard it's not too bad to do that kind of stuff, um, but you never know, right? Oh, County Line. I would love to see County Line come make an update. Yeah, I'm a County Line fan for sure. County Line would be fantastic. See, so that just says Twish. Twish. I don't think Twish is a thing. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Case of Special Brown. Just kind of like my empty uh, 
my empty glass. We got the case of special brown on that one. DJ Moose has that one. <laughs> All right. There we go. Laner and, and Cecil both got it. Wow, it's hard. It's just K Bot's angry. He's got the metal going on right now. He's got the metal. So you guys are is that a stat holiday for most most of you tomorrow? Is that right? Do you guys have a stat holiday tomorrow? I'm assuming it is, right? There's football tomorrow. Is it Thursday tomorrow, right? Is it Wednesday tomorrow? What is tomorrow? I'm confused. It's Wednesday today. Yeah, Wednesday today, Thursday tomorrow for you guys, right? So you guys got you have tomorrow off. <laughs> I've been zapped too many times in one stream. Did you get zapped? What'd you get zapped for? Is there a 200 bill? I didn't even know that. Oh, man. I had no idea that was a thing, JT. What's a stat holiday? Oh, a, a statutory. So, like, uh, you get you get paid if you don't, even if you're not working, basically. Yeah, you, you guys don't have to work tomorrow, though, right? That's what I'm saying. Unless you're, um, unless you have to work. You don't, you're, you're not supposed to, you don't have to work unless you have to work. Public holiday. There you go. That's the word. We call them stat holidays up here. Or at least I do. I think everyone calls them that up here, at least. All right. Thursday and Friday. Sweet. There you go. Laner, you don't get paid. Oh, crap. That sucks. Rabble. Rabble. Do you get, you get paid double time or overtime for that, don't you, Fluff? You guys work tomorrow you get paid extra right all right i'm gonna wash this crap up <laughs> it's so dirty uh and that is the day gertie's not coming back yet i don't know how much she's got left to take up there there's got to be quite a bit she's got quite a but a few loads i hope the owner is cheap but don't they have to is it not re not required Uh, if you were working, it'd be triple pay. Nice. I thought by I thought it was by like law they had to pay you that. And console does have a manual. Nice. Okay. Cool. All right. Twenty five percent more on five hours plus equipment. Really? So if I get that right, Kyle, if you have over five hours on equipment it wears 25% faster is that right I did find that this uh 8RT it it got damaged really quick by comparison like I've only put like two or three hours on this since we repaired it fully and it's already at half damage which is kind of crazy uh I heard the side panel is working for PS4 um which it's not supposed to though so I wouldn't I wouldn't go out and buy it right now until we're for a little bit because our updates still coming out as well. So um, I've heard it is working for PS4 though for some reason, uh, which was not supposed to be. All right, that's done there. Stop that. All right, where is oh here comes Gertie right now. Here comes Gertie right now. How's she doing? We're going to check on our uh, our flower, see how much flower we're making right now. She should be coming around. There she is. She's been putting some miles on that. No, I got no pigs on this res resale. Uh, like the, the farm that we, if you watch the pre, uh, the pre-release farm, we took over, where was it? Right through here. So I bought all the fields in here again, but all these these two fields, like right down in that corner, and then this field right here, um, they were made into animals. Yeah, so this is all our, our animal area right down in here. Um, I have no animals on this farm yet because we started from scratch uh, after release, and we're just kind of doing a playthrough to see how things work, how well, like how easily you could make money. 
Um, yeah, more of a proper playthrough rather than just... Because that whole thing, we were messing around most of the time. Just testing things out, seeing what would happen. How much we got left in here, speaking of which. We still got 32,000 liters of barley in here. That's a lot of barley chat. Let's just take a look, see here. Let's see how we're looking. All right, so... We've got 21,000 up there. We're storing. We're at 17,000. How does the price for flour? Is it going to go back up in the summer at all? Because this could cause us some issues. Uh, flour. Not that I believe this thing. Okay, so as of September, it starts to rise. So um, we're in June. It's going to be filled by August at the rate we're going right now. October. So if we can get to October and start selling there, maybe it'll start to be worthwhile to sell it. Because it's not right now. Actually, speaking of which, how is this looking? Water's almost out. We're still storing stuff. Okay, we've got lots of room for storing there. We'll fill this thing on up, and uh, we'll let Gertie take a break here. All right. Let's go here and do this. Zip that around right to eight o'clock. And we're good to go. Let's see what our loads are at here, folks. Should be good there. Okay, that should be good. What day are we on now? All right, so harvest is done for wheat barley. We've got time to wait now. I can't plant anything until September. So I have two months to wait for that. And then October is when we can plant or harvest the soybeans. So we got some time still. It's all about these factories now we got to worry about. So just keep an eye on these. Okay, we're going to about to run out of water. Um, we're going to run out of space here on the flower. So I need to find a way to get that taken care of. Ugh. Okay. Need to find ways to take care of all of this. Uh, all right, let's send this. Let's send Gertie back up there. Let's keep this going. I like where we're going with this. Let's keep this rolling. Uh, great job again. Is it still the same? It looks like it stayed the same. Start job. We're going to keep her rolling. Keep on taking the flower. Oh, no, oh, no, no, no. Great job. Start job. Back. There we go. Oh, those forks are awfully low. I don't trust this. There we go. I don't trust that at all. I don't know how she met. Like, were the forks that low the whole time? Oh, I, just, I keep on hitting the X instead of just let her go. Let her just do her thing. Get out of here. If those forks were that low the whole time, I'm surprised she made it, chat. Yeah. We got to go take care of the, um, the greenhouse. We got to take care of the greenhouse. All right. All the way through. And you know what? We want to see if we can fill this up for free. Um, instead of spending the money on it, let's go. We got a little bit of time. Let's go for a quick trick over to the pond and see if we can get this for free. I'm going to see if I can save myself uh, 800 bucks. Gertie likes living on the edge. No kidding. That scares me. Like driving. I, I've, I've driven a forklift where those forks have dug into stuff before. Luckily, the forklift was big enough, but man, I wouldn't want to be driving on the cement with them like that. Driving down the road and catch some concrete. You get the steering wheel right in the gut. That would hurt. All right, where's this pond that's up here? Should be one on the right. Should be one just on the right. <laughs> you detached the plow before it looked oof. Okay. Uh, there should be one right in here. Let's see if we can load from this. Uh, GG Gamer, bud. How you doing, man? Welcome in. All right, let's see if we can just back this in, get some water out of the pond instead of using our water source. We'll uh, we'll just uh, borrow. We're just gonna borrow this one because that's all we're doing. We're just borrowing it. It's just gonna funnel back in here eventually, right? We're just borrowing, chat. That's it. Uh, activate. No, not not close enough yet. Not close enough. Activate, 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 activate. Okay, there it goes. Okay, good. We just had to pretty much. I think you have to get this 
I don't know what you have to get. I was going to say that has to be in the water, but it doesn't look like it has to be in the water. So it's free if you get it from this, but you got to pay for it if you slap the one down. I got gotcha. you. Um, that sucks. Uh, how do you make money in the water? Um, I don't think you make money in the water. Uh oh, we got a worker blocked. Why are you blocked? Oh, you're fine. You're good. You're okay, Gertie. Keep going. She's good. She's fine. It's all good. Kyle, I did a whole video on uh, the manual transmissions. Yeah. Uh, I was. Tip I typically use them. Tonight, I'm not. I just didn't feel like setting my shifter up. But typically, I do use manual gears. Plus, all the equipment I'm running has CVT transmissions. So, um, manual gears don't really make a difference for what the equipment I have tonight, at least. Oh, how do you make money in the winter? Did I say... Did you say... Did I, I read water. Sorry, dude. Uh, how do you make... It's, it's animals. Animals, greenhouses... Uh, your production chains. That's what you got to focus on if you want to make water, uh, money in the winter. I need to get over there. Need to get over there. All right. <laughs> or logging. Or logging. Yeah, that's right. If you're desperate, you can go logging. Uh, but uh, yeah, animals, uh, greenhouses, those are the two big ones for sure. Uh, but the production chains will make you cash as well. Like storing stuff up in your production chains in your greenhouses and then doing the shipping in the winter is really the best way because you can, that's, that's when the prices are the best. Um, that's just what you're gonna have to deal with. All right, drop this in there. But yeah, these greenhouses, yeah, what logging exactly. Uh, these greenhouses, the prices are for like the best prices to tire price time to sell all these is in the winter. So you want to try and store as much as you can. And then for winter, have the, your most, your stock ready to go. So you could probably start, you can pull all these off of here because you can just grab them and store them someplace, but then you've got to ship them afterwards. Just be aware of that. But it is by far the best time to sell is in the winter. So let's just see here. Uh, yeah. Like if we go into our, our menu, go into into this right down to the bottom like lettuce you know february and march that's your best time to start selling that stuff so um yeah that's what you need to do all right uh should we get one more how much do we have in here how much room do i have should we'll bring this up there we go uh we can put some more water in here and then we don't have to worry about it for a while oh did i am i selling something no so you can see like right here, tomatoes and lettuce. I'm storing right now. I'm storing both of these products. I'm not selling them. They're just building up in here. And then come the winter time, I'll sell them off when the prices are the highest. I'm trying to do my best to hold on to that kind of stuff. Um, like that, we, we made money off this greenhouse actually right off the bat. So it cost us 30 grand to build that. And I think we've, within a year, uh, we've, we've already paid for it. It's, it's made enough money. We usually get like about 12, $14,000 a year, depending on what you put into it. Or, what your market prices go for. So you can make some good cash off those. At least pay for them. It keeps you busy. Just getting water, shipping stuff. Uh, I didn't want to go this way. I didn't want to go this way. Oh, well, we're going this way now. That's kind of a waste of time. Another field I wouldn't mind buying. I think this field's overpriced, though, for what it is. It's not a great size field, but it's nice and close to your farm and you have access to it, but it's overpriced, I think. It's a little on the pricey side. Um, that's the biggest one there. So I think that one's 30K for the big one off the top of my head, right? I am still playing one day per month seasons. Yeah. I may change it at some point, uh, but right now I have no problem keeping up with one day per month. So uh, we'll stay with that until, until said time. And I've been holding it on five times speed as well. Um, I think I slowed it down a little bit for last stream, but I really don't need to. I can I can usually just hold it on five times the five times speed and let her go and let her buck, and we're pretty good. So yeah, one day one day per month seasons, and then five times speed tends to be a fairly quick turnaround. Your days go fairly quick, uh, but it's still like even with the, I mean I don't have a lot of fields yet as you guys can see. Let's go back to our mini map, but still taking care of. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We've got seven fields in this little area. Uh, we're still able to take care of... We split them up into two different sections, right? 
So we've got our grains, our wheat fields, wheat and barley fields are the brown ones, and then our bean fields are the, the, the greenish color ones. And all that's allowing us to do is to have two different harvest air times. So making sure we've got a barley or wheat, uh, we could go canola as well would be a good option. Uh, and then making sure that we have the other ones. So they're separated and they're, they're, there's always something to do kind of throughout the year. Whereas if you focus on one of the other types of grains, you could maybe get into a little bit more trouble because uh, you got the whole thing to harvest then potentially. Uh, four days per season at 15 times speed. So that almost, it would be identical to what I got, I bet you. That would probably equal out to almost the same. That's kind of a good, interesting way to do it. Then you get more days and nights, which is cool, right? Nothing wrong with that. I like that idea. That's a kind of, that's a, that's a cool idea too. 15 times speed with, yeah, that's cool. Nothing wrong with that. I like hearing you guys do that kind of stuff. That's cool. Uh, five times speed equals uh, two to 2.5 hours per playtime per day. There you go. I don't mind what Victor's saying, though. That's kind of an interesting idea. 15 times speed with four days, four day seasons. Um, that's kind of an interesting concept there, too. <laughs> I played 28 day months. Could you, yeah, that's a long time. I, I'm curious to see. So we've already we've got a server set up with all of the other guys. So Grant, uh, Pickle, Austin, Bach, myself. Um, I don't know what they have the season set on for that. And it's not easily changeable, obviously, is one of the other problems. Like, once you fire it up and start doing something, you can't change things till the next season. So you, if you... And we tend to have to put things on kind of a wide berth because of the way we do ro the roleplay stuff. Uh, I'm not sure how that's going to work out yet. We'll have to wait and see, guys. We're going to have to wait and see on that one. There we go. Oh, and somebody got stuck. Oh, there she is. She's making her way. Good. All right. Just making sure she's coming. Uh, have I used... Can anyone join you guys on multiplayer? No, on that one, no. That one's a private multiplayer. Let's see. How are we looking here? Uh, I can almost put another one in here, but I'm not going to bother. We got enough for now. Keep storing, keep storing those tomatoes and uh, lettuce. I like it. Close that up. We'll leave that there. Let's till this up quickly. All right, all's the way through. All right, let's just grab that and we'll clean these fields up. So this is one of the questions I had and somebody actually was commenting about this last stream. Uh, I'm not getting stones and stones are definitely on, but they think we think it might be because there's a roller on the back of this uh, crockerling that's pushing the fields back down and the stones back down so they're not getting tilled up at all like i i just have i've seen one stone i think come up uh from cultivating so i don't know if it's from the rollers they don't really seem like proper rollers uh so i'm kind of surprised that we're not getting more it seems kind of strange to me um anyways yeah but everything call causes them it's not just it's not just stones you could or not just plows you, the plows will bring up the big ones, but every single, every time you bring up dirt, like even the uh, the direct drills will bring up, uh, will bring up stones. Yeah, cultivators will bring up stones, it says, in the store. That's, that's still a thing. So I don't know why that particular one's not bringing them up. It's kind of bizarre. Uh, great job. Start job. Go. So, yeah, if you go to stones, like I said, that's a cultivator. Uh, da, 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 da. Stone, stone, stones. Where are the stones on here? Cultivating, stone, stone harvesting. Is it in here? No. Proving yield, maybe? Uh, yeah, see, it doesn't say it in there. Where's the one about stones? But anyways, like, it, 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 we're using a cultivator, so stones should come up in theory. <laughs> Would you say they're rolling stones? <laughs> um, it doesn't really say. Here we are. When cultivating and plowing your fields, there will always be the possibility of stones being dug up. We're cultivating. That's what I'm saying right there. So um, stones should be coming up, I would think. But this cult does this cultivator say anything about it in the store? Actually, that's, a, that's whatever. Maybe that's what I'm missing. Does it say something about it in the store? Is this what you're talking about? It says it doesn't. Does that in the store? Cultivators. 
Uh, which one do we have here? Uh, oh, we had the croc ring. Isn't this one room have? It's not it. Which one do I own? Is this not it? I could have swore it was this one. Lumpkin? No, it's a crockerlin. Did I grab the different... Which one did I grab? What do I own? I could have swore that's what it was. Not a, is it a disc? Oh, it's the disc! So this disc harrower doesn't bring up stones. I thought it would. I thought disking still would too. Ah, see, I thought it was a cultivator. It's a disc. But I still thought the discs would bring up... Um, I thought they would still bring up. That changes my thoughts a little bit. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Yeah, yeah, safe, safe, safe. Do your thing. Let me just check this out. Does it not say anything about discs on there? Uh, possibility of bringing something cultivating or plowing. Okay, nope. So we're not sub, but subsoiling brings up big stones as well. Yeah, so subsoiling does, but disking doesn't, which is interesting. Okay. Yeah, shallow con shallow cultivation. So uh, disking is, con I guess, disking is considered shallow cultivation. I thought disking was still thicker. It was uh, was still more than uh, some other methods, but I guess not. So um, maybe that's a smart way to do things if you want to do with stones, because it doesn't seem to have a problem with that. <laughs> Anyways, I thought I thought this was a cultivator in my head. I thought this was a different one. I thought I bought the uh, the cultivator, the crockerling cultivator. Uh, if it's a high speed tiller, in theory, it shouldn't. Interesting. Okay. Discs cause more weeds. Oh, did they? I didn't know that either. Does that is that actually the work in game? Is that actually a, a percentage on this? I haven't read anything about that. That's why I ask. Not that it matters, because I have weeds turned off. Alright. I know the subsoilers tend to bring up some uh, some bigger rocks. And the cultivators definitely bring up smaller stones. Uh, but I thought the discs did too for some reason. But obviously not so much. Which is kind of handy. Uh, okay. Yeah, I've noticed it for sure that disc harrowers don't bring up the stones, so... But, uh... I thought it was a cultivator. I was using it for the longest time. I thought it was a cultivator. This tiny little field. This is such a pain in the butt, this field, to do. I had time to get my notebook out. Yeah, same here. Apparently. Uh-oh. Come on, baby. Turn around. Turn hard. Get that done. Nice. Get her done. Oh, I, tr I just lifted it up. I lifted it up. Hang on a second. I'm, this is this is the Gertie patch is messing with me. There we go. Let's get rid of that. Uh, parsing files to update. Um, it was usually just a, a cancel and redo it. Was the the fix I did, and it fixed it for me. Is it not working for you? You still having some issues? Hang on a sec here. What's going on with this? There we go. Yeah, for me, it was just a simple uh, reset and good to go again. Oh, yeah, we definitely need GPS. 100%. 100% we need a GPS. Would love to see it. Soon, I'm sure someone... I know Wobster's... I think Wobster was working on it. He already said... Oh, don't mind me breaking my... my uh, it's not a cultivator clutch. It's a disc hour. <laughs> All right, finish off this tiny little field. This field sucks, but I need it. I still need the money from it, so I'm doing it. All right, let's uh, let's fold this up so we can get through here. Uh, still doing it every time you play. Game crashes. Really? That sucks, man. Um, I've got no issues. I've, I haven't had any problems with mine, to be honest with you. And I've had to update it twice, I think now. Uh, and no real problems. No problems that, uh, yeah, were game crashing or anything like that. Even as far as, like, bugs go, I haven't had really any bugs that are other than, uh, funny pigs. Like, that's the worst of the bugs I've had. That sucks, guys. I'm sorry to hear about that. 
Um, yeah, it sounds like it might be like a driver issue of some sort you're having, but weird. All right. See, there's the ones, the two stones that have been brought up. Um, I think those these were actually brought up from uh, me trying to use the uh, what is it, the the wing arms on uh, on the um, the planter. I brought them out and brought some stones up instead. I'm like, well, I don't want to use that. I've got fields that no stones right now. Do they stay or do they come? They go back down. No, they stay on the field. So I should probably rent a roller at some point. I wonder how much damage that does to things. Like I've got like barely. There's like two little stones back there. You guys see that? Like how much damage can that possibly do? I can just get this straightened out and get the rest of them up. Like how much damage do these do to your your to your equipment? I wonder. I wish I could pick these up. I wish we could have like a tractor that just had a, a rock box, and we could just pick these up and be done with it. Like this is that sucks. I just they're stuck there. That's the only two I've got. There's nothing there. Uh, doesn't. Yeah, it's like the only rocks I have. So it'd be nice if I could, uh, if I could just pick those up by hand instead of having to go rent equipment to go smush them down or uh, to pick them up, because that's going to cost like four or five thousand dollars just to go pick up those two rocks. So I think I'll, I'm better off just leaving it alone. I can't see it damaging the equipment that bad, right? Uh, no Gertie back yet. Gertie's still driving. All right, mod incoming. You're talking about mod incoming. Oh, for the, the rocks, you mean? <laughs> I would love to see that, man. I would be game. Can we please get, can we please make that happen? Like, just have a rock box. If you had a rock box on your tractor, maybe even. Just have it so you can walk up to it and, like, click a button. And it would pop into the rock box. I think that'd be sweet. Turn the rocks into gold nuggies. <laughs> oh, man. Could you imagine? Uh, sorghum, wherever you can sell. There's all sorts of sell points. You can turn it into flour. Um, you can even chaff it, I believe. Or I think you can chaff, you can chaff, chaff the uh, sorghum, can't you? I think sorghum can be made into chaff. You just cut the tops of it off. You can mow it, I think, and turn it into chaff. Oh, not quite sharp enough. Did I get it? Oh, it is too. Look at that. Look at that. A rock box and a boom box. <laughs> yeah, so if you want it with the sorghum, like I said, I'm harvesting it because I'm taking it up to the mill to make that into flour. But the sorghum can also be made if you want it to turn into silage. You can, uh, yeah, you can chaff it. You can just mow it down, get a mower of some sort, and mow it, to, uh, mow it down, like get the crone and mower down, or uh, yeah, turn it into chaff. Kind of like you would do with corn. All right. Gertie's back again. Guess who's back? Back again. Gertie's back. Hide your friends. All right. Let's see. More barley. All right. Get going. Almost there. 80%, 90, go. Great job. Drive. Back it up. All right. And back on the road she goes. That little 6M is getting so many miles put on it. I mean, I've driven that road like probably 20 times just driving stuff up to that mill. And Gertie, that's her, what, fifth load now? Oh, boy. She's going to be mad at me. She's not going to be happy. Uh, why aren't there any drawbar plows? Good question. Yeah, the, some of the stuff, I, I agree. Yeah. Everything needs a three-point. I've noticed that as well. I'm missing something here. Uh, there we go. There we go. 
Um, and speaking of which, that Rossel Mash that's in there, the, the, the heavy tractors, that one there is like the one of the best deals in the game. That thing is crazy. Like large tractor for 200 and some thousand dollars like that. And you're getting like, what, three, 400 horsepower out of it. Uh, but once again, I think limited usage, unfortunately. All right, go around. Oh, yes. Perfect. Not going to get it all. Going to have to come back. I'm going to have to come back. $500. Ouch. See, she's costing me a lot of money. I'm paying her a lot to drive that tractor up and down. 500 bones? Man. Workers, workers make so much money in this game. Just because the Giants made them a little bit smarter, I think they can charge more. All right. Another Jim B. <laughs> uh, Clutch missed a whole bunch here. I'm going to get all this stuff as well before I finish this off. There we go. That's better. A, did you see that like flickering we get from the the tank it was like the the mirror effect kind of weird all right well there is a labor shortage i guess that must be it it's got to be the labor shortage <laughs> our workers are asking an arm and a leg they're asking what are we getting it's like a, a buck every what three seconds they're getting a dollar man what a ripoff all right, this side's done. I got two fields on the far side. Uh, should we do those tonight? I guess we should. Gertie's still driving. I'll finish off these fields so they're ready to rock. I can do them later on. Need course play for workers. I agree. I'm happy with the workers as is the way they are right now, though. I'm. I mean, I'm. It's a step forward. It's a step in the right direction. It is a step in the right direction. Alright. Tell you what, I think I'll finish the, this field. I won't do the big field tonight. Get this headland kind of smoked away so I don't have to run into our beans. Keep the speed up on the corners. Keep the speed up on the corners. Alright. I should be able to cut down in here now. Drag this thing around the corners. No deer. No deer this time. I find the, this little forest right here, there's always deer that seems like populated. They always come out of here for me. Alright. I'll do another one down here as well because I always run into this telephone pole otherwise. Uh, let's see. S saying tonight? What's saying? <laughs> Just woke up at 7 a.m. Oh, it's it's late here. It's 11, 11.30. This has been a long stream. I don't usually stream this long. What time, How long have I been streaming for? How long have I been streaming for tonight? That's the question. Yeah, thanks, Fluff. All right. Four hours. Almost five hours we've been streaming farms. And holy shnikes. This is... I haven't done a stream this long in a long time. Yeah, we got snow in Calgary, Anthrobox. Yeah, we got hit a little bit. Uh, it's not bad, though. We got hit yesterday with a couple centimeters. Nothing crazy, mind you. Just enough to know it was there. Just enough to know it was there. All right, keep on trucking through here. Looks good. I haven't seen Gertie come back yet. She must be dumping off at the mill. See how much we can get. Like I said, the mill, I'm, I'm surprised. I thought we'd get like $1,500 uh, per, per thousand at the mill for flour. And I haven't got it above like 1200 since I saw it. I only saw it there once. Usually it's like right at a thousand bucks. It's, it's, oh man, it's almost not worth it. It's going to take a long time for it to, uh, for that to pay off the fact that we pay like a hundred, well, 90 grand for that. 
and then you're still paying you got to remember you're paying like a buck what is it i don't even know what it is a buck per hundred hundred um uh 100 liters made or something like that i can't remember what the profit or the, what the cost is on that so you're paying to still have stuff made so that's eating out of your profit margins and you're not making that much more than if you're just selling straight and it's a two-step process so i i don't know i'm not sold on the mill right now the mill is a little bit disappointing tonight I almost think maybe I should have went and made oil and, and focused on... Uh, oh, they're stuck. I'll have to go take a look and see what's going on. Maybe we should have focused on making oil with uh, canola and sunflowers. Now nah, she's good. But it seems like it's a little bit out there for prices. Seems like it's a little out there for the prices right now. But that's this will get done in no time. I still can't believe what we got this this tractor for so freaking cheap. <laughs> this thing was half off. Oh man. A bulldog mod? Joe wants a, a bulldog, nice. We never got any puppers mods, eh? Like there was no no one ever came up with a different dog mod. Oh, that's what we need to place down on this farm as well, speaking of which. The clothes is where the money's at. You might be right. Cotton will make some good cash. Cotton always does. Yeah, cotton's some good money. All right, let's keep on going. So I still have that big field. We're going to cultivate that next time uh, or tomorrow. Maybe we'll see. I'm not going to worry about it. We're, we're ahead of the game right now as far as timing goes. Um, we can't plant for, oh, ouch, ouch, ouch. I can't plant for a couple of days. So I'm not too worried about that. We can't harvest for a couple of days. So harvest, no, plant should be first. I think we can plant before we can harvest. So I can plant all these three fields again. Uh, we can probably go back to wheat. We did barley, so we'll go back to wheat again. And then as soon as that's done, we'll be into harvesting those beans once again, which should give us another probably... I think it's 30 or 40,000 bucks we get from the beans from harvesting it. But it's a, a bit of a slow go, chat. Like, we're not... We need more fields, I think, is really what we need. We need to expand our fields. Uh, that's the only real thing that's going to make us some decent cash. It's, it's kind of tight. Yeah, we'll see. The equipment we have can handle doing more bigger fields, I think. I think, yeah, I think our fields, we can handle bigger fields. So, do I want to pay off more of the loan this time? We're only losing about $12,000 per year from the loan. We lose about, what, 12, 100, bucks a night? So, we're only losing about twelve grand a year from the loan. Um, I could pay that off. Slowly. We wouldn't even be able to get it off in what? Like, we'd only be able to get half of it. Maybe not even. We want, what, $250,000? Yeah. We could, Randy, we could go make bread. Uh, you made 22,000 in clothes. I missed some big T. I missed that. Uh, 22 grand in clothes. See, the clothes are interesting. I find that kind of a fascinating one. I don't usually do cotton. Uh, can you do, do you do clothes with wool as well? Can you get some sheep going and do it that way? So, yeah, I, I the problem is if I want to do bread, then I've got to buy the, um, the whatchamacallit, the bakery. And that's another expense then, right? Because that's another 100000 I think, for the bakery. So do I buy the bakery or do I buy more fields? Like, what would be more profitable? I think fields, uh, long run, will be more profitable. Let's leave this out in the field here. We don't need to bring this back. We'll leave it up in the top part. Wool and cotton do, okay. Uh, there's just not enough water in there, I, I guess. You can get it from the river, and I think you might be able to get it from this river here. Like, oh, no. is there enough water in there? I don't think there is either. We'll leave this right here for now. But, uh, yeah, like I said, so the... Oh, man. It's, it's tough to say. So you could go in and buy... Like, what does it cost to buy the bakery here? Visit. Uh, bakery's... I think it's $100,000, right? To buy this place? What's the hit point on that? There it is. It's only 50 grand. Okay, so it's 50 grand for the bakery. And then, instead of getting, what are we getting for flour right now? 
flower, flower, flower. Instead of getting like twelve to thirteen hundred dollars for the flour, we'd go down and make bread. And we'd be getting thirty five hundred. It's the same thing, so it's probably up to four thousand bucks. So that's like three times the price. That's that's a lot. Don't get me wrong, that's a lot. Um uh, do you have to ted the hay? Yes, you have to ted the hay and, and there's no uh it will not dry. So you can get hay right away though. You just have to as soon as you ted it, it turns to hay. So otherwise, what do I have for fields that we can buy instead and expand? Is there anything so 50 grand was for that? Um, say we went over here. What is this? 150 grand if we wanted like a bigger field. 145, 140, 180. Like anything that's half decent size. I think like this one here is not bad. 140 for that one. But that's on the other side there. We can get to that one pretty easily. Um, it's tough to say. I don't know. What do you guys think? Where should we plan to go for our expansion? Buy a field or stay with the fields we got and buy a company or expand that company so that we can move our, our flower. Oh, man. Like, let's see here. What's our flower at? What do we got for flower right now? So we're making, let's see. We're almost full right now. It's almost full. We still have 33,000 liters of barley in there ready to go. Price to close. Okay, price to close. So wool, let's see. Wool prices are 1,100 bucks per thousand. So nothing special for wool. Um, cotton, I don't really want to do cotton because the expensive clothes or the expense on getting uh, a cotton harvesting and stuff going because it's half a million dollars at least. Let's see. Where's the clothes? Clothes. Holy crap. 16,000. That's a grocery mart. So do you have to build the, where do you, where, where's, do you have to build the tailor shop? Let's see. The, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Cause that's not built. That's not in there, right? That's not, you have to build that. Uh, productions, carpentry, dairy, grain mill, spinner, Sp is it spinnery. Is that what that is? Is that making the clothes? Yeah, it's a spinnery, isn't it? Is there anything else? Oh no, so you have to go. You have to go spinnery to the tailor shop. So you have to buy both. So you're at 160 grand. Ouch. That hurts. And then plus you would need something to harvest cotton. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of cash. Yeah, that's a lot of cash, chat. That's a lot of cash. The cheese factory. Cheese factory, 70 grand. You can get, well, milk and sugar uh, brought in here to make any of that. But it's just milk will make cheese, right? I like the bakery. I like the idea of making cakes. Like, the cakes are the hardest one for sure. I thought the oil mill might be a good price. Like, like that's what, 80,000 bucks? Uh, and then... So if you if you were to go the oil mill is already on the map as well, so you could buy the oil mill, and then your prices are pretty good. So you could take your canola, which is selling for twelve hundred bucks, whatever. Um, your soy, sunflowers, seventeen hundred bucks for sunflowers. Holy crap! Uh, and your beans, yeah, sixteen hundred. So actually, that's a really good price. Uh, no, the beans are going up still. Oh, did I forget to sell those? I need aug, uh, July, August. What is it right now? The beans, I should be selling pretty quick here. I don't know. I think the price is still going to go up in the beans. That does that price doesn't look good. I thought that it was we were above 16 before, right? Is this price going to go up anymore? I think this price is going to go up one more. Anyways, uh, oils. Where's the oils? Yeah, here we go. 3,000 bucks, 2,200, and olive oil. Five grand for olive oil. Holy crap. That's a lot of cash. Um, yeah, the oil's not bad, right? Like, it's going to double the value. Unfortunately, like the flour, I feel like I'm getting kind of sewered on my flour prices, where, like, the oil is almost double. $3,000 for sunflower oil. Uh, sunflowers are selling for 1700 bucks, So it's almost double. It's almost double the price if you go and buy the oil mill, where flour, I'm only getting $1,100 right now. And wheat is like 800. Like it's, it's barely, it's barely more. It's, it's just not, it's just not that much. I'm kind of disappointed in the flower right now. The flower looked better when it, I first, last time I looked at it. All right. What kind of oils? Yeah. I'm not surprised you're asking that. Not surprised you're asking that. 
All right, we're going to send Gertie up there. The price will drop next month. Do you think... I, it says that, that the price will drop for sunflower oil or for... Um, not sunflower oil. Um, uh, soybeans next month. But I don't think... I don't know how much it will. I, it might still go up, I think. I don't trust that. I don't trust their market price. I, don't, I think it's bunk. I think they've, they screwed it up. Uh, well, that's why. Let's get this going. Let's go up there. So I actually have more than uh, the stock that they say that's up there, guys. So it says that we're almost full at 29,000 liters, but we've already pulled out a couple, I think. And uh, it's not counting those, so... Oh, this thing. Let's go. We can go up to 26 miles an hour, please. Thank you. Oh, look at the damage done to this tractor, too. This thing's almost in the red. It is in the red. But we're still holding 23 miles an hour. I'm going to have to repair this at some point, I suppose. It's never... Fluff with you, it's never an innocent question. Uh, do I have a thing that can close this? Oh, my twisty thing closes that. I didn't know that. I just learned something new. I just learned something new. That's handy. Okay. My twisty knob um, changes the, uh, the width of that, in case you guys wanted to know. The twisty knob does it. Uh... Is there an olive harvest on it? There can be. If you really want, there can be. Let's go take this to the mill. It's a little 6M. Oh, this poor tractor, though. <laughs> we beat the snot out of this. We got Gertie drive it for the whole night tonight. Uh, and she just did runs up and down this hill the whole time. That's all she was doing. <laughs> No, no. Uh, I want there to can be. I want there to can be. What is Fluff talking about, chat? Do you guys have any ideas? Does anybody venture a guess on what the heck Fluff is talking about? I want there to can be. Don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't know if it matters. Let's see if the beacon's not as bad on this one. There. We got the... Uh, hey, why is the beacon not working? There we go. So this beacon, like I said, on this tractor, it's not as bad. It doesn't flash, flash, flash. It just does this rotation thing. I like how the beacon changes depending on what tractor you're on. Some tractors, it does like a crazy flash like it does. And this one here, it actually does a rotation. It's very kind of cool. All right. In we go. I think he must be. <laughs> Translators. <laughs> oh, this poor tractor. Look at this thing. We have beat the snot out of this tonight. Uh, let's go take a quick look. See out front. There's going to be quite a bit up here. Yeah, we made a mess of this stuff. I wish we could pick these up. I wish I could pick them all up. All right, so we're still running with the barley flour. Yeah, still waiting for that. We're pretty much full. We got a whole bunch of pallets. I almost want... Oh, man. We need an autoload trailer for pallets, too. That's one thing. Uh, that's one mod we need to get. Well, lawn equipment? You want lawn equipment? Yeah, I'm not a rush. I would like to see, like, autoload trailers, to be honest with you. I was wondering about this here. Can we use this for anything? I feel like I should be able to use this. But I don't think it works. Like, I feel like that there should be able to load in bulk flour for me. But there's nothing there. I get nothing. No activations. Uh, what happened to 3K? What happened to 3K? Trucker, what, what, what do you mean? What happened to 3K? What happened to 3K? What do you mean, what happened to 3K? I don't know what you mean, what happened to 3K. Uh, it is more than possible, though. You can do all of all you want on Elm Creek. Yeah. There is a... The Geo does support it. Uh, the big enclosed trailer and mist is for pallets. But it's not auto-load, is it? I don't think it's auto-load. I'm pretty sure it's not auto-load. <laughs> you want the 24... The 2410 back. Uh, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, there's no auto-loads. But I know what you mean. The pallet trailer in there. Um, the problem I have with that trailer... It's fine, but I can't 
load a um a tractor in with it or a forklift with it so i take the flat, i take the flat deck and i will load this tractor or a forklift on the back of it so that i can load the pallets with that but yeah the the big the the big the what is it, the curtain side it doesn't have an auto load option on it unfortunately i like it it looks cool but it needs it needs an auto load or it needs to have uh what do you call it? like the the forklift that's attached to the back of it or something that you can attach to it so that you can actually pick the stuff up otherwise you have to have a permanent tractor or something at the sell point and uh i can't afford that as well right now all right before you had 17k oh um gertie i didn't buy anything the gertie cost me three thousand bucks uh i don't think we bought any anything did we I'm, pr I'm pretty sure trucker we didn't buy anything oh that's right it doesn't fit behind the mac very well either you're right it, it, um, it hits the fairing doesn't it yeah it, like rubs right up against the back of the fairing yeah i don't know i don't know what the best option is still like i still think we need some kind of an auto load option or something that can has an option to load a tractor or uh, a forklift in the back of it so you can keep it with you i don't know i find it a bit frustrating that there's not a that trailer doesn't do that and like i said i always just take a flat deck and uh load the tractor right on the back of the flat deck and so it takes up that space but uh you can take it with you everywhere you go at least then perfect what do we got left in here the beans we got what fifteen thousand liters of beans yeah a little bit of barley not too worried about the barley it's a thousand liters of barley it can stay in there the beans will uh will ship out here in the next 24 hours make some more cash that should get us over like 20 grand ish i would think right it'll get us well it'll be like 30 it'll it should be around actually it's like almost 2,000 bucks so uh we'll be looking at almost another 30,000 so well, 45,000 bucks we'll have yeah we're getting somewhere it's at least it's, it's something's happening at least something's happening All right, group. Oh, that's a lot of echo. You know what? It's Thanksgiving Day tomorrow. We're going to wrap this up now. Get you guys get some, get some sleep. You know what? You guys can just get some rest. But grab some brown waters. Take Put your feet up. You know, you should have tomorrow off. If you don't have tomorrow off, I'm telling you, you can take tomorrow off. You can say, you know what? If your boss asks, Clutch said you can take tomorrow off. Just, just go with that. Um, of course, don't forget, we got new merch. New merch. We got the, the K-Bot sayings. All of them. Uh, make sure you guys check that down in the merch store. Uh, Pin comment has them if you're looking for a new shirt. Other than that, folks, have a great uh, long weekend. We may even try to stream tomorrow night just to, just for funsies. So if you're uh, not watching football and you want to hang out for a bit tomorrow night, maybe we'll see if we can stream. I don't know if it's going to happen, but I'll, we'll see. No promises, okay? Uh, other than that, have some fun with some family tomorrow. Uh, have some turkey for me because I'm not going to get turkey. There's no way I'm getting turkey tomorrow. Anyways, folks, have a great night. Uh, Spanners, thanks for your help again, as always. Uh, last call. Last call! Get it in you, last call. Let's go. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. That was fun. I'm, I'm digging this. I'm digging this, guys. FS22, I'm digging it. Um, I look at the beacon up here. Let me put that on. Can I put that on? I don't have the button anymore. Um, have a great night, folks. Like I said, happy Thanksgiving to my American friends. We'll be back for sure next week, of course, if we're not back tomorrow, tomorrow or next week. The weekend's a write-off for me as well. So uh, have a great Thanksgiving if I don't see you. Thank you guys so much again for all the support. It's always, the, you guys are amazing. Best chat in farm sim, seriously. Uh, I don't care what Kbot tells you. He's a liar. He's a liar. Hey, who's having KFC tomorrow night? That's kind of like turkey, right? I'm not judging. I've done it before. I'm probably going to be doing it at Christmas, to be perfectly honest with you. Yep, probably will be.
And remember, make sure you guys drop a like to hate Kbot, right? You like to to hate. Like like to shock? I think it's like whatever. Just thumbs up. Yeah. Speaking of which, I saw a funny meme from PETA yesterday. It had a picture of a turkey and they were saying, how would you feel if you were being stuffed? PETA, that's not gonna work for me. 